Look, we just started disc two. So if you know, you know, disc two, right? <laughs> uh, disc two. You try to fix most of your stuff. Little plastic wheel can crack over time, causes miscalibration. Weird. Bluetooth trade-offs. Yeah. Your PS4 controller is delayed, but it's still more convenient than pulling out your PS2 to USB converter and PS2 controller. However, you would hate to play Super Metroid on your PS4 controller. Yeah. You missed it? Yep. You did. Yeah, it was Friday night. Pretty late. You were probably in bed, man. It was like five in the morning or six in the morning. My time, which, well, your time too. So yeah, um, we're, we're down a party member. <laughs> If you know, you know. You were dead asleep. Yeah. The VODs are there. They'll be going up on YouTube eventually as well. No, no, no. Do the YT command, someone. We could use more. 2 BUB subs. A minus one to the counter, in a, in a sense, yeah. In essence. <laughs> You're glad you weren't here for it, self-harmonized. Too, too impactful? We'll put it that way, right? Too impactful, right? Mm, how's the death scene? Um, We had someone here complaining about the music. And I just kept my mouth shut until it kicked in. Because... They were being aggressive. Um, what they didn't know is that the music in this these mods are designed to cue to the voice acting itself. So it started out kind of somber, and then when like certain lines were spoken and kicked in, <clears throat> it was pretty cool. Was it any different? Well, I mean, obviously, it's all voice acted, right? Otherwise, I'm not sure what you mean. The music in that scene was top tier. Yeah. Yeah, the music was good. Like, it, the, the way it started out somber, it almost sounded like part of the song was missing, but I realized what was happening in the moment. Um, and then the music kicked in. It was pretty cool. Hey, Nerd Code, how you doing? I just uh, added you to the, the exclusive channel for Patreon. I had forgotten to do that last week. Sorry about that. Your number one favorite retro game soundtrack is something Secret of Mana Medley. What retro game is that in? Or are you talking about a not game soundtrack, but like a performance of it? Because that is a different question. A real slice of life moment. That's yeah. Are ads about to start already? Yeah, they are. Shit. Okay. We talked a lot. I love it. I love it. This might be a good chance for me to get tea. Something for this mouth, you know? This like infinite dryness that I have. You could probably hear it. I can hear it. If I can hear how dry my mouth is, I mean hear. Sit your ass in the chair and drink your goddamn tea. That's when you know it's bad. Do 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 do. You just watch it on YouTube, right on. What about the voice acting? Really impressive performance by Cloud. Um, well, all of them. Like you could hear Tifa's voice breaking up. It was, it was really good. It was really good. Yeah, what's up, Option? How are you? It's a performance of the Secret of Mana soundtrack. Okay. I mean, that still sounds really cool, Nerd Code. It wasn't exactly what I was aiming for, but I'm not being like, Wow, you did it wrong. How dare you? Wow. 
That's cool, man. Hold on, I'm gonna move my windows here. What do you think? Should we get a quick drink break? Drink break? So I can get some tea? Hey, Paul, how you doing, man? Yeah, when you can hear how dry it is, I can hear it. I can, I can hear it. How do you fix that? I don't even know. You like how catchy sounds? Yeah. He's got that like kind of Irish bro going on there a little bit, a little bit. Hold on. Let me, let me take care of this. If I don't do it now, I'm going to forget like all night. I'm going to heat up tea and use the restroom. So let's get some snacks real quick. And if you haven't answered yet, let us know what your favorite uh, retro game soundtrack is. Huge ball fuck. That's a penis. All right, folks, thank you for waiting for me tonight. Thank you for waiting through these <clears throat> health issues, I suppose, in a sense, these side effects, you know what I'm saying? What's up, Sky? How you doing, man? Tea's heating up. Don't let me forget. It'll be done in like three minutes. Be like three minutes. You used to have a golden ditto. Yeah, we had like five dittos at one point. This PT. Mm -hmm. Get that from the gas station. Dude, Sky, were you around years ago when some dude kept calling me that? It was fucking creepy. <laughs> that was a weird time. You think you were? T heating up? Yeah, nerd code. Bam. Sounds uncomfortable. Oh, it was. Do you remember chat messages? Yeah. <laughs> I finally had to ask him openly in Discord general chat to stop doing it. Because it was making me really uncomfortable. And he did and never spoke again. 
I'm probably left. <laughs> All right. Cool. Damn. Get it, Tifa. You see that damage? Oh, listen to that ambient audio. Oh, it's gone. Sorry. Faraga. Where's the town? Did I go past it? Oh, right. You have to kind of hook around. Forgot about that. There it is. It's up there. Back attacks. Yeah. Well, she has basically almost no magic. I don't use it on her. Here are some questions I have that I'm going to need answers to. Um, when is the earliest I can get a cursed ring? And when do you get Hades? I will need both. She has time. All. Steel, long range, death blow, HP plus, luck plus. This is a big one. Cover and counterattack. We're going to fill her up with counterattack materia. As many as we can get. No, Sky, relax, buddy. You're fine. It just reminded me of that dude. <coughs> Hades is not for a while. Okay. What status effects? Does the curse ring give you? Ba -ba -da. <clears throat> uh, no, Keto, I'm not going to do that for a follow message. That's the opposite of the vibe I have around here. <laughs> I do want to use that for a sound effect. And if people start using it for that, then I will just delete it. <clears throat> Curse ring is sometime after this. Okay. Hades of Farewell. Okay. Yeah, all that Curse ring does is death sentence. Is that it? That's not bad. That's not bad. Yes, I want to use that Kino, just not for what you said. It's our first time hearing this song, isn't it? Tea time. You're right. Oh, God. Thank you. <clears throat> Grabbing my tea. Thank you. right now. I've got big tits. Nice computer you got here. How's the music? Is it good here? Dr. Wowie. Dr. Wow, I love how when I step away, it's just like, let's spam sound effects. Cause you can still have fun. Even when I'm not sitting right here. It's kind of cool. 
Yeah, yeah, go ahead, Paul. Is there a materia? With added effect I can combine? Other than, well, I thought Hades might work with that. I need you to go out and buy eggs for more. Yes, that sentence does stay away if they re revive. It's my understanding too, nerd code. You have a special affinity for ice, snow, area music from RPGs. I like it too, yeah. You will give me an egg. Hey, Dad, wake up. We have customers. Odin. <clears throat> no kidding. Odin, huh? Yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of that either, Darkens. That's why I always tell Chad, hey, if there's like missables, side quests, secrets, info, whatever. Y'all can tell me that stuff. That's fine. Just don't backseat or spoil, right? <coughs> Welcome. Organics. <clears throat> uh oh. Look at these upgrades, chat. Wise from your glaive. I guess I could wise from my glaive. Dragon Claw. Anime Clip is weaker, but. We might want that. Yeah, it's gonna give him two more slots. We're gonna we're gonna make the switch. Uh. There's gonna be a point where I cannot use Tifa or Cloud, but I think when that happens, I'll be able to go buy more equipment, right? Without being forced into things. I think that's my understanding. Hello, Gold Rat. Did I say hi to you yet? <laughs> Good to see you. Shop music. Wrong channel. <laughs> do, do. Destruct works too? Okay. Am I getting close to a summon? That's a good question. Think so, yes. After the snowboarding, right? Love it, Dubmeister. What's that piano emote from? <clears throat> oh, 7TV. Okay. Uh, Odin is death on attack and protection. And death protection does prevent... Oh, you know what? I remember. You're right. If you have prevention... If you have death protection, death sentence still... You still have death sentence. When it runs out, nothing happens. Right? That's what I remember now. <clears throat> Hissy Senior, Missy, and Hissy Junior say hello. Cats? I'm assuming cats. Got it, Gold Rat. Okay, good. This is good planning. You can travel and get stuff for when you take a break from just class. Okay, cool. Then I'm not going to be too concerned about buying stuff for anyone else right now. All right, Murasame, you served us well. Swapping over to the organics. We've gotten a sizable list of equipment now. Mm -hmm. Wizard bracelet. When did we get that? Oh, right. It has six defense. <laughs> yeah, you have literally no defense if you use that. But massive magic defense. Then we have these, which are cool. They do absorb, but limited on slots. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I gave her this rune armlet because it has double growth on these extremely important materia. So, situationally useful. Yeah, I would agree with that for sure. Gonna keep her with this uh, power wrist for now. And you are gonna use the adamant clip now. All right, cool. All right. With that, we should be able to, at the least, level up some more materia. 
So she has. We could give her a chocobo lure just for the plus one luck. <laughs> just for the luck. An extra enemy skill. Did wizard give you double? No, I don't think so. No, it's normal growth. The only thing I have that's double is her rune armlet. <clears throat> Other than some weapons, of course. We've gotten quite a lot of weapons that have that. Um, all right. Trying to think. What I can give her. She's going to need added effect. But mastering it is whatever, right? It just gives you another added effect. It doesn't do anything. Wizard Bracelet was dropped by the last boss I fought. Oh, okay. The one at the bottom, right? With the crystal staircase. Curse Ring Steel is hard steel. is not guaranteed. Am I able to save right before it? All right. These are two unlinked slots. So what we can do here is put the two summons there. Leviathan and Kajana. Um, hmm. All, all, all. Okay. Maybe we can give him added effect since he could actually use it. Let's do that. <clears throat> there you go. That's actually really good. Destruct added effect. Insta kill proc, right? And then. You do barrier. That's useful. It doesn't work with any of these, but I can give him enemy skill and start working on well, working on that, right? <clears throat> Oh my god, I hate when she does that, Dubmeister. She just ruins it. <laughs> I could give right a third summon, too. You can't hear Leviathan without hearing the 14 song in your head. Oh, I have no idea what it is. I just know 14 has amazing music. You know what's funny? I remember what the composer did, but not his name. Supposedly he was like fighting cancer in secret and still composing from his hospital bed. What a legend. Soak in, that's it. Like, it's not something I would ever condone anyone doing, but also I personally understand that kind of drive. I know what I can do. Kajada has no element. Leviathan does. I mean, we could do water element, right? I don't know if that's really good, though. Now that I think about it. Um, I'm trying to figure out, like, what would be good with element here? Anything? Anything? Uh, you know, you know, you know. But do you know? Do you know? Nanaki looks all grouchy. I guess these portraits are potentially from that Urgi's uh, concept art. Urgi's. Masayoshi Soken. Okay. There you go. Did not know the gentleman's name. Uh, magic plus take off, put HP absorb with something. What's this revive? Revive has no element. What happens if you protect against non-elemental in this? It does something, right? <clears throat> Whether it's intended or not, it does do something. I just don't remember what it does. I do think we should level barrier. 
Did we stop leveling Blizzard entirely? We did. Maybe we should try to get Blizzaga. I'm not really using Elemental. I'm not a big fan of it. Other than for defense. Yeah, it's dedication. Do I have any elements I want to defend against? Not really. Switch all to his clip. Like these all have all on them. I think this is fine. Like what I'm doing here. I think what I have here is fine. I just don't want to like overdo it. But this looks good. This looks good. I never played her guys. I'd like to. Supposedly it has that random procedurally generated dungeon crawling mode in it, which is the thing that I would want to play it for and not the fighting. <laughs> I think that's funny that that even exists. My boy hurt himself right after we moved here. I never should have bought him that accursed snowboard. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Poor kid. Poor kid. There's a kitty. <laughs> Can I steal your snowboard? No, he's just gonna cry. Okay. Okay. He's gonna shoot his eye out with that snowboard. People game? Yeah. Turning the fan on from under the desk. You're typing that? The uh, the reference, nice. You remember Urgain's being way too strange to get into, despite loving Seven. I never played it. Maybe someday. I think it's like hard to get. Look at the map. Oh right, we need to get added cut. We need to get added cut. My grandfather was a climber. Same. They Not say really. he saw every corner of the Great Glacier. Oh, that's hitting the spot. I got to tell you. Hero drink vaccine. What? Protects against transformations. Okay. No, I don't think that's funny. I'm 41 option. All right. I'm going to drop references that are like 30 plus years old. <laughs> and that one's like 60 years old or something like that. Yeah, maybe Ryo. Also, hello. Hello, by the way. They thought it wouldn't sell and added Final Fantasy 7 characters in it. I mean, they might have been right. It might have been on to something. Honestly, they should have just like focused on the dungeon crawling aspect. I bet it would have been a lot better. My husband left 20 years ago and never came back. He was heading for the foot of the Gaia cliff. It's marked on the map. My husband, he was. Can you just steal their map? I thought they said like, oh, you can just take that. It's nearly impossible to reach the north safely without a map. Take that one on the wall there inside if you're planning on heading that way. You got it. There it is. That's what I was looking for. Take Oops, I forgot that voice those. Cool. We got a free map. Hero drank. You remember you used our W item glitch for it? Oh, to duplicate it. What does it do? 
That's an old reference. Oh, who's on first? Yeah. They say there's a deadly slope beyond here and they won't let me near it. Why are you not wearing shirts? They say there's a dead. It's freezing. Just my luck. We came all the way here for nothing. What a load of crap. <laughs> Finally, just about finished setting up your room that will likely be where you are in for the next four months. Looks great, and you can see the San Francisco Bay and sunset from your large window. That's awesome. That's really cool. Oh, we came all the way from Costa del Sol for some snowboarding. Now it looks like we'll have to head back. We charge 200 gil a night. Would you like to stay? No. no. Well, maybe some other time. Some other time, yeah. Miha. That accent. Can I talk to that guy back there? Probably not. I don't think you can get back there. No. Okay. That was a Niha, wasn't like it? Zoinks! What is it? Don't come too close or you'll get burned. <laughs> oh, oh my God! Why did they make him fucking shaggy? All right, that I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. Ugh. What in the world? I've heard there's a snow woman at the Great Glacier who hates hot springs. That's true. But I think it's just a myth to scare off travelers, though. It's not a myth. No, sorry. I've heard there's what? a... But I think... I was trying to steal from him. Hi there. Oh, you look real strong. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Would you like to talk? I'm, yeah, okay. Okay. You are very attractive! Apparently, yeah. That guy over there was such a bore. Oh boy. We're thirsty right now. That guy over there. Oh, do you have to sit down or I've something? I've got thinking of going north. Look, that's the plan. Spot In that case, you are going to need a map. I have a map. There might be one left at Holzhoff's house. He was Who hates hot springs? A ice switch. <laughs> An ice switch. That guy over there. That guy over what did I I thought we were talking oh you in that okay I guess you can't talk to her no she's talking about this guy cheese for no one was that boring her you kind of were I guess yeah dude that guy over yeah see she doesn't say anything all right he must have died a dog's death no matter how well equipped you are you can't hold out there even two days I think she just needed to get away from that guy I get it. Heard some guy went up to the Great Glacier up north. Oh, I see Paul. What an idiot. Apart from the local hot spring, yeah, nerd. the place is a frozen death trap. Ever heard of the Cetra? Yep. The Cetra? Oh, yes. They were the ancients. Well, the last surviving Cetra lived right here in our village, you know. Her name was Ifalna. She knew a lot of things. We know that name. Hmm. I wonder what happened to her. I heard Shinra took her somewhere. Mm. Shinra and the ancients? I smell something fishy. <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> He's opening toilet doors, a sick hobby of yours, or something! <laughs> yeah, kinda. <sighs> yeah, kinda. He's opening. <laughs> what are you looking at? The guy's voice was awesome. I loved it. It was great. That guy. He was such a bore. Ah! I'm here to deliver a pizza. Oh my God. Oh, random X potion. Cool. Uh, it appears to be it, but that was a nice find. Do you have a copy of Ein? No. What is that? <clears throat> is that PS2? I don't have Urgeis or Ein. Einhander, Hander. I think that's German. I don't know how to say it. Sorry. <laughs> like, I, don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. 
He has one. Oh, we get to hear this voice acted. I forgot about this. We get to hear this voice acted. Isn't there a secret item in here somewhere? How do you get down there? There we go. Turbo ether. Maybe not so secret, but honestly, a lot of people didn't even know you could go down here. You can actually like do this for some reason. I don't know why. Do, do. Is this Medeal? No, it's the snow town. I can't remember the name of it though. The crisis of the planet. I like that you can open that. Like skylight. The crisis of the planet. <clears throat> Here we go. Let's hear this. Icicle in. There you go. Holy crap, SOG. Look at that. Look at that, man. Look at that. Camera's ready. Camera's ready. Then, Ivana, please tell me about the Setra. Interesting how the audio is recording. Recorded. Deliberately so. 2,000 years ago, our ancestors, the Setra, heard the cries of the planet. <laughs> At some point, if we run out of VIP slots, I'm going to have to take some off so that we can permit people to post links. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Mystique? How are you? The first ones to discover the planet's wound were the Cetra and the Gnolls Pole. The Gnolls Pole. Tell us, Ifalna, where is the land called Gnolls Pole? Gnolls Pole refers to this area. The Cetra then began a planet reading. Ifalna, what exactly does planet reading entail? Good question. I can't explain it very well, but... It's like having a conversation with the planet. It said something fell from the sky, making a large wound. No option. If, if I ever actually came down to that, I would just probably take it from people who aren't around anymore, you know? Because that just happens, you know? Life, life circumstances change. People get bored, you know, of Twitch or whatever. You know, people come and go. Thousands of Cetra pulled together. Trying to heal the planet. <clears throat> but due to the severity of the wound, it was only able to heal itself over many years. Hmm. Do the ancients, rather the Cetra, have special powers to heal the planet? No, it's not that kind of power. The life force of all living things on this planet becomes the energy. The Cetra tried desperately to cultivate the land. So as not to diminish the needed energy. So growing things. Life existing itself gives the planet energy. What's Shinra doing with it? <laughs> hmm. Even here, so close to the North Cave, the snow never melts. Is that because the planet's energy has gathered here to heal the injury? Yes. The energy that was needed to heal the planet withered away the land. Then the planet... The planet tried to persuade the Cetra to leave the Knoll's Pole, but... Knoll's Pole. Ifala, let's take a break. I'm all right. Huh. <clears throat> when the Cetra... We're preparing to part with the land they loved. That's when it appeared. It looked like our, our dead mothers and our dead brothers. That's freaky. Showing us specters of their past. Who is this person that appeared in the North Cave? I haven't any idea. Shinru would never go against their creed. <laughs> When the one who injured the planet, or the calamity from the sky, as we call him, came. 
He first approached his friends, deceived them, and finally... What's up, EMP? Gave them the virus. Virus? The Setra were attacked by the virus and went mad, transforming into monsters. It makes you think, what What if most of the monsters we fought were transformed Setra? Then, just as he had at the Nose Pole, he approached other Setra clans, infecting them with the virus. Adds an ambience to the recording. Yeah. You don't look well. Let's call it a day. I wonder who... I don't know if it ever says... But I, I always wondered... Or, I don't know if I did. Like, they're talking about... A person, a he, a calamity from the sky doing this and infecting everyone. Like, what are the weapons? Who is that? Right? Yeah, option. All right, here, we're going to learn about weapons now, which a lot of people really Kala, like. Can you comment on the thing called weapon? Yes, Professor. Do, do, do. The one the professor mistook for a cetera was named Genova. That is the calamity from the sky. Genova's a he? Okay, that's confusing. The planet knew it had to destroy the calamity from the sky. Why do people ask me if I was going to fight the weapons? You see, as long as Genova exists, the planet will never be able to fully heal itself. So... The weapons were born of the planet's own will in order to defend against the threat? The weapons are like the planet's immune system. Yes, but there is no record of weapon ever being used. A small number of the surviving Cetra defeated Genova and confined it. The planet produced weapon, but it was no longer necessary to use it. So, Weapon no longer exists on this planet? Weapon cannot vanish. It remains asleep somewhere on the planet. That's fine. Totally Even cool. Even though Genova is confined, it could come back to life at some time. You know what I remember from way back? I, I think this was true, but I think the... US PS1 version of this introduced Emerald and Ruby weapon. I don't think they were in the Japanese version, but I'm not sure. I'm not actually sure. Yo, Ifrit. Yo, thanks, dude. Six months. Hell yeah. The planet has not fully healed itself yet. That's right. I'm still watching Genova. That's wild. So did they ever get the version with them? Like a re-release? It was the other three. Well, you only fight two others. Like there are three others, but you only fight two of them, right? One of them gets, well, we'll see, <laughs> right? I don't want to spoil it for anyone who hasn't seen. Yeah. Final Fantasy VII International, they got a re-release, okay. hear the voice of the planet well times have changed hmm. the planet is probably watching this situation closely interesting thank you Felda. that will be all for today two down i think there's four three or four entries I always found these really fascinating. Like, this is total lore dumb, but... If the lore is interesting enough, I can deal with the exposition, right? So... Private. Okay, let's do this one. Oh, there's two more. Okay. My, my daughter, 10 days old. Two more. 
What are you doing, Perfect? I mean, honey. Oh. Oh, I, I'm thinking of taping it on video. But the video is not working right. What are you going to tape? Is there still something I haven't mentioned? No, that's not it. I'm going to record our beautiful daughter. Uh oh. When she's sleeping, she looks like a little angel. First, we have to figure out her name. We can take the video later. I've already decided. If it's a girl, then it'll be Eris. That's that. You are so selfish. <laughs> but Eris is a good name. It is a good name, right? <laughs> it's a good name. Considering it came out of that forgetful head of yours. Professor Gast, ADHD confirmed. Right? <laughs> oh, the videotape. <laughs> One more. My daughter, 20 days old. No more. Video again? You just got through taping. Never say that. I will protect you and Aerith no matter what. Yeah? You're not going to work tonight because your boss is an asshead hole. That's... That is a combination of of nouns right there. <laughs> you and Aerith are my right. only treasures. I'll never let you go. Yeah, what up, Bap? Don't you want to capture her fleeting childhood? If you keep doting on her like that, she won't grow up to be strong. It's true. Aerith is different from the other children. I wonder what dangers await her. Oh, that line hits especially hard right now. Holy smokes. You mustn't say that. I will protect you and Aerith from anything. What's up, Arslan? Oh, is this your first time seeing these? Oh, yeah, we haven't done this yet. So this is a fully modded version of the PC version. Um... So the most notable one that you and many others notice first is the voice acting. Every single character in the game is voice acted. Every sign, every tutorial, all that stuff. Um, and then, yeah, if you want to see the list of mods that I'm using, do the mods command. And it'll show you the list that I have and the load order if you want to do it the same way. But this will work on any any PC version um, of Final Fantasy 7, including the original 1998 IDOS published version. So, if you have any of the PC versions of 7, and not 7 Remake, right? 7. Um, then you can mod it too. Oh, you're going to make your own game? Cool. What kind of game are you going to make? You're my beloved treasure. Thanks, folks, for doing those I'll commands. I'll let you go, no matter what happens. I feel so much better now, darling. If I hadn't met you, I... Aww. Now, who in the world could that be disturbing us like this? What up, Bradish? How you doing, man? Bap, you just ordered parts to fix your gaming PC. Oh, good. I remember you talking about that recently. Recently. Did I already pass that part? Yes. Yes, that was the last thing we did Friday night. So we just picked off from there. Picked up from there, I should say. Du, 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 du. What the? Damn. These voices. How dare they intrude on our private time together? Yo, Emery, thank you for 25 months. He could just not answer the door. Right, yeah. Da, da, da. A lot of ways to make your own game. Generally speaking, the best way to do it is to start. Don't wait for funding. Don't launch Kickstarters. Don't do any of that shit. Just start. You know, just start working on something. Learn as you go. Old fashioned RPG style, but it's two gameplay styles that will work in harmony. Okay. What are they? Do, 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 do. Lots of ways to make your own games. Worth doing, lots of fun to learn. Yeah, definitely. 
Do do do. <laughs> I'll send them away. It's them. Uh oh. <laughs> I've been searching for you, Ifalna. Or should I say, mm -hmm. Cetra? Oh, good. Hello, Professor Gast. A long time no see. Tactical like Fire Emblem with Final Fantasy X gameplay. Do you mean Final Fantasy X combat? I don't think I've seen that combination before. Oh, good. Two years I've waited. That's a testament to how much I desire this new specimen. <laughs> Mark Hamill's Joker vibes? Kitty, what did you just do? You alright? Did you miss? Did you miss step? Oh, everything looks fine. You alright, little lady? How you doing, little lady? You stinky. You just went to the bathroom, didn't you? She always has to come over after using the bathroom. It's like, thank you for letting me smell that. Good. New sample? You don't mean Aerith. Oh, Aerith. What a lovely name. <laughs> Too bad. That's it. I'm severing all ties with the Shinra. Hojo, please leave. Ifana! Oh, you have the Shoko book for the road. He was just me, going right? for a work. Good timing, Delph. How you doing? Thanks for 30 months. <laughs> <sighs> oh, my goodness. Dude, how's it going, man? How's it going? Hold on. I'll be needing all of you for my experiments. Yikes. Professor Gast, you understand, of course. I change the world. Don't worry, Fauna. I'll take care of this. Please come quietly. I don't wish any harm to come to my precious specimen. God, Hojo, you suck. Da, da, da. Hmm. What a funny looking camera. You, destroy it. Uh-oh. Careful now. Still recording audio. <laughs> okay, dude from Matrix. I hear that at least once a week. No. The weapons. Gassed recordings are how Hojo learned about all this. That's not good. That's not good. Going all right, winding down after a long week. Ah. <laughs> a treasure trove. Why, thank you, Professor. <laughs> you know what Gas should have done? Should have used the password. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. That's it, right? What private? Yeah, okay. Alright. Dude didn't have a password. Full disk encryption, right? Like, come on, man. Rookie mistake. He was so hell bent on getting knowledge. He didn't do his homework. That looks like something I can grab, but maybe I can't. No. Doesn't it look like I should be able to get that bottle? You can't get it, can you? Also, hello, Rio Isk. Welcome back. I think you were watching this last week, yeah, or maybe a couple weeks ago. Second time tonight. What? Okay, I can't get that. If that is an item, it's just 
locked there. <laughs> it just, it lives there, okay? Fascinating lore discovery that we just had. Do do. Hello, sir. How are you? No, don't. It gets really steep past here. All right, Arslan. It's been a minute, really? Do 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 do. Good luck with your game. Do 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 do. Two weeks? Oh, okay. I've been streaming seven and a half years. When people say it's been a minute, it means I haven't seen them in years. <laughs> Sorry, I got a little thrown there. Perspectives and all. Wasn't seeing it that way. Yeah, I think so, Darkens. That's probably what it is. It's too dangerous. Yeah. Don't mention it. Anyone else would have done the same. Yeah, I need the, the I'm snowboard. I'm not too busy at the moment. Want me to teach you how to ride a snowboard? No. No thanks. I, I know how. How boring. <laughs> the nerve on this guy. Jeez. Can you believe that? That was rude. I steal this kid's snowboard now. My boy heard him. I never. Okay. She says the same thing. He's still crying. Cat still meows. Okay. Can't take the snowboard. I don't remember what the story trigger is. Let's go save since we just did a bunch of stuff. Saving dog game. Wow, 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 wow. All right. I guess we just go without the snowboard. No, it's. Hey, I was only trying to be helpful. There's no need to. Who are they? Looks like trouble. Oh, I have to try to go this way. There's the story hook. Chat. There it is. Oh boy, Turks. There they are. Hurry. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I thought I could run. Guess Good. not. <sighs> That's as far as you go. <laughs> as far as you go. She's winded. What's up ahead? It's classified. Anyway, never mind that. Oh, she didn't Let's actually talk about what you did to my boss. Should actually spill the beans. Your boss. You mean Sung? That wasn't us. It was Sephiroth. Yep, that's right. Think I'm stupid? Yes. I'm telling the truth. It was Sephiroth. Do, 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 do. Wow, that is weird. Why did it say Arslan caught that Pokemon when they didn't do a catch command? <laughs> oh, because you're the one that summoned it. That's why. That's why. Yeah. When you do Poke Lure, you automatically enter to catch it. You might as well drop the act. It's not like you're going anywhere. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Looks like words aren't going to cut it. I'll just have to try something you can understand. We'll deal with this jerk, ma'am. You thought I was cracked? No, 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 no. No, I can handle him. There's no way he'll dodge I did my too, punch. But yeah. Huh? As you wish. Yeah, what up, local host? How we doing? How we doing? You get first throw. Oh, yeah, that is first throw, isn't it? Dodge the punch. Ma'am? <laughs> 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 
Well. <sighs> what was that all about? They were kind of weak for Shinra. You said it, man. <laughs> Sorry I ran off, but I could smell trouble. Anyhow, to make it down the slope, you'll need a snowboard. I can teach you how to ride one. No, not interested. I just don't understand you. Well, don't play me when you get hurt. It's respond. Oh, because it says dog. Yeah. It's kind of weird that it does that. Here we go. <laughs> I got woof, woof. hurt on my snowboard, and now I can't play outside. <laughs> okay. Hey, no much. I'll let What's you up have with it, your okay? dog? Okay. Then the kitty moves. You can get the snowboard. And now we can go get hurt. Isn't that great? Target. Maybe you can teach me too. Target. Whatever that is. What was that from? Somebody wanted that as a sound effect. I don't remember what it was from. Somebody's doing something outside. Or a skunk. But it's probably somebody doing something outside. You know what I mean? <laughs> I wonder what happens if you let Elena punch you. You know? Sorry I ran off, but anyhow. Not I just Dude, let me go. Be careful. There we go. You ready? She punches you, you wake up in Gat's old house. That's funny. <clears throat> I'm assuming you don't get anything for it, right? Here we go. I just thought it was weird that this mini game did not have music. Ah! It has balloons. And the balloons, if you collect enough of them, do absolutely nothing. <laughs> I'm not sure why they're there. But they are. But there's balloons and they exist for some reason. There's Moogle snowmen. Oh, I made to do that. Oh, I hit the wall. I thought there was a way to speed up. I guess not. You just go. Our ad's gonna start soon. Oh, in like a minute and a half. Okay. I thought you could hold the jump down button down. I guess not. There you go. I got a blue balloon. Isn't that great? It didn't do anything. Whoa! <laughs> that was cool. Yeah, the balloons don't do anything as far as I know. Well done. Thank you. I know. Oh, well, that didn't work. Oh, right on top of the Moogle. <laughs> flying in the sky. That's true, we are flying in the sky. Yep. Oh, oh, we didn't wipe out. We got lucky. Imagine going that fast down a slope. Dude's going like 70 miles an hour right now. What? Oh, okay, that worked. For some reason. That's it, I'm calling the clock. I know, it's. Oh, you can pause. Yes, dude. Sorry. The, um, 8 has my favorite Final Fantasy soundtrack. Job's done. <laughs> of all of the Final Fantasy soundtracks, that one is my favorite. Oh, shit. There we go. Ah! Oh, that wasn't cool. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I 
<laughs> I didn't see that one coming. Cloud. Cloud, you gotta slow down, buddy. You're going too fast. You're going too fast. Well, okay. I think the path you take actually determines where you end up in the freaking mountain. This was Bonk. the worst freaking way to go. Look at this. Here we go. All right, we need an added cut. Uh, yes. Option, you can play it in Gold Saucer. Do, do, do. Well, we're still in one piece. I see, Delph. Cloud yeeted himself. He did, yeah. Everyone all right? Yeah. Just about. <laughs> I've got snow in my ears. Oh, that sucks. So Beep me up. where did we land? It didn't feel like we jumped far at all. We've hmm. got a map, right? Well, let's have a look at it. Let's have a look at it. It's way too cold. It didn't let me. We'll freeze to death if we stick around here much longer. There we go. All right, here's the map. There is no indicator as to where we actually are on the map. <laughs> You kind of got to guess, but I think I'm somewhere in the bottom. Somewhere in the bottom. That's 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 what I got. There are a lot of treasures here. We're probably going to be making multiple trips. I don't remember what they all are or where they all are, but there are two main ones I want a summon and a an added cut. <clears throat> have to get those okay these aren't bad look at that sword he's got that looks dope looks pretty cool nice death blow their chance to freeze yeah after a certain amount of time you freeze and you wake up in like some cabin or something I can't look at the map. Well, that's great. Okay. Treasures. Keep your eyes peeled. They're hard to see. Um. I'm at some kind of four way. The missable summon. How is it missable? That was easy. Do, do, do. Your eyes have been freshly peeled. Thank you. It's important to keep them healthy, you know? So, good job. Potion! Good! The best place to land is near the entrance. It helps navigating using the map. It still sucks. I think I did land near the entrance, but I'm not 100% on that. We did just find a four way, so I think I'm near that cave in the middle. Hi, Belvin. It's missable, but not permissible. Let's. I, this should take me to that cave in the middle, I think. Let's see. Hello? Why didn't it zone? <laughs> the hell? All right. Uh. I'll take it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Dolphin blow. <gasps> Got him. What up, Fendler? By the way, poison level up. That's Bioga. Bioga. Where's the zone? There. I just had to let go all the way in the corner. All right. This is a puzzle. Oh, I forgot how to do this. This is like a light puzzle. Looks like we'll have to cross here. Okay. We can go up or right. Can't be helped. 
I can't pause. Oh, shit. I am confused. Ice game. Yeah. Would suck to fall in the water. Yeah, you'd probably die. Uh oh. That's not Now good. bear my Arctic blast. <laughs> okay, I will bear it. Up. Cloud. Work with me, Cloud, okay? This is not good. Oh, fuck. <laughs> that would have been bad. Um, this way, this way, this way. Oh man, we're in trouble chat. Is this it? I think this is it. Got it. Cool. Safety bit. What a safety bit. Falling in water speeds up walking in the cabin. Wait, what? What does that mean? Safety bit. Protects against sudden death, petrify, and slow numb. That's cool. Do, 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 do. I think... I think we're good though. Is there anything else in here? What's that audio? Oh shit. Oh, there's the ice lady. I wonder if you can steal from her. Let's try. Cold breath. I've got big tits. How do you get the summon? I don't remember. Couldn't steal. Let's see if we can turn her into a frog. That'd be we'll funny. Look at you. Or it's sleep. Oh, well, that didn't work. You find the person in a coat. Oh, oh, jeez. Okay, she just tried to steal from Red. <laughs> let's just, let's take care of business. Oh, Tifa. Ow, Jesus. Is he dead? Oh no, okay. I'm gonna use beta. I'm scared. Don't get cocky. Wow! <laughs> Woo. That was a couple, maybe three damage. You need to dip your hands in the hot spring to go to the top right of the map. Oh, right. That's right. Added <laughs> cut is the one that's like... I've never been able to find it without a guide. Alright, I guess that was all that was in here was a safety bit, so... Cool, cool accessory. All right, let's go. Added cut as a kid was the one materia I could never get. The only one. It would be nice. To freaking get it. I got it once, like in college. Like I went back. Found it by accident. That's really lucky. There's like a specific path you have to walk just to get it to spawn. Looks like we'll have to cross here. You have to do the puzzle again just to go back. Okay. Weird. But okay. Boom, boom, boom. All right, so we're right there in that middle crossroads. Where's the hot springs? I don't know. I wonder if I know where Attic Cut is. Yep. This is about how it goes all the time when I'm here. <laughs> 
it's above the tree. Okay. Two pond spot. Okay. So I think it's this way. I don't see any blue materia. Now we're at the tree. It should be a three way. Oh, that sounds great, Belvin. Edit cut somewhere right on the map. I mean, that sounds right. It sounds right, Paul. Ba -da -da -da. Kitty bed. What up? What up? Kitty beady. Kitty beady. Added cut specifically on a diagonal screen, top left to bottom right. Yeah, that sounds right. Let's see if this is one of those. No. This is a straight path. So it can't be here, right? Yeah, no, it's not. All right. Bottom is the eight has a voice mod? Yes. So does nine. Those aren't done yet, though. <clears throat> It's in a room like this, added cut. But it's blended in so well with the background that I probably walk past it all the time. Do you stream today, Roy? Andor Sasha? Da 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 da. Top left to bottom right. Yeah, same Paul. I want to get, I don't remember what treasures are here other than I think Alexander and added cut. At the least I want those, but if there is more than that, I want to know if anyone does, of course. Jeez. Three rooms like this. Is this remastered music? It's fully modded. Everything is modded. Yeah. Sure is. Every character, tutorial sign, NPC voice acted, 60 FPS, full analog movement, uh, upscaled backgrounds, HD models, lighting engine, ambient audio, new sound effects, remastered soundtrack, Basically, all the mods I'm using. <clears throat> Do -do. I had a weed already. Well, you got a missing note at one point, so you probably had to re get it. So, yeah, if you want to see what I have, do the mods command. The mods command. I think this is the way to the hot spring. Maybe? Well, this doesn't look right. Now I'm confused. We'll find out. Beta! Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. There's an all materia here. Oh, no, I didn't get that. Where are you? Added cut. You're hiding from me. We're probably going to pass out soon. So I think I went the wrong way to get to the hot spring. Oh, there it is. Never mind. I did not go the wrong way. It's not frozen here. Touch it. I think this gives oh, you more time. It's a hot spring. Okay, so we're at the hot spring. We need to go to the cave, right? I think we need to go to the cave. Yeah, a lot of new clouds, Kitty Bit. Bad day and chain of events. So it wasn't up to streaming today. Oh, okay. It's already here. Yeah, the FPS, I think, is my favorite part. 
Go toward the check mark. Why? It'll be a mini map where you put stakes down. And you need to go east. I'm not trying to leave. I'm trying to get the treasure. Oh, you have to do that for Alexander? Okay. Sorry. I thought you were telling me to leave. <laughs> like, wait a minute. Warm us up. Okay, we warmed up. Where's that in cut? It's hiding. Okay, now where the hell am I? Just a transition room. Okay. Oh, okay. Snow. As far as you can see. Better watch where I walk. Uh. I'll place a landmark and start walking. Yo, Deramis, thank you for more than six months. Because you made a new account for some reason. <laughs> thank you. No idea how much it is. All right, I have to just go east. I forgot about this. It's like this way. Okay. Okay, I went east. Where am I? I'm in a random encounter. It's about a few, you know, a few, a couple, maybe three. No longer a lurky Lou. Welcome back. New account to assert lordship. <laughs> uh. Oh, could you, Belvin? I couldn't. I, I didn't notice that. Okay. Where is this taking us? I love the sound of the crunchy snow. All right. Where the hell am I? I have no idea. No. Oh, do, do. We got to follow. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. Enjoy your lurk or join us in chat. Whatever you like to do. Um, I like to summon. Test your might. Hello, Against roasted donut. Summon. Hello, hog. Link to the pastel favorite retro soundtrack. East two is pretty good. We're gonna play finish East three Saturday. We're gonna finish the SMZ three Saturday. If there's time, we'll start East four, and that's Sunday's plan too. I know I love it, local host. Paper Mario Hog, favorite retro soundtrack. Ooh, I'm excited to hear that one someday. Grandmaster Shag, how you doing? Uh, okay. There's no cave here. Or is there? Taking it easy on the weekends. Did you just pun? Is this the kind of behavior that you wanted to exhibit when you grew up? All right. How much space does Echo S require? Great question. Give me a minute. Ba -da -da. Echo S itself was like three and a half gigs, I believe. Ba -ba -da. But I'm a bit time sensitive right now. So once I've at least done this, there we go. Ugh, how dare you touch me with the same hand that embraced that filthy hot spring. I shall never forgive you. Okay. Now I can check. <laughs> it's weird that it plays boss music. It's the same enemy we just killed like three times. 
All right, let's see. Um, where is it? It's in there. Gameplay. Uh, three point two gig for Echo S. Not too bad, given how there's thirteen thousand lines. I think they said. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, wild Belvin. I've heard of uh, places that do that. Let's try Faraga. How did Red get all of his MP back? I don't know. That's confusing. <laughs> That was a boss. <sighs> oh, Echo S isn't graphics. It's the voice acting. You didn't ask me how much all of my mods I'm using take up. You just asked about Echo Hi. S. Echo S is the voice acting. Alone. That's 3.2 gigs. Dun, dun, dun. How can this be? Alexander. Hell yeah. Hells, yes. Um, who do we want to give that to? Maybe him. Maybe, maybe the doggo, maybe him. I could get rid of HP absorb. I'm not using, I like never use lightning. I don't know why I have it. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I just nuked her down. How much are all of the mods? Um, I can try and figure that out. I don't know where they're stored. Uh, let's see. Steam library. Um, let's see. Is it this folder? Yes. 30 gig. All of the mods appear to be about 30 gig. If this is accurate. Let's see. What is the entire Final Fantasy 7 folder? Yeah, it's about 30 gig of mods. And you'd like to see Kajada come back to a modern FF. Yeah, I don't think it has been in any others, has it? Just this one. All right, that's all that's in here. There's an all materia and added cut. Added cut is what we want. I do not know how to get it. Someone said it's a, what did you say? It was a zone where you're going from top left to bottom right. Is that right? That sounds right. Claude needs MP. Do white wind. We're, we're hurting. Seriously, I'm baffled. How the hell does Red have all his MP back? Oh, because he did Sled Fang. Or whatever it's called. Blood something. It does the HP MP absorb. Oh no, poison! <gasps> nice. Give me those counters. Red zoomies. Yeah. It's something. It's one of his limit breaks. He absorbed HP MP. That's why he got it all back. It's impressive how much it gave. How? No, Blood Fang. That's what it was. He needs to get. Still needs to get the second tier of level two. Wait, I'm going to go the other way. I changed my mind. Is this guy a drummer? What are those? Miss. What? What? What's with this evasion? Evade this. Ha, 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 ha. 
Nice. That worked pretty well. <laughs> on this dick. Ooh, HP plus level. I changed my mind. I want to go down here. Let's see where this goes. Random encounter. Steel. I want to see Alexander. Oh, I don't have enough MP. All right. Stole circle. What may? What's that? Two shields. Slow as an ox. Evasive as heck. Yeah, why didn't they just have him like block and it did zero damage if it was, that's what it was happening? Circlet. Let's see what a circlet is. Is that an accessory? It is. Magic and spirit plus 30. Wow. I think I'm going to give him that. And we'll give red the uh, ribbon. There we go. Now his magic is 141. His spirit's 107. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's pretty good. <sighs> do, do, do. That's a really nice accessory. Um, do, do. Power source for Tifa, of course. We haven't found in very many luck sources, unfortunately. What is Cobot? I don't think I know that one. Do, 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 do. I did see he was streaming uh, some speed runs again. Guess he got the itch. Do, 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 do. Summon. Let's see. Summon you from beyond. You'd think water would be pretty devastating in a frozen landscape, you know? That's so cool. How terrifying would that be? <laughs> this giant sea serpent. Like a deafening roar and a tidal wave right behind it. Yeah, he streams when I'm asleep, so I never get a chance to stop in. Um, Kind of lost a little bit. Kind of sort of lost here. Go back to the hot spring if we can because i think that gives you more time if i'm not mistaken i need to know i need to know there we go oh take him down there we go So badass. Look at that. Whoa, I think they're weak to uh <laughs> Holy wait, maybe they're not. Maybe it's because of that circlet, right? I think it's because of the circlet. Cause we did just skyrocket his MP. Like what's his magic without it? 108, right? Okay. And if I equip it, oh, I was looking at the wrong number. Damn it. <laughs> I was looking at spirit. All right, magic. Oh, it is 108. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. It is 108. Okay. Hold on, let's see if this works. Goes from 108 to 141. So there you go. There you go. Adds 33 because of the MP plus. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's when I go to bed. It's about 9 a.m. Central, so 10 a.m. Eastern. Yeah. Yeah, Dark Max, I think so, too. Uh, I think it was this top route to get to Hot Spring. And it cut. We need to get that. We got to find that somewhere. Not sure where, but it's here in this mountain. Okay. All right. So we got a little hot spring action there. Maybe if we had west instead of east this time in the snow field. Let's try that. We're going to head west. Oh, it might be a zone like this, too. Uh, let's see if they have any MP. Oh, they do. Perfect. Nice. Magic hammer is good. It's not as OP as Osmos and six, though. It was arguably game breaking. Okay, so it's in a zone like this, right? Like a diagonal zone. Well, I guess that's all there was for that. I don't see it anywhere. Do you? All right, we're going to go west. Added cuts on the east side of the map. Oh, is it? Huh, I don't know how to get to it then. Osmos is god mode? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of busted. Ooh, it's a lot of damage. Dun dun dun. Like two or three screens away from the cave with the lady. Oh. Well, uh, this way. Well, this way. Stop it. You're rotating too much. Oh, okay. <laughs> <sighs> we'll just roam until we faint then at this point. There's a cliff on each side of the screen where added cut is. I see. Magic hammer. Oh, she's gonna counter kill. Works for me. Ba ba da. Remember that screen that had two exits on the left? Go up. I came from there. And it wasn't a How do I phrase it? It wasn't a screen like you described. That face in the wall is so cool. Boop. Thanks for the boop. Welcome on in. Enjoy your lurk or join us in chat. Got those lovely anonymous fellows. You whiffed. Ow. Let's see how Faraga does. Quite well. Quite well. You don't know where I'm at? I'm at the face. I'm at the face. Yes, correct, Fenrir. And again, I came from that direction. I know what you're talking about. That is a direction I came from that was a diagonal that was top right to bottom left and not what you said. And there was no added cut in there. Um, okay. Yeah, we're at the face. So there's a cave to the left. There's like a little branch to the bottom right. I'm gonna go bottom right. Towards that log. Let's see where this takes us. Mm -hmm. It takes us to the log. Four ways here. Okay. That's odd.
screen is a one way up weird okay let's go to the cave which should be right here see if we can do magic hammer don't know if they have MP I don't have time for you they sure do very good do it again I don't have time for you <laughs> Doink. they have 90 or like 89 somewhere in there there you go. He's all, well, he's not full, but you know, better than having 40. I keep leveling these all materia. It's kind of awesome. We're going to get one mastered and like have extra. Well, that's confusing. They led to the same spot. How in the world? Okay. I guess I'll go this way. I am baffled right now. <laughs> I did choose a different direction, so two two exits went to the same spot. I didn't just imagine that, right? You saw the same thing. No wonder this place was so confusing. Wow, Beta is so busted strong. Also, he has abnormally high magic stat. All right, let's go this way. Okay. Ba -na -na -na. Dang, Tifa. Even the voice acting in combat. So nice. Cover leveled. Good. The more she covers, the more opportunities she has to counter. We didn't get a command counter yet, or it's just called counter instead of counter attack, right? I feel like we're going to be getting that soonish. Okay, what do we got here? So there's a cave here, supposedly. There it is. Let's see what this is. Oh, these things are everywhere. Okay. Are you ready for this? Doink. I don't think there's enemy enemy uh, blah, blah, blah. I don't think there's any enemy skill I need to look for, right? I call upon the hellfire. We basically have most of the good ones. You get circlets. Yeah, I have one. I just stole one a couple minutes ago. Mr. Cloud has one. Elixir. That's pretty nice. So that just goes the other side. All right, let's go down. There's a nice skill or two coming up in the next bit. Good to know. <laughs> Boy, you just cannot I'm hit them with interested. melee. But new clouds, no big deal. <laughs> wow. That is some damage. <laughs> Holy smokes. I wonder where that all materia is. There's a lot of different ways you can go over here. 
Let's see, what's this? Is this the kind of exit we're looking for? No. What about this one? No. Overleveled. You're overleveled. <laughs> It's like, what is that from? <sighs> what was he doing? What's up, Future Proof? Oh, that sucks, Paul. Future Proof Vigilous. All right, where's this go? Let's just go this way. I'm lost. We didn't find the all materia either. I don't know where that is. It wouldn't be too bad to grab that. Well, this is not what I was looking for. Oh, we're up. Okay, I'm at a road sign. That doesn't even look like it's on the map. Dead tree? I think it's a dead tree. I think it's a dead tree. Yeah, I guess. We could pretend. <laughs> I know, option. I know. He, uh... I was just, like, jokingly asking him. I'm like, yo, you want me to record any more lines? He's like, yeah, just do this one. So I did it immediately. Cause I was calling his bluff. Uh, and then we convinced him to add it on stream. Which he did. Dude, dude. 27? 27 points. There's a couple tier threes in there. Yeah. Da, na, 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 na. Northwest. I just came from the Northwest. See? Northwest. Dude. Let's go right. Until we pass out, right? Oops. That's the thing. This whole zone is oops, right? Because there's exits that lead you to the same spot a different exit you just took was. So it's very confusing. All right, let's see where this goes. Not seeing any of them fancy materials. We're in the middle of the woods. Well, but I think this is where we started. Now I look at it, right? Can we go north? No. Okay. Yeah, what's up, rat? How's it going, man? Rat, which channel do I see you in all the time? Can't remember. I know you're a shrimp strammer. Where was it that I see you all the time? Was it like Mr. Radon or Duke Donuts or something? I don't recall because I have streamer brain. I have ADHD, so. <laughs> so far, that's right. Yes. Yeah, it was during our uh, Diablo 1 co op stream. We're going to do another one of those. Uh, we haven't figured out the date yet, though. But yes, we're going to do another one. We're going to pick up where we left off. That was a good time. It worked really well, too. Shockingly well. Ba -ba -da. Yeah, there you go, Dark Mix. An all-timer from Duke Donuts. I think that was from one of his magazines. <laughs> <sighs> Nude man tries to poop in a room full of apes. Yeah, there's just no context that's ever going to make sense from that. <laughs> uh, you don't mind? I, I, it's the opposite for me. I think it's amazing. Hell yeah, rat. When do you stream, rat? What's your schedule like? Let's try it this way. Let's go this way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Dude. But then, is he really nude? Ah, yes, the philosophical quandary of the nude man with apes. An old timer, that one. You stop cloud. Whatever you're doing here, let's do Kira. 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 Ba -da -da -da. I won't disappoint you guys. There we go. Lady, stop with your ice. I think she counters every hit, doesn't she? Do 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 do. Oh, did you stream tonight, Rat? Some Sanic games? Which Sanic game? Ba -ba -da. All right, we're going to go this way. Right? We're going to try to reach that four way screen that y'all are talking about. Sanic one. Tough game. Tough game. What's up, Slider? Bam, bam, Two rats. Oh, yeah. Gold rat. And rat. Rat 707. Is that like a rat plane? I don't know where. I'm just. They're just numbers, right? <laughs> okay, so. This screen. Four way path. Head down, then take the path up. So go down. Okay. Go up, not down. Okay. Just up. Okay. Going up. If we can survive. Let's see. We've got to be getting close to uh, the pass out, right? Oh my god, so many douches. Rats on a blade. Time magic level. I think that's stop. Should be in a screen or two here. Okay. Keep your eyes peeled. Added cut might be here. There. Yes! Jets! <sighs> Why is this so rare? <laughs> okay. So if I'm not mistaken, you can't link purples with blues. Is that correct? So I can't add and cut a counter attack. For double counter which would be cool <clears throat> but I get why it wouldn't work mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yo what's up pics <laughs> clown tifa and red stumble across a sexy lady in a bikini in a remote snowy area immediately murder her then move on to finding the nearest ski slope no questions asked. Yep. Things were simpler back then. <laughs> yes, I do always live on a night schedule. I'm on a night schedule, not because of streaming, but because that's how my brain and body work. Only green, red, and yellow. So no purple. Okay. It's true, Fenrir. I could do that. I could add a cut steel and then just do steel all the time, right? It's actually a pretty good idea. I kind of like that. Let's do that. We don't need that extra enemy skill. We could put it on him, I guess. Um, do we need to? No, not really. Not really. Added cut push restore. Oh my God. Dubmeister, please. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> she shouldn't have been out there. You know, yeah. You know, when heroes are rolling through, you got to get out of the way. They're going to take everything you own. Otherwise, 
all under the guise of saving the world. Do do do. What a boxer. How are you doing? Counterattack. Oh, almost level three. Okay. We've almost mastered cover. Luck plus just takes forever to level. And it cut manipulate. <laughs> that would work. It'd be hilariously pointless. Oh, man. All right. Awesome. There's an all we didn't get. Where's that? Where's the all material? Does anyone know? Do do. Pix, what you been up to, by the way? It's always nice to see you. Pix is like. Pix. Bewitched Pixels and Ferocia are like two of the first channels I followed on Twitch. Like, probably one of the first five. <laughs> I think that was eight years ago. <sighs> almost. Or almost eight. It was around then. How do you manage friends or family gatherings during the day? I don't do them. Do, do, do. Do, do. Just got added cut. Yeah, we're in the glacier. Um, we got Alexander before that. We're looking for the all material. I'm not sure where that is. <clears throat> it's in a cave in the middle of the snowfield stake area. Interesting. Okay. Make sure I get Knights of the Round. Not if it requires a ton of grinding. If I have to do a ton of grinding and Jokobo racing, we won't get it. If I can get a gold Chocobo quickly, though, then we'll get it. I don't like grinding. It's just, you know, it's in a cave somewhere. Yeah, you need a gold Chocobo to get it. <laughs> it's the only way. Did they update the map quality? Yes, I believe they did. It does look to be higher quality among literally everything else in the game. Do people do friend or family gatherings? I, most people do, yeah. It's never really been my vibe. I'm introverted. That shit's just exhausting for me. If you know the plan for Choco raising, it's not that long. Okay, not that long, Nob. That's a good point. But not that long to you might be different to me. You know, it just depends. Like to some people, getting gold Chocobo in like eight hours is not that long. And to me, it's, that would be absolutely mind-numbing. You know? Do the super boss for Master Summon. Yeah, that's an option. For beating Ruby. No, Emerald. Emerald. <clears throat> you can get gold chocobo after you kill Ruby. True, true. You'd want to use Knights of the Round on Ruby. I used it on Emerald. On Ruby, I had a different strategy. I don't remember what it was. Chocobo racing may require many resets. Oh, man. Like, I'm down to get anything I can get that does not require mind-numbing amounts of grinding. That's basically where I'm at with that. All right, middle of the snowfield, you say. Let's do it. Is there any other notable treasure in the glacier? We have added cut. We have Alexander. We have safety bit. Right? Is there anything else worth grabbing? Now, here's the thing, like, if it was just me playing on my own, I would do grindy chocobo breeding and racing because I can just zone out to that, right? But when I'm streaming, I don't want to zone out. <laughs> That's the last thing I want to do when I'm streaming. Anybody could just zone out, you know, and play a game. I got other things and priorities. Like, talking all you goofballs. <laughs> you know, driving conversations and things like that. There, that's got to be it, right? <clears throat> Are you ready for this? Oh, they ain't ready. No. One thing we learned about the uh, Chocobo racing is... 
I couldn't do the trick for the stamina regen. Because the PC version has always had issues with that. So that's a big issue. Ads are about to begin, by the way, chat. If you're not a sub, you will see up to three minutes of ads. We will pause gameplay so that you don't miss any. And I'll probably grab a snack. Pix, you're doing good. Doing a lot in the gaming verse. Teaching art for gaming and other things. Just got a kitten as well. Saw Pharaoh's doing a partner anniversary. Yeah, she did that last night. I don't know if it's continuing today. I think so. I was lurking for that. That gal. Always doing awesome things. And so are you, it sounds like. That's pretty great. I got all the major stuff. Okay. Means no getting master materia. Correct. It's just a lot of grinding. I know there's a lot of completionists here. I am not one of them. What's this mod, Milk Magnet? Uh, oh, it looks like Chad has got you. Um, well, one of them. You missed, you missed one of the commands. Because this is not just one mod. Milk, let me know if you can still hear me and I'll feel free. I'll be happy to explain that. They might be stuck in ads, so... There's a gold chocobo manip that has no racing, just breeding. We could do that. We could totally do that. That sounds like something I did the last time I played this. Do, do, do. Tiny ultramarines. Cherry limeade? Uh, is it madrinas? It's not bad if you do it right. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine if we can just breed our way to a gold choco without racing. Do, do you hear me? Just join. Okay. Well, ads are rolling, so that's why I was like, oh, okay, I don't see a sub. So usually if you don't have a sub, you don't see ads unless you have turbo or an ad blocker, uh, which are fine. Um, so this isn't a mod, it's mods, plural. So there you go. Delph just got you. He did the mods command. That's the list that I'm using and the load order if you want to do it yourself. It's pretty easy. The echo S command is the voice acted mod. Um, now, hold on. This is too wide. There. This is what you need to install the mod. It's called 7th Heaven. And it is stupid easy to use. Misclick? Delph, you do that a lot, man. You gotta, you gotta work on... Work on that. I know you're on, like, mobile or something. Like, turn off those shortcuts. Because that happens too often. Um, alright. So, what I was saying? You don't misclick a lot? Are you sure? <laughs> this right here, you just click browse catalog. It's got every mod. Like every single one. Like all of them. So you just look through what you want. And you just double click and it installs it. And then when you're done, you just hit this button. It auto sorts. Philadelph 267 has gifted a tire and sub to milk tire by magnet. It just auto sorts the load order for you. So it's like all automated for the most part. It's pretty cool. Dalv, thank you for the gift sub. Thank you so much. Maybe turn off your shortcuts. I have to do that sometimes. <laughs> turn off your shortcuts and use right click instead. <clears throat> You can join the accidental band club with your cat and I watch his mouse and Mog. <laughs> Freaking Mog did it too. No, EMP, just do the command. There you go. There you go. That's what the command, just do the command. There you go. They aren't mod only commands. You can do them. Anybody can, just so they can see what they are. Um. Yeah, those. that's the list of the mods that I have. The main focus of why I'm playing this again is because I wanted to hear this game fully voice acted. But we got a lot of extra out of it with all the extra mods, didn't we? It's pretty cool. Uh, okay, so we got all. We got safety bit. We got Alexander. We got added cut. I do think that that means 
we can leave, right? I think we can get out of here now. <clears throat> I don't think there's anything else worth getting. I think we go north, question mark. It's interesting, the full analog is off in this zone. Like, it's not working right. It's kind of like... Yeah. <laughs> I wonder why. I got the cool stuff. Cool. I forgot to get a snack. Let's just get this over with. Here's gold chocobo, no lacing. Seen lots of streamers try it and it works. DM that to me. I won't be watching that on stream, but I will probably want that. If you don't mind. Yo, counter leveled. You never got Alexander. Yeah, that one's commonly missed. You apparently have to go to the hot spring, then rush to the cave with that NPC and touch them while you still have the effect from the hot spring. And then they get mad and attack you. And when you kill them, you get Alexander. <clears throat> so it's like, there's, I don't think there's anything in the game that tells you you have to do that. But I'm not sure. It just seems so random. Save point. That was a pretty successful trim. That's why you place the stakes. -na -na. Yeah, Helix. Yeah, yeah. That's what the stakes are for, right? All right, I need a snack. The witch says something about a hot spring as the clue to go check it out. Oh, so if you talk to her beforehand, she says something. So at least there is a conveyance to it then. That's good. Bahamut zero gets missed. Yeah, you need the other two and it, before it'll proc, right? And it's missable. Well, sort of. All of those missable materia you can dig up in the archaeology area. An NPC in the village said something about it in the bar. Okay. I know the bartender mentioned something about her, but I don't know if he mentioned anything about hot springs. Yeah, that, that's true, Dubmeister. There's nothing, I don't think, indicating you can actually interact with the hot spring. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Yo, thanks, Paul. All right, let me go grab a snack real quick. Let me grab a snack. Do, 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 do. And I'll leave you the question. This will just take a couple minutes, if at if anything. Uh, if you get stuck in a game, how long do you wait? I ask this one a lot. How long do you wait to look it up? Or do you not?
All right, I got some blueberries. Blueberries. Ba -da -da. Thanks for your patience, everyone. I appreciate that very much. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, there are a lot of mods that we're using here. Some of them really change things a lot for me. Your timer for being stuck looking things up is your frustration level. If repeating or figuring out is fun, it might take a long time. If you feel like you're banging your head on the wall, you look it up and move on. Hmm. Depends on the kind of stuck. Good point. Similar to Flair's answer, yeah. At least five minutes worth. If you get stuck and have no idea how to get unstuck, you look it up immediately. If you have even an inkling of a solution, you try it all. That's true. I, I kind of do the same too, where if I feel like I still have options, I won't look it up until I feel like I'm out completely. Depends on how much you're enjoying the game, Helix. Now, this is a surprise. Um, if you're really enjoying it and you're able to go off and do something else, it could be months later. Oh, wow. Typing a mobile is hard. <laughs> Appreciate that. You prefer not to look anything up if you're a fan of the game or series, but with more novel stuff, you tend to care less about asking Google and just want to get the cool item or whatever. Hi, Jiltra. Depends on how crucial what you're doing is, if it's time sensitive immediately, if not 24 hours ish. You did it initially, but now for Soulsborne games, you give up right away and start looking things up. <laughs> I feel like that's relatable for a game like Elden Ring because of how big it is. And sometimes you just want to like continually progress. So I can kind of relate to that. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Using a map for Earthbound right now so you don't miss any items. I used a guide as a kid for Earthbound. I think that's a big part of the experience in that game. <laughs> Reiko, you look up instantly if you don't get it or you're irritated. Hello. How many years has it been since I saw someone? When you're stuck, you try everything you can think of, and if needed, put it down for 30 to 60 minutes to clear your head and take a fresh look. If you're stopped at, stumped and your options are either stop playing or look up a solution, you look up a solution. The rare game will be so too, so you decided to switch to a different game. <clears throat> yeah, I remember that, Delph. Helix, it's your 35th birthday today? Yo, happy birthday, man. Oh, I'm sorry. My name is Holzov. I've lived here for 20 years now. Are you doing anything for your birthday or is this the end of the day for you? The introduction of achievements and trophies ruined your love of blind playing. <clears throat> I've never been an achievement hunter. You know, if the achievements had come out when I was a kid, though, I would have been obsessed with them. Completely obsessed. Would you mind hearing the ramblings of a lonely climber? <clears throat> Sure. Let's go and have a chat in the other room. All right. He won't let me up top. I thought this was a chest. I guess not. Like I thought it was treasure. Let's go and have a chat in the. Okay. Have you ever heard about the men who challenged the cliff? Yeah. No. No. An old legend around these parts tells of something that fell from the sky a long, <clears throat> long time ago. You know him all together? I, I have said, and I know this isn't happening, but if the retro achievements ever got hardware support or Mr. support, I would start doing retro achievements just to have an interesting way to replay some of those old games. I'm supposed to have pushed the land up and formed that cliff out there. You got plans later today, yeah? Yeah, everyone say happy birthday to Fallen Helix. Yamaski and I braved the precipice to see what was on the other side. Oh, what fools we were. We never dreamt the temperature could fall so low. A 
cold wind swirls bitterly around the cliff like a storm, plundering you for your body heat. I did achievement hunting a little bit on the 360, but not much. It was mostly for games I really liked, like Mass Effect or Borderlands. <clears throat> Yamaski was below me. He, he cut his own rope. And I... I didn't even notice. Dang. I moved here shortly afterward and have been trying to climb the cliff ever since. I also provide advice and modest shelter to fellow climbers. If you're thinking of climbing the cliff, there are two things you should be aware of most. Okay. First, <clears throat> plan your route carefully, as it could become really hard to see with all the snow. Second, always remember to raise your body temperature when you reach a ledge on the cliff. Do you understand? We have fire magic. Why can't we just use that? <laughs> yeah, got it. You must have worn yourselves out coming all the way up here. Get some rest before you head out again. I like all the mini games this has, but sometimes it's like... We have like this cat, red cat dog thing who has fire magic. Like, just, just cast it. <laughs> Just, just do that. Just cast the spell. To successfully climb the, and you must keep. You need to rest a while. No, no. Don't overdo it. I was trying to see if he had like things to for. No, and you must no. Keep it. You need to rest a while. <laughs> no, don't. I wanted to read the book. I thought there might have been treasure in here, but I guess there's nothing, huh? Empty room. Sounds close to the remake. Really? Cool. I still haven't played it. I'm waiting till they're done, if you can believe that. You know, I've been thinking. Go on. We'll hear him out. What is it? Scenery like this really makes you realize how awesome nature is. That's a good point. If anyone ever told me to live here, I'd tell them no. Well, you get the idea. One thing, though. If I did have to live here, I'd make sure things were a lot more comfortable. One of the channels you mod for is doing a co-stream tomorrow with one of your favorite channels. So you're counting it as birthday presents to you. Oh, cool. <clears throat> Midgar. I guess that's a place where we've done just that. When you think of it that way, Shinra don't seem so bad. Excuse me? Damn. Hell am I saying? Shinra, not bad. <laughs> we'll secure the route. <laughs> Join us later. Yeah, UV and Sid are not enjoying themselves. Neither is Tifa. Let's see what they say. <laughs> Change members? No. Nope. Shit. Do you think I have the means to just soar over this damn cliff? Right? Change member? No. I wonder what awaits us on the other side of the cliff. Um, uh, tea party. Change me. Standing in a place like this. Don't it make you feel like the planet ain't really our ally? Oh. <sighs> Not that it's our enemy either. Uh, how to put it? Interesting point of view. What I mean is, I just don't think it pays much attention to us one way or another. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Change member. This is classified, but the Rufus will be landing shortly as well. Huh. Change member. You love cold weather. I like... Cool weather, like 45 to 60 degrees. All right, here we go. Here we go. When you do a little hustle dance. Why is it not working? Oh, it's square. That's right. <laughs> I was pushing the wrong button. Need a little wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. 
there's treasure here. We gotta make sure we get it, right? What the hell? Well, those are enemies. Oh, I forgot. I gotta do steel. Rufus is landing soon. We got added cut now, so. Got it. Damn. <laughs> Stole his tranquilizer and then just beat him to death. <laughs> She's not playing around, chat. I don't remember how to get all the treasures. I definitely want to get all the treasures, though. I think 38 is as high as it gets. <clears throat> Can I go down? No. Okay. Wait, wait. Heat up. Ah, dang it. Da -na -na -na. We have more explodey chickens. Stream bomber! Ha! It missed. That was easy. Yeah, ha! Undisputed legend. Look at that wolfie. Wolfie. Wolfie emote. Steel wolfie. I got to hang out on her channel. Was it yesterday? She was playing Final Fantasy VIII. It was really fun. It was really fun. I have the calm music in my head now. It's a nice track. It is a really nice track. Yeah, welcome in. Undisputed. What you up to today? Oh, he's got Fury. No wonder. I was like, why is he taking so much damage? Something seemed off. Something was off. Wiggle, wiggle. Are there multiple paths you can go here to get treasure? I'm thinking of something else, aren't I? This is linear. Is that track? Newbie. There's a ribbon in a hidden path back that way. The way I came. And magic breath E skill. Magic breath's in here. In the caves. Okay. Do, do, do. I don't remember what has magic breath though. I just remember it's really strong. Steel. I could have sworn there was something. Ah, oh, you missed. You missed. You kept fury on everyone all the time because you like limits. Yeah, it's a strategy. You miss more, according to chat, though. They told me last week. I thought it meant that you do more damage but take more. But they said it gives you faster limit breaks, but you miss more. So I believe that's how it works. I'm going to trust chat because a lot of them said that. <clears throat> this is such a cool track. Ribbon. I don't think I want to use it. I don't like the power wrist here. No main. Kind of like it. It's kind of sort of good. Trying? Where you got trying? We got out on the material keeper. <clears throat> and uh, Mount Nival. Yeah, Paul. Yeah. 
I thought it was weird too. I was in the same boat as you. I didn't get it. <clears throat> Counter. Nice. Steal nothing. What enemy has the uh, magic breath? Makes sense, Nob. Oh, luck leveled up. Hell yes. Stilva. You know when you see it? Okay. 35. It's pretty low. We'll get there. That cursed ring is going to help a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Javelin. That's for Drill Sergeant Sid. I'm kind of lost. I don't remember what else is in here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, this thing. Right. Okay. Let's heal up. Let's defend. Actually, I don't know if she did steal. Did anyone see? I didn't actually look. Big horn. I hope I don't have to do manipulate. Diablo 2 soundtrack. Favorite retro soundtrack. That was a really good one. Nothing to steal. Thank you. There it is. Holy shit. Woo. <laughs> you did, Sumo, yeah. Yeah, we just finished the glacier just very recently. All right, we got magic breath. Yeah, that was impressively strong, wasn't it? Cost 75 fire, ice, lightning damage on all opponents. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, wrong way. There, there we go. Push the rock? Yep. Okay, should, yeah, pan camera. <clears throat> I think it gets rid of those uh, crystals. There we go. Pew! Same problem with Kajada. Gotcha. Yo, it's going well, Salem. How are you? Look, everybody got limit break from that magic breath. That's funny. Naki Blood Fang it up. We need him to get his tier two limit. I don't know how many more uses I have to do. So he has to use Blood Fang X times to get the tier two. Then to unlock the next level, it's kills. He already has the next level though. There it is, Stardust Ray. Hell yeah. Yeah, number one retro game soundtrack. Salem, yours is Banjo-Kazooie and then Mother 3. I gotta do Mother 3 someday. Stardust Ray attacks all opponents. Okay. Howling Moon begins fighting wildly. All right. Level three. Here we go. Go, uh -huh. go. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. What up, Lily? Nob Xenogears? You and Monty both said that. It's a great soundtrack. I am a fan of it. Toxic barf. Sounds lovely. That was not my best. 
But it should kill at least two of them. Near, says Reiko Man. Above and beyond. I've never heard the music in Near. <laughs> Looks like carpet in a blacklight arcade. You're right, it does. Huh. Yeah, Donkey Kong Country trilogy. Ooh, she got Meteor Strike. Man. We get limit breaks. Fury. Um, I don't want her missing, so. I'm more inclined to use sadness than anything. Okay, we gotta go back. This way? I believe. Yeah. Or a bowling alley. Oh, yeah. Bowling alleys had weird carpet like that, too, didn't they? <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, it's this thing again. Back attack. Attack. Naki has a ton of MP right now. Let's do a little uh, Faraga. Burn. Burn. Should do good damage. It's good damage. Your work has weird carpet. You don't have to tell us what it is, but is that normal for your work? Or not your work specifically, but your profession to have weird carpet. Like bowling alleys and arcades, for example, right? In the next area, there's another enemy skill. Is it good? Don't horn me. Ha! Da -da -da. You don't know, you just think your work is weird. Fair. Places I've seen weird carpet, uh, bowling alleys, arcades, um... Uh, I think I've been to a roller rink once that had that too. Had a weird carpet. Um, movie theaters. Movie theaters have weird carpet too a lot of the time. That was the one I was trying to think of. Movie theaters. Go this way. Oh, it's time to do the shuffle. The truffle shuffle. Now we have to start picking directions. And this is where you can get treasure, right? Uh, We'll just go up for now. And warm up. And see what we can see. Well, I'm not sure. Ridiculously sticky carpets? Yeah. You learn the hard way how to sweep the carpet at the arcades. What do you mean? Your dentist office had weird carpet. Light blue and super dense. That is weird. Does it count as retro to you, Slam? We can't define that for you, so. Do No one can define retro. Only you can, because it's subjective. Airport carpets? I don't remember those. Hold on one sec. Excuse me. Um, okay. So it looks like the right side might have been a dead end. I can't really tell. But we'll keep our eyes open for treasure. Okay. Oops. Keep your eyeballs peeled for treasures. I don't see any down there. That enemy might be out here. What does it give you? Is there an enemy skill out here? You were sweeping the carpet with a broom like aliens trying to blend in with humans because it was mainly paper trash. I see. Yeah, right, Fickle? Oh my God, Marlboro's here? Okay. Um... <laughs> I'm going to give him the ribbon back for now. 
All right. <sighs> That's not a marble oil. Okay, good. Your favorite retro podcast defined retro is the following. There's no rules to what defines retro gaming, so screw you, this game is retro. That's very accurate. <laughs> That's very accurate, yeah. So Slam said Final Fantasy VIII and Earthbound for top retro soundtrack. Eight is my favorite Final Fantasy soundtrack. By a lot. Not by lots, but it is my favorite. You again. I don't want to fight you. I'm a waste of time. We're looking for a Marlboro. Okay. That's why we're here. Do, do, do. I'd like to pick up a retro copy of one of the Animal Crossing games. I have only two Animal Crossings. The newest and the oldest. That's all I got. People were upset with them for New Vegas. I don't think New Vegas is retro personally. But I also don't get to make that determination for anyone else. Yeah, yeah. What is taking so long on this? Yeah. All right, fine. Jesus. These things really wanted to fight. Tifa is just handling it. <laughs> What's up, Toffee? What are you doing? <clears throat> New Vegas was 2010. Yeah, it was a 360 release. I don't know if it was on PS3 or not. And then I think it got ported to PC after. Personally, I don't see 360 and PS3 as retro. But they came out like 17 years ago. Okay. <laughs> so... I'm sure there are a lot of people who do think that they're retro and I cannot fault them for that. What's up, Ma Megane? Megane, how are you? <clears throat> New Vegas was on PS3 as well? Okay, cool. That I did not know. I'm not getting any Marlboro encounters here. Are we sure they're here? Oh yeah, Slam, it was awful. Well, I think I just got my answer. <laughs> All right. Don't kill her, Tifa. I stole some of its tentacles. Feeling good. How cool is that? Frozen beam. All right, we're just gonna defend until it does the unthinkable, unspeakable, horrible magic. All right, we chill hard. Borderline retro knob. Yeah, it's up to each individual, right? Do 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 do. You like Banjo Kazooie and DK64 soundtracks, Lily? Yeah, someone else just said Banjo, didn't they? This must be a good one. This thing is not doing it. And we gotta heal red now. Traditional Fallout fan base, the Black Rock. Black Isle, Black Isle, I know what you're talking about, has been notoriously derisive of any and all future games. I don't think that's true. I don't think that was the traditional fan base. I think that was the loud minority. <clears throat> like that website you're talking about. That was not the traditional fan base. That was by and large a bunch of loud and judgmental people. Mm -hmm. 
There it is. Okay. Good old ribbons. Bam! <laughs> Vinemajam. Casino! What's the 15 months? Thank you. Thank you so much. How oh, very nice of you. How about that? Wiggle, wiggle. Climb and climb. Here we go. Ba -na 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 I still think there's treasure here somewhere, but I don't know where. Are there... That's a dead end. Is there a treasure in that crevice? I'm going to check. I see. HQ, that's too bad. I can't ever... Yo, what's up, Aaron Soul? How are you? Thanks. You free it's here? Good to see you folks stomping in. Thanks for picking our corner to hang out with. Do, 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 do. Banjo's on the next list, Lily. Dead end. Okay. Checking for treasure. You know, got to be thorough. Lauren did start a retro journey. She started Mario RPG and freaking loves it. She did start it. Casida. Casida and Aaron Soul and Efrint. Good people stomping on him. Ba, 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 ba. But yeah, what, I, what I was saying is I could never... You know, maybe when I was younger, it was probably like that, honestly. But like right now, I just can't understand judging people because they like things that aren't the same as you i just don't want to deal with that like it's just childish nonsense <laughs> but yeah banjo's on the next list uh you can vote for it with bits and tips it's in 16th place forty thousand votes hashtag 290 whenever you drop bits or tips That'll get Banjo some auto votes. Yeah, it did kind of sound like that, Salmica. I heard that too. Like it was a Final Fantasy spell. <laughs> oh, were they, Andrew? The PS3 releases of those were bad. I loved the 360 releases of both Fallout 3 and New Vegas. I lost so much sleep and was showing up to work just dead because... I got those games like midnight release and would, would play them way too long. Go to work with like no sleep. <laughs> I knew the whole time, like this, you know, like, eh, you know, this isn't like Fallout 3. I was like, this doesn't feel exactly like a Fallout game to me, but it was just too fun. Vague New Vegas felt like a Fallout game. That's my favorite Fallout game. It's kind of ironic that those people on that website don't like it when it's the original creators who made it. <laughs> Are you ready for this? No, 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 no. Alien Syndrome. I'm not sure if I know that one. There's a lot of retro games I'd like to play, Highlander. The reality is I will never be able to get to all of them. That's just the truth of it, right? I will get to as many as is reasonable and stick with them as long as they are fun. Because I've learned over the years that trying to push myself to the end of a game that myself and chat and or chat are not enjoying is just harmful. It's not fun. Like, it, it doesn't help anything. You know, like it's not helping anyone for me to do that. So I always make those judgment calls when necessary, but not without much deliberation because it's not an easy call to make because I always feel bad about it. Hi, Jay Solf. Thanks for the raid, man. It's always good to see you. Magic the Gathering. How's your magic tonight? Jay Solf raids us a lot. We should check him out someday. What do you think? Although schedules will not allow. I'd have to check out Jay Solf on a day off. There you go. That's when I can hang out more in that corner. <laughs> know what I mean? Know what I mean? Hopefully you had a good time, man. More Lord of the Rings shenanigans. Oh, it says Magic the Gathering, though. Oh, wait, there's a Lord of the Rings set, right? That just came out? I forgot about that. They're doing those, like, crossover sets now, which is kind of neat. I think there's going to be a Final Fantasy one or something like that. I remember hearing something weird like that. 
doing well, Aaron. How about you? That wow, Casca, that's wild. Where is your my line for retro? My personal line? Um PS2 GameCube Xbox era is kind of where it stops. But it gets a little fuzzy when you have like handheld games like PSP and DS as well. Um, and sometimes Wii games feel retro, but for the most part, I don't think they are. But nothing beyond that. Because to me, like what I learned is what I think is retro has more to do with the feeling of it than some arbitrary time frame. So once you start getting to the edge of that era, like the lines blur significantly. Do, 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 do. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it was her RPG journey, not retro. That's right. Warren's right. It's so behind. Um, Yeah, that doesn't matter. You have to understand some of those games have been on there for years and climbed up over the course of years. And when a game wins, you take it off the list, right? So it's not going to get in the top 10 of the lotto system without votes, right? It just won't. Doo -doo -doo. But it's not just the first one place winner now, right? We added that lotto system like two or three months ago. Uh, New Vegas release was mega shit. I didn't have any issues with it. Zero issues. I know it was supposedly beg buggy. But when I played it on 360, I had no issues with it at all. There was no crashes, like no corrupted saves, like none of those common issues that a lot of people did have. There are a lot of games for everyone. If you don't like one, you're sure there are others who will. Doesn't make any sense to argue about it. But you do like hearing what other people are interested in. I like hearing what people like about games that I don't. Because it can give me a new perspective sometimes. New Vegas is your top game of all time. Wow. Baldur's Gate 3 might be finally. I hope I can find time to play that tonight. Do just catching up with chat here it's not fun unless everyone's enjoying it yeah what i was trying to say like over the years i see too many people do this and i hope it works for them i really do like maybe that's the vibe of their channel right maybe that's the aesthetic i've just tons of channels where no matter how much they're frustrated or not having fun with a the game they will stick through it to the end I can respect that level of tenacity, you know, and appreciate that, but I'm not going to have fun watching it <laughs> because I don't think it's enjoyable watching somebody who looks like they're miserable. It just, ugh. it just puts me in a bad mood. I think that's true of a lot of people. Man, that magic breath messes us up. Tyrion, it's a shooter game on DOS for a great soundtrack you like option. I don't know that one. Happy one of your peeps are up and streaming. Right on, man. Thanks so much. Some of the worst games have great reputations. Desert Bus? That does not have a great reputation. <laughs> no, no, not at all. That game has one of the worst reputations for a video game possible. That's why people do it. That's the, the reason why people do it. Because it's meme trash that they're forced to play against their wishes due to an incentive, usually a charity incentive. <laughs> so no, it has a terrible reputation. Doctor Who Magic the Gathering also. Interesting. Okay. But I'm going to see Lord of the Rings, Assassin's Creed, Doctor Who, Walking Dead, and more. Wow, they're really going f all out with those crossovers. Snap judgment on tonight's question, Aaron. Mega Man 4 
But your favorite OST ever is Chrono Cross. Same. Chrono Cross is mine as well. Mega Man 4 is my favorite NES Mega Man, but not my favorite NES Mega Man soundtrack. Hi, Cage. How you doing, man? How you feeling today? Lily, what are we cranking? <laughs> Hardest one to pin down is when PC games become retro. Mid 2000s, maybe late 2000s. Yeah, you know, it depends. Just depends on the person. It's a feel thing. That's why, I, you know, I don't know. Like to me, KOTOR is retro. Knights of the Old Republic. When did that come out? Like 05, 06 ish. Something like that. Ooh. Retro to you is if you could play it before turning 18. Oh, cool. SOG stuff from all main series then. Yeah, that's wild, J Solf. You got New Vegas early on PC. It was mega buggy. The PC version of New Vegas was a port, though. It wasn't like an original release. And Bethesda games, I say Bethesda. It was it's Obsidian, but it was Bethesda's engine. Man, their stuff is always jacked when they're ported. <laughs> they were as bad like as Square Enix was for a while. Square Enix still has problems with that. Not as bad, though. You're stubborn sometimes you go with what peeps enjoy. Yeah, I'm not saying people should change what they do on their own channel, you know? What's up, Jacelyn? How are you? I'm still catching up with chat. Sorry for the delay there. Yeah, if you all want to use these mods, uh, Echo S has a tutorial video on how to get started. It's also the voice acting mod we're using. And then the mods command lists all the mods that I'm using. If you want to use the same ones in the same load order. So you don't have to think about it at all. All right. So there's a thing here where you have to make icicles fall. And I believe you can get a treasure for it. I don't remember exactly how this goes. There's a gimmick to it. There's some kind of gimmick to it. Mm -hmm. You've been playing that new world builder pally with some buds. Yeah, I saw Bear Boo playing that yesterday. Looks all right. Although I heard its microtransactions are really bad. Like super, super bad. So yeah, I think we have to make an icicle fall near this to get it. I don't remember how though. I don't know if that's correct. It's been a while. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Bad rats is like desert bus. Same thing. Yeah. Bad Rats is the game, the joke game you buy for friends. Like, you gift it to them on Steam because it's that bad. Scientist, what's up? Question of the night, you'll give two. One is brutally obvious for you, Dragon Warrior 4. Uh, that's a good one. I like Tornado Steam the most in that game. The other one you think people sleep on, Destiny of an Emperor. Chrono Trigger 6 for a SMO. SMO. M. S O M. Secret of Mana, right? How am I today? Oh, I'm so dry, Cage. This meds help. <laughs> How are you? I'm so dry. I think I have to go in another room, right? And, like, literally fight icicles. It's kind of bizarre. Howling Moon. I need to see this. Right now. Okay, that was cool. I think he goes berserk and then gets like. Okay, I actually don't know what the hell that did. Never mind. Doo -doo. Oh, he's got a ribbon on. So it didn't work. That's funny. That's really funny. No, those don't count, scientists. When you start talking about games with licensed music, you're basically just ducking the question because you're not talking about a game soundtrack. You're just talking about popular music put into a game. And that's a different question. Uh, all right. Let's give him the circle back. Forgot about that. I know you're not, like, it's not trying to duck the question, but it is.
No Mega Man OST and NES is a dud. Yeah. I mentioned New Vegas so it's someone cage. Is she a fan? It's my favorite Fallout game. You didn't know the lore on Chrono Cross? Yeah, we streamed that, what was it, two years ago? Those were some really good streams. Like every stream was, at the time, I was getting like well above my average viewership. I was enjoying the game. People were happy because I wasn't shitting on it. Fans of Chrono Cross feel a little persecuted. Kind of like fans of Final Fantasy VIII or XIII. Um, Cause it gets a lot of hate and I think it's a little overdone. I don't think people are required to like it, you know, but I do think that a lot of people unfairly compare it to Chrono Trigger. And my counter to that is always literally no RPG you can compare to Chrono Trigger. So don't do it. <laughs> Just let it stand on its own. Now, when I see people say they don't like it cause they didn't like the combat system or there was too many NPCs, you know, recruitable NPCs. So they didn't get the character growth they wanted. Like I totally understand and agree with that. Do, 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 do. KOTOR came out in 03, it was 20 years ago. Damn, I didn't realize it was that long. Okay. Sonic 2 or Mega Man for shuffle for number one retro soundtrack. Sonic 2, the, man, those are really tight as, as far as quality goes. So you just set a time limit for an SOG for retro? Just a number? We'll make it retro for you or not? Well, that works for a lot of people. <laughs> Hello, actual human. You learned what a Nintendo 64 is. Chat was talking about blowing into a cassette tape. Uh, cartridge. Cartridge. Yeah, that's true. That's what we used to do. It didn't work, though. <laughs> Yeah. So this is a cartridge, right? This is an NES cartridge. So we would put it in the NES, right? Slide it in. If it didn't work, for some reason, everyone in the world would take it out and blow in it. Maybe because there was dust. But the reality is you would end up getting moisture on the contact pins in there, which aren't going to be... Actually, I could probably show them with the phone. I've done this before. And over time, it would cause more corrosion. <laughs> and ultimately, it may do more harm than good. All right, so we're going to do mobile cam here with light. There. You see those contact pins? That's what connected the cartridge to the system. So if those pins were corroded or had moisture on them or some, you know, detritus, like dust, lint, then it wouldn't work right or not at all. So people would blow on those pins. Don't recommend doing that. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, okay. It did turn off. I was hoping it would turn the light off and it did. Nintendo 64 was two console generations after what I just showed you, which was NES. Pally has cosmetic stuff for a little more expensive than necessary, but that's all. That's good. As long as they're not gating actual content. Yeah, they really need to move on. I don't know if they have, I think so. I Maybe Starfield's a new engine, who knows? Yeah, I remember hearing about that HQ with the, the train thing. Tornaco Steam. Yeah, that's my favorite. What's up, Stellazio? You're a fan of New Vegas Cage? Yeah. Sorry, I'm pretty behind chat. That's a good problem to have. It had good exclusive music. I didn't realize that it had exclusive music. I thought it was just like unknown indie music that they would throw in there or their own bands, which many of their employees had. Chrono Cross is a top fiver for you. 
Beautiful, moody, pensive game. Yeah, they did, Aaron. They wanted more of that initial vibe. What's up, Bit Wizard? Horrors of Cartridge Games. Oh, man. Ads will start here in just under a minute. So if you're not a sub, you will potentially see up to three minutes of them. But we're going to keep gameplay paused until they're done. Do, 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 do. No, somebody was saying that they just recently learned about a 64 uh, Bit Wizard. So I was showing them what a cartridge looked like. There's a lot of people that just have never seen that stuff, you know, because it's a lot older than they are. <laughs> like, a lot. You know, like, there's people I know where NES carts are, like, 20 years older than them. You smacked the NES a couple times? I never did that. I was too afraid to break it. My parents probably yelled at me or something. Your friend, a teacher, took his students to Gettysburg. One of the kids found a cassette tape in the woods and asked if it was a Civil War relic. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my God. That is amazing. I fucking love that. <laughs> Civil War relic or cassette tape. Oh, that's so funny. I wish I could have been there. I would have freaking died. <laughs> oh, man. That is so funny. Oh, man. Oh, there we go. I got it. There's an eyelash caught. All right, I'm gonna put these blueberries away. Just give me a sec. What a cool track. What a cool track. It will. It will. Ah. Appreciate everyone's patience. Job's done. Job done. <laughs> Just tell the NES I'm not mad, I'm disappointed. Cage, what are you streaming it's next? Time to kick gum and chew ass. What's Cage it's streaming next? And Bit Wizard too. Look at these Play streamers. Nintendo. Bit Wizard and Cage. Those are good streamers right there. Mm, what up, Diseased? Oh. <laughs> What's up? Sorry, I had to check in with my roommate. She was like an hour and a half late. Ugh. The interstate was shut down. The main, 
main artery <laughs> in and out of Chicago. Holy crap. Is this new? Is what new? What are you looking at? Oh, are you talking about the break screen? Yeah, it's kind of new. A few months. You know? A few months. Maybe six months. I don't know. Do do. You're playing 76 with Curly this weekend? Oh, nice. We like Curly around here. She's a good. She's a good chestnut. Cage is the co-stream you talked about early. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, interstate closures at midnight, especially. That's kind of weird. Kind of really sort of weird. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's go beat up some icicles, okay? I think this is the right way. Did I use that save point? <coughs> oh, excuse me. I don't remember. Let's just assume I did. The hell with it. Let's just assume I did. When are you streaming with Curly Cage? Also, I told Bitwizard that I have a prediction chat. And you can assist him with that after my streams. Haha. <laughs> He's gonna, if he wants, continues this level of consistency and not losing sight of why he likes streaming, will probably be partner within six months. Definitely give him some lurks and whatnot. Check him out. Do Sorry, my eyes still bugging me. No, stop missing Tifa. Oh yeah, we get to see the last one. Show mod's done. Time to get serious. What? <laughs> okay. Cage plays a wood elf bard. Are you playing Baldur's Gate 3? or D and D campaign or other Doo -doo 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 -doo. Mm -mm -mm -mm. interstate closures yeah that's pretty wild they usually happen at night <clears throat> not in chicago <laughs> in chicago they are just 24 7 but they just they're not there at night they work during the day a lot of the time or the evening you mod for curly and cage is one of your favorite streamers ah okay mm -mm 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 -mm. Doo -doo -doo -doo. yeah i've been playing Baldur's gate 3 on my own you did that in your first playthrough i've been doing that since i was a kid in the 90s. Anytime a game let me do this with the borders, I would. The two that come to mind are this and Star Ocean 2. I can't recall which others let me do that. So many enemies, so little time. Hurricane? The West Coast can get hurricanes? Have I ever heard of that happening before? I don't think I have. Huh. I guess, I mean, it makes sense, I guess. I just don't think I've ever heard of that. <laughs> Theoretically, has it happened? Like, has it been, well, okay, has it been recorded happening, right? Which would have been the last like 150 years or whatever. It does happen, but it's usually south of the U.S. border. Okay. Mm. Yeah, Bit Wizard. Yeah. Her limit looks cool with the mod. Yeah, I like them. Fire armlet. 
Now, don't I just have to make all of these icicles fall? Is that right, chat? Not a hurricane, not landfall. I don't know what you're saying. Hi, Moggy. What's the handsome little guy want? What's the handsome little man want? Does he want to hang out? You can hang out. Go ahead. Yeah? Okay. You want to play? Yeah, good boy. He had butt the controller. <laughs> oh, that was cute. They theorize a tropical storm made landfall. One sec. Tropical storm made landfall in San Diego in the 1930s. So the West Coast US has never seen a recorded hurricane. That... Come wow. with me. Due to the Earth's rotation, the West Coast of the US does not experience something comparable to a hurricane on the East Coast. Okay. Yeah, little Mog's here, right here. He's hanging out. Good boy. What you want, man? What you want, buddy bud? Ba -ba -da. Interesting, Vayus. Yeah, he's a handsome little man, isn't he? You got a nice coat. Cute little socks. And a gremlin face when he's eating. That shit's funny. Jump down to the room below? No. No. Nope. We're gonna make all of these fall, right? Make them all fall. Boom, boom. Mm -hmm. Yo, Cage and Bit Wizard, put your schedule in chat so we know when to find you. I'm like telling him what to do. Asking, can you put your schedule in chat? <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting bossy. Apologies. Do, do, do. Yo, what up, Jimmy Jam? How you been, man? Good to see you. Ooh, restore. We got Kiraga now. Very nice. Or did we get regen? Jump down to the room below? No. Maybe it's regen. Let's find out. Oh, we already had regen. So now we have uh, all of the spells. Lovely. Very lovely. Mm -mm. It will move into California, but it's unclear how powerful it's going to be. It's a new and unique problem. Hurricane Hillary may re retain its tropical storm status in the California. Huh. Oh, I hope it's safe. Whatever happens. That's a not a common problem West Coasters have had to deal with ever, is it? Unprecedented freak storm territory. That's scary, isn't it? Silence. Don't silence red. Oh, you can't. He's got ribbon. I call upon the hellfire. Yeah. Yeah, slickety. No, there's no snacks right now. Nope. None of that. You already got some. Do 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 do. You stream every day at 1:30 p.m. Tokyo time. Uh, okay. Somebody do some math for us. What the hell is that Pacific and Eastern? I'm sorry. 70% <laughs> of my audience is North America. So I'm like, okay. Some of you know what that is. I don't know. <laughs> sorry, but I always forget that that's your timing. They don't show the cracks forming. Uh, if they're not showing up, then maybe the model change. Mess that up. Jump a down bit. to the room, but no. no, no, we're gonna make all of them fall. 
Mm -hmm. You're straight up in its path, Aaron? Oh, dang, dude. Okay. Hopefully it's just a big storm and nothing worse, you know? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, Vis. Well, hoping. Cage this Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday. Right, but... Cage. Ma'am. There are 24 hours in the day. Would you... Tell us when you start. <laughs> what are we going to guess? <laughs> uh, 12.30 a.m. Eastern is when bet starts. 1.30 p.m. Tokyo. So Tokyo is 13 hours ahead. Is that right? Am I mathing that right? Ahead of Eastern. 9 p.m. Pacific. Okay. So bit starts not too long after I do. Just a couple hours after I do. And he's usually there when I'm done. So there you go. Jump down to the room below. No. No. I want a mega elixir. Now we can jump down. Except you can't. Jump down to the room below. Okay, maybe you can. You, yes. Do it, Claude. Whee. Okay, what did we do? Oh, this. Here we go. Speed source. Okay. But. There we go. Boink. Who that? Pinna me finky. Pinna me finky. Pendragon Vaxis with the three months. The three months. Is it the last elixir? I don't know. Mm-mm. Cage normally starts in 15 minutes, 2 a.m. So 3 a.m. Eastern, midnight Pacific. Got it. You start 3 p.m. for you? 12 hours. Are you in Australia? 12 hours? Where are you? <laughs> Wait a minute. Pendragon, how are you? What time zone? Central daylight time currently. So Chicago, uh, which is like central US. You're in Western Australia. Okay. I thought so. I'm trying to think of how I found you then. It might've been through Mike. Do you know Mike? Fractal Mind Mike? I wonder if he raided you. That might have been what happened. If you start... 3 a.m. Eastern. Mike's usually raiding a couple hours after that. And he likes to hit Australian streamers. <clears throat> you don't remember how we met? I don't either. It could have been in Curly's channel. Or you could have found me through Rex or something. I think you came here first. Now that I think about it. It's 1.48 a.m. in Central. Yes. Yes, correct. <clears throat> that is right. Do, 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 do. How have I been? Uh, very dry, but otherwise good. Um... Mog, what are you doing, kitty? Okay. You can do that. He just flopped over and almost landed on the keyboard. He's going to nap. How do I get to that one path that I was seeing? You remember seeing me in Curly's, but you think you followed me before that. Okay. 
Yeah, if you don't know Fractal Mind Mike, then I'm not sure. It's possible you found me through recommendations on the sidebar or something. But I don't know. I found some really good channels that way. But can you stand up to this? Mm -mm. You found me through Bear Boo? Yeah, I like hanging out there. <clears throat> Figure it out someday. I can look at your chat history and see the first thing you said. If it was a raid, it'll probably have that info. Do, 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 do. Beria. Using me as a sage word, safe word. For what? Like for spoilers or whatever? Mog, stop hitting the keyboard. Kitty. Kitty. Doesn't look like you came from a raid. You just showed up. Five days after you followed. Yeah, I don't know, Kate. <laughs> it's likely we'd followed each other in someone else's channel and just went from there. It's my theory. For backseating? Okay. Rendered Rayquaza? Oh, this game predated Rayquaza. <laughs> so, I guess the question is, when did Leviathan get in Pokemon? Mm. You found me through 8 D or Selena? Yeah. I definitely hang out in their channels a lot. They stream before me, typically, so... I like to be in friends channels to start my day. Enhanced sword. So attack power is weak, but it has a ton of slots. Hmm, that's tempting. Do I need those two extra slots right now? They are all linked though. I do not need those extra slots right now. I might at some point. Finn's butthole was her safe word. That sounds like something bear would do. Oh yeah. Absolutely. She would totally do that. JC raid? I think so too. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I gotta link him to the... Uh... Oh no, I already did. The Battletoads run I did. He wanted to see it. I think he watched it. No telling the story of how we met for the first time. I raided into your channel as you were looking at Samus's ass. Yeah, that's true. But I raided your channel because I had seen you, I think, in Dr. Orochi's corner a few times. I think that's how I ended up following you. It's because you were just a shit gremlin in his chat. <laughs> I was like, all right, this person streams. I got to see what this is about. And I went to your channel and you were looking at a picture of Samus's ass as like 150 people just rolled in. <laughs> <laughs> Trainer Benny Raid? Hmm, I don't know that name. I don't know that name, so I don't think so. Unless it was a raid train. You remember finding me through BGG on his D&D nights? Yeah, yeah. He, he sacrificed a lot to be a part of that campaign. He cut his streams in half on those Saturdays and then would just raid over here so that he could be a part of it. Cause he always wanted to be a part of a D&D &D campaign that didn't suck and didn't have shitty people, you know, or a terrible DM. Like, I was going to approach him. I just like, was, like, casually bringing up the, the campaign to him when we were talking once in a call. Because I was going to, you know, work my way up to asking him to join. And as soon as I mentioned that I was going to start a D&D campaign, he's like, I'm in. I'm like, what? what? Uh oh, okay. <laughs> like, what? Like, don't you want me to tell you about it first? He's like, yeah, okay. <laughs> like, all right. <laughs> it's like, well, that was easy. 
It was a gift of the cutscene from Zero Mission where she loses her various suit. Oh, I see. I don't think I've seen that. You found me from a Juker raid. I don't know what his schedule is anymore. He used to raid a lot. I don't get to see him very much anymore. Mm -hmm. That's too bad. I like his channel a lot. Dude is like an encyclopedia when it comes to weird retro. He's just the guy I always go to every time. Yeah, I know, Cage. What's my first message in your channel? Does that give any context? Yeah, Veus, they like dive bomb into you and explode. They're weird penguins. Yeah, little Moggy stand stood up. DD campaign? Oh, I ran one here for a year and a half from 2019 to the beginning of 2021. It was pretty good, but it was too much work. I had zero time to work on anything other than that. So my normal streams were just, you know, they were kind of hit or miss. They were, they were, they were static. We'll put it that way. I'm not saying they were bad. I just didn't really grow as a streamer from that. Not really. Yeah, Paul, we did get bad breath. Yeah. Thank you for asking. He did community nights for the first half. Yeah, yeah. Whose channel? What? What, Lauren? gonna do a session zero for pathfinder tomorrow that was the rule set i used i both liked it and didn't it's too bloated i should have restricted it to just like core rules yeah doc i think that's how i found out about you yeah he's moving no i was talking about the juker as far as schedules wells hello you found me from a willow raid dave yeah speaking of raids you can read dark and darker that just got re-released is it good i'm curious about that uh cage you go to your chat you type forward slash user space and then the username and it'll bring up any user that's ever been in your channel or no just any user on twitch in general it'll tell you when they followed um how long ago right if they're sub their chat history etc dark and darker it's awesome. Re-release is great. Yeah. Welcome back, by the way. Thanks for picking my channel to raid. Yeah, no, that's not true, Dom. Any DM can work with any level of luck in D&D, &D, no matter what. It just sounds like you had bad DMs, if that's true. Or inexperienced ones, right? Not necessarily bad. That's a little judgmental of me. Yeah, Juker's awesome, Lily. Yeah, I miss that guy. I want to hang out with him more. They've done themselves no favors for your play group. What do you mean? You can't believe you're learning this just now. I don't think a lot of people know you can do that, Cage. It's something that I try to teach all my mods, but a lot of them just end up using mod view because of how easy it is to check on people in there but yeah you just do the user command if you want to check somebody who's not there that's how i ban people or check like shared ban lists go left go up um when i'm not streaming do -do 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 -do. i love that roll emote is it still in early access? Asks Highlander. Good question. Puels, do you know? Is Dark and Darker still in early access? They gave you five re-rolls. You rolled a five every single time. Yeah, I know. That's not what I'm telling you. That's not good DMing right there. You don't you don't give someone re-rolls. You, you come up with a creative result that results in everyone having fun with it. Go down. That's, that's what I'm talking about. It sounds like you had a bad and or inexperienced DM. Honestly, if you had rolled five fives in a row myself, I would have done some seriously badass stuff for you because of the odds of that happening are so astronomically low. <laughs> are you serious? That would have had some like mad, like Benny Hill, like, uh, 
Rube, Rube Goldberg device level of shenanigans occurring for five fives in a row. Like your DM really dropped the ball on that. <clears throat> you remember freezing here and waking up in the cabin, had to reclimb. Oh man, I got pretty close there, didn't I, Paul? I have been in Benny's chat during one of his FFH streams. Why don't I recognize that name? Did they change their name or something? You know, I'm not very good with names, Cage. What the hell is Benny? <laughs> like, who is that? I don't even know. I feel stupid. <sighs> I followed you before I followed you by four days. My first message is from when I raided you. You mod for Benny too. Okay. Yeah, I just don't, I, I'd have to see what they look like. Do, 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 do. You mean the whole debacle that is D and D these days? Oh, you mean all that stuff? Gotcha. Yeah, I don't think they're doing that shit on purpose. I just think there's a level of incompetence there because they were for so long hamstrung by Hasbro. And finally, the community railed against it and forced Hasbro to back the hell off. So now we're in a situation where they could finally get, regain con some semblance of control over their product. Personally, I think fifth edition is probably the best edition they've ever done. It doesn't require esoteric levels of calculation and math and knowledge to play. And yet it still somehow maintains the essence of what D&D is and should be. And the result is that it is more popular than it ever has been right now. Because of how easily approachable it is. And because it's easily approachable, it's resulted in many people and or groups of content creators to make content with it and make really compelling content with it. So it's kind of been synergistic. Dark and darker. Is it still in early access, but you're past the alpha play test. Okay, cool. Right on. Thanks. Plus. Slash commands have great utility. Yeah. Crane did a good job with clouds. VA. That was crane. Wasn't it? And he, he did bear it as well. Yo, X, X lives. How are you, man? If the dice gods are that cruel, it's time to narrate utter chaos. Yes, absolutely. Five fives in a row would just be mad shenanigans. I would be reveling as a DM in that because of the weird stuff you can start doing. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> Maybe I came to your channel through recommended. That's what I'm thinking. It was that or I saw you in another channel. Because here's the thing, Cage and everyone else. If I go to a friend's channel and they shout someone out, I'm going to follow that person. Especially if their interaction in chat is interesting to me. Like, I know a lot of people just discount shout outs. I don't. Like, if, if my friend or a streamer... I trust tells me that I should be following someone and tells me why and or I see why because of the way they're interacting in chat then I will follow them what a cool track you know I forgot to do I forgot to eat <laughs> I had one breakfast burrito today a banana and a little bit of blueberries. Whoops. I should fix that next break. Yeah, Hasbro is really hamstrung them, haven't they? Oh no, did I really? <laughs> I just used a tent. This was right here. <laughs> Damn it. Mock. Mock's in the way. <laughs> the recommended channels on the sidebar on Twitch. I use them. Let me show you. If Mog will let me.
if Mog will let me, if Kitty Man will let me, y'all can see the browser, right? Watch this right here. Eat right now? No, next break. I'm not getting up right now. Protect ring, steal, and boss coming up. Okay. Oh, it's Emmy. Emmy's good. Um. All right. Yes, you can. I was, couldn't tell if like, anyone could see it. That's why I was asking. Right here. This thing. Recommended channels. The amount of times this is recommended gold to me. I've lost count. So. Don't discount this. I know I've, I've been in this channel, Alicia. A Trey have been there. Ash Rocks, I'm pretty sure I've been there. Pretty sure they've raided. Don't know these other names. So, like, I, if I was looking, I'd be checking some of them out. Uh, let's see, what else? There's the other one here. Live channels we think you'll like. There's Wolfie. She's on my Twitch team. The one Selena made, Octopus and Dragon. Mr. Scoot's good. I don't know Salberry. But Merv, Minerva's really good. There's Ash. Yeah. Those recommendations are usually spot on. <clears throat> Boom. Protect Ring Steel and a boss coming up, huh? That's one of the rare boss steals then, isn't it? Oh my god. That sounded cool. When you see a shout out, you tend to look at their info panel for more info. Yeah. I mean, I always look at that for a new streamer. What the? Oh, that guy just got yeeted. Sounds like you after Taco Bell? Man. Oh, it's the Jabberwocky, right? Schizo? That was Jabberwocky. All right, whatever. I forgot this thing's gimmick. Boyer? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, Boyer? What the hell is... Oh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's see what we can do here. Mm, let's try Bioga. Poison. Poison. Miss and zero. Well, that was a mistake. Okay. <sighs> Can't lose this fight. Steal. All right, here we go. Couldn't steal. I do not have sense. Tifa is going to take matters into her own hands here. <laughs> All right. Blizzard works on the left head. <clears throat> uh, no, I'm like, it's not like a set thing. What's up, boo boo, bear boo, butt. We're just talking about you. Someone said you used the phrase Finn's butt as a safe word. And I believe it. That does sound like a thing you do. So. You know. <laughs> that is a bear boo thing to do. Yeah, yeah. Still. The Japanese name was just twin head. Okay. Baraga, let's do it. Meteor rain, let's do it. Well, it healed the left one. Whoops. Chance, asshole. <clears throat> this won't heal anything. Who told me? Uh, maybe Felix. I think. Maybe. I don't know. Or Curly, sure. Nice.
Um. Why are you stopping? No, stop. Steal the thing. She don't want to steal. Maybe I should hit the other side. You know? You know what I'm going to do? Fuck it. Now's our chance. I'm going to giant non-elemental dragon. It was your safe word when you played seven. <laughs> apropos. It's apropos. Damn. Okay. Oh, the other head's dead. Okay, that's not bad. Nothing to steal. Oh, I guess we're not getting that ring. That's all right. No big deal. Grim Sage. Hey, how are you today, man? What's new with you? Does he have any non elemental strong attacks? Not really. Actually, well, not enemy skill, but we do have this. Shower. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, that's more like it. There's no jabber walking in seven. Okay. I wonder what I was thinking about. Bam bana. Bear Boo, when do you stream next? Bear, we got a lot of good streamers in chat today. Mingling with our dope viewers. Know what I mean? Dragon Fang, what is that? Let's find out. We got K Drink and Bit Wizard and Boo Boo Bear Boo Butt. Those are good streamers, right? 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 Jay Solf, I need to watch more of. I can't say if he's a good streamer. No, I'm so sorry, Jay. I'm sure you're fine. <laughs> I haven't seen much. I'm so busy. I'm sorry. Oh, there's that gamer chick. She'll be a streamer again. If she isn't already. She's pretty good. Do, 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 do. Did I see Jimmy Jam? I just saw your message. You had a forgiving DM. If you roll the one on a check, would have you roll again. If you got another one, would do something super good. Interesting. Yeah, like a, a fortunate fumble, right? Those are fun as a DM. Nura, you were too impatient for D&D. &D. Yeah, it's not for everyone, right? But it also depends on the rule set. That's why I like 5th edition. It's for people who don't want to do all the homework. You know, like the excessive homework. Just catching up with some chat messages here. Do -do 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 do, do, do. <laughs> Play a little bit of Death Trap. What's that? Death Trap. You managed to kill both heads of Schizo at the same time and got a game over? Wait, why did it give you a game over? Was it a bug or is that supposed to happen? I'm sure you're fine. Yeah, I... I'm not trying to, like, placate the guy. I legitimately don't know. <laughs> like, like, I don't, I don't, I, I honestly, I think if he was a bad streamer, he wouldn't be raiding here, you know? <clears throat> Let's be honest. A bad streamer would pick, like, the biggest streamers I could find and raid in there. Like, it's not going to help anything, right? It probably won't even show up as an alert. ba na 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 na, -na. You got more time to watch everyone else. Nice. Streamers like watching other streamers. Absolutely. Quarrels. Do these have a enemy skill? I don't know if they do in this game. But they're terrifying in almost every Final Fantasy. I switch up my chat design per game. It's a pain in the ass, but I have a lot of presets for it at this point. But yeah. If I don't have a font for it, I have to go find it and install it. I 
I don't know what you mean, Grim. There's five editions of D&D, &D, right? Do -do 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 -do. You gotta get more time. Oh, I just read that. My bad. You get hit with both heads of final attack, one after another of health is too low, game over. Oh! That makes sense. Yeah, they usually have the one-shot mechanics called Blaster that just kill you. Uh, let's do Trine. Pretty good. There you go. What's up, Lemon Bomb? How are you? Tower Defense game in the same world as Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing games. Huh, okay. I haven't played a Tower Defense in a long time. Encounter rate. Oh, these things are easy. Okay. Or they dodge. Do, 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 do. Bow, na, 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 na. Day 230 out of the year in a row streaming. Good lord. I've never done anything like that. I would lose my mind. <clears throat> I can't do anything two thirty days in a row. There we go. I'd be too tired if I try that with streaming. Do you have enough time to like plan your streams and like all that other stuff? Or do you just do streaming? Do Got the skills already. Okay, thanks, Highlander. All the new rules. Something. Uh, that's a blue dragon. Nothing worthwhile. Does not have anything to steal. Let's make sure it's dead. There's an old version called D&D, &D, but then they revised. Yeah, that's just AD&D &D is just second edition, right? AD&D <clears throat> &D is just second edition. It's not every edition after first. Someone argue I already have lost it. I might be the first. <laughs> <laughs> Dragon armlet. Yo. That was a lucky drop. Uh, okay. Let's give it to him. How about that? We got two of these now. <clears throat> There's that luck stat. I don't think that's supposed to happen very often. You struggle to stream three days a week. Four is hard for me because of my long streams, which is why I take an extra day off sometimes. With that said... It is what I prefer when I can have the energy for it. It isn't worth it, then don't do it, JSOL. If you know it's not worth it, then don't do it. Like, what What are you... You have plans, but you have to limit yourself from getting gassed out. Okay. Like, what do you gain by doing it the way you're doing it, then? That's not how you grow a channel, if that's what you think is going to happen. <clears throat> You love to stream more often. You love the social aspect, but life in general doesn't like you doing that. Yeah, my last career was very chaotic schedule initially. My streams were like anywhere from six days a week to zero because the schedule was event based. Also, I didn't know you streamed. I'll go ahead and follow you. You've been here long enough. <clears throat> I can peep you. A good way to know, uh, to know. To let me and the community know if you stream is to be in my Discord. Because as long as your Discord is integrated with your Twitch, my bot automatically adds you to the live role, which is like bright magenta and at the top of the list, the user list. So sometimes I just look at my Discord for who's live. And I'm like, oh, I don't know this person or I haven't seen their stream and I go check it out. And I know a lot of others do too. No, a newbie. That was the cue to do the Discord command. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to have a talk with mods. 
There you go. Future's got it. Uh, Future's got it. Thanks, Future. I found a pee pee. Yeah, you did. Yeah. You found that too. You'll find that there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Second edition, remember Thacko. <sighs> It's like, oh, you want to play D&D? &D? All right, go learn theoretical calculus. And then you might know if you hit the enemy. <laughs> I know My it's balls a, are gone. It's a gross exaggeration, but that edition was the most absurd of them all when it came to that stuff. You give up on sleep too much? Red drops, yeah. People separate third and 3.5 as very different rule sets. I am not one of those people. They are the same rule set with just revision. Same for Pathfinder. Pathfinder is like 3.75. It's just a revised 3.5. Do Just do what works for you. That's important. Yeah. You're stubborn and just want to say you did a whole year's worth. I mean, if that's, if that's what you're getting meaning from, like it's a goal that you set for yourself just because it's something you want to accomplish. Cool. Just make sure you don't think that's going to help grow your channel because it's not. Like this isn't 10 years ago. The meta on Twitch isn't just be live all the time anymore. And it hasn't been for years. That does not work. You still have the OG gold box with the walkthrough and everything on, on floppies. Oh, that's so cool, Grim. That's really cool, man. Those are like the mid eighties ones, right? It's dope, dude. <clears throat> uh, okay. Uh, we got an extra slot here. Let's use it. Could uh, hook up some elemental action. Could resist holy. I could resist lightning. Um, ooh, I could add HP absorb to Bahamut. We could do that. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. That sounds fun. Do 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 do. You stream four to five times a week until you hit affiliate. Now you're planning your streams out more methodically. Makes sense. I think it's a lot of things. A lot of things. Hold on. Let me rephrase. Let me collect my thoughts. A thing a lot of viewers probably don't recognize because they can't see it is that a lot of the work that goes into streaming isn't while live. And that could be like planning, research, you know, setup, uh, outreach, collab, all that stuff. Like all of that stuff. Like a big part of that for me is that like the planning and the research. Like finding games that I think would be really fun, not just for me, but you as well. That could be really fast just by an offhanded, you know, remark of someone saying, hey, have you seen this? Or it could be me like asking people in DMs or looking up lists on Google and whatnot. Just to challenge yourself. You can see why someone would want to do it and see if you can do it. Yeah, like I respect that goal. As long as it's not like, oh, this will grow my channel. Because it won't. Uh, hello? Then I had to like climb here or something. There we go. <clears throat> Oh, jeez, Andrew. Doo -doo -doo. You never joined the Discord? Cool. It's good to have people there. It's the place to get information about the streams, announcements, things like that. I also post my YouTube videos, Twitters, TikToks, all that goes in there. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Pathfinder 2 is better. I haven't played it. I don't know if I will. Maybe. My Just depends. Oh, FMV time. Cool. Look at that. <laughs> there it is.
The creator. I think that makes your balls bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what that does? <laughs> God damn it. Listen, all right. <laughs> Yep, we got that for sure. <laughs> Jesus. Y'all are wild and <clears throat> GURPS. Vehicles needed stats that accounted for planetary motion. <laughs> that sounds awful. Pathfinder 2 streamlined like 5e. That's good. <laughs> you get way more views from shorts. Well, I mean, that's just how YouTube works. It will maybe push your channel into the initial algorithm, which will get one to 2,000 views. Sometimes it'll do that. This crater was made a long time ago. And then if you don't see the right level of engagement with those one to 2,000 views, that's where it stops and it doesn't recommend it anymore for the most part. I don't know if I've ever really had one go beyond that. Maybe once or twice but it was only like 3,000 or so it's YouTube has a very blatant looking algorithm in the way it recommends channels it's like you're gonna get six views a hundred or one to two thousand beyond that you really have to be consistent and have serious quality something fell out of the sky and crashed here you have all the OG three Bard's Tale games. Wow, that's really cool. The planet was wounded. The planet's energy has pooled here. But yeah, views from shorts don't really amount to much. If they did, then you wouldn't need 30 million of them in a year as one of the metrics for partner. Slowly but surely, it's healing the ancient wound. Got your second star. Oh, and Mario RPG, nice. Sephiroth is going to steal this precious energy so he can summon Meteor. If he succeeds, the wound he inflicts will be far bigger than the one we see here. You really gotta play the game for channel growth nowadays? Yeah. Yeah, you do. Tactical coverage and content on alternate platforms, which I don't really have for the most part. Like that's the thing, you can't do all your growth on just Twitch and I did and I still pretty much do look at my external platforms they don't go anywhere twitter tiktok youtube they have never gone anywhere like if i was relying on those things for a living i would have been dead years ago because i've made a grand total of zero cents from all of them right like they don't have that level of coverage or growth <clears throat> you find off stream prep is more important than actually streaming yeah it can be for sure and a lot of the times, depending on how good you are at it, it will be. Do, 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 do. Wow. That's a big chonker. I guess. Let's see if he has anything to steal. Can I put him to sleep? Yep. <laughs> Still guy gets arm on it. I already had one of those. I'm not surprised that's what he dropped. Yeah, OJ Soft, thank you for four months. Calling Comet. Yo, I got all six. And he's dead! <laughs> eh. You know, at least I did it. <laughs> You do all request streams for variety novelty. Does that work for you? You're just happy with hopping on when there's a game you're stoked about or just feel like chatting. Yeah, that's the thing. Most streamers shouldn't really worry about that. That growth strategy. They don't need to. It's a hobby. Now, part of your hobby might be seeing how far you can push it, but it's a completely different ball game at that point. Like 99% of the streamers should never do the things that I do. Must go to Sephiroth. Oh. 
Ad starting soon. I'm gonna use that opportunity to heat up some food really quick because I did forget to eat. Oh yeah, future. Yeah, you'll see that a lot. Like especially if someone is like clearly established rules of no vaccinating and someone comes in and just defies that. I never. I'm never gonna fault the streamer for just nipping it in the bud. Good and stale. <clears throat> Do -do. You know a streamer who would take no hints, tips, or anything, even something like reminding her which button accesses the menu is banned. I probably know who that is, but no name drops. They want to experience the game as if they played it alone for the first time. The harsh restriction is because some people couldn't balance helping versus spoiling. Yes. Yeah, that's usually where those draconian hardline no's come from. It's because people just cross the line constantly. I still get people who spoil and backseat. It's not common. Most everyone either assumes not to do it at all or knows the rules well enough here that they don't do it. It still happens sometimes, but it's just like, hey, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> It's time to end this. Oh, Tifa, she's ready. Do, 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 do. If you use gravity on the icicles, it ends the battle straight away. Oh, wow. I had no idea. That's clever. Do you know you don't care if people are backseating as long as they don't try to micromanage your gameplay? That's when it becomes weird. Yeah, that is weird. It's like at that Sephiroth point has taken a lot from me too. It's like just go play yourself. <laughs> Who wants to be told how or what to do in a game? Some people do. Honestly, like some people do. Let's hurry. Everyone has different motivations for playing these things. I usually want advice tips, but you do know a few streamers who prefer running blind as possible. Oh yeah, I think most streamers I know prefer that. I think some like take it too far or no, let's rephrase that. I think some of them do that and they shouldn't because of the way that they get frustrated with the games they play or respond to people who cross the line, you know? And I'm not saying like they shouldn't enforce their boundaries. What I'm saying is that their boundaries might not be realistic for them with the way they behave in response to it. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense. Again, I'm not name dropping, but there's multiple instances I can think of where I see that. Do, do, do. You get a little passive aggressively obtuse about stuff when people try to backseat you. I've learned that doing that is almost never what helps anyone. Because it just feels like a a subtle way to try and dig at someone instead of just being like, instead of just communicating the issue, you know? And it can come across as insulting. I, I don't know, passive aggressive just never works. And I know we're all guilty of doing it sometimes. You love the passion people bring? Yes, it could be infectious, right? You enjoy both kinds, but they're different moods. For sure, for sure. Shackle remix. Oh man, I'm behind chat. Sorry, dub. <laughs> it is a good dish, yeah. You get steamed if anyone tells you anything. I mean, for things like movies, yeah. But I get it. It's different for everyone, right? You found reminding a streamer something they've already done can be considered backseating. Correct. Like, don't... Like, this is the easiest way to do it. Oh, wow. Thanks, Future. This is the easiest way to do it. Are you telling them... <laughs> information that they didn't ask for? Right? Most streamers... You can spare right now. Big love. Thank you, Future, for 100 pence. Most streamers consider any information they didn't ask for as backseating. 
That's generally how it goes on Twitch. That's the easiest way to understand it. Not everyone does. Like, I have that distinction for it, right? Um, like, for me personally, I don't want to be told what to do. At all. But I do want to be informed. But the game, it might depend on the game, right? Yeah, what's up, I watch? Thank you, Seni, for 46 months. How the hell are you? What's up, I watch? How are you today? Do, 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 do. Who would come in here and accidentally spoil something? Start sweating. Did you do that? If Tifa is in the party, she'll force herself in. No kidding. Okay. <clears throat> do, do. A heads up is nice if streamers don't want backseating or spoilers. If egregious backseating leads to a streamer deciding to play the rest of the game offline, then the chat was probably part of the problem. Yeah, part of the problem. Like everybody's part of the problem with that. If it gets comes down to that, right? The streamer did not have clearly defined boundaries or did not uh, uh, defend them well if they did. And the chat was clearly disrespecting said boundaries. Do, 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 do. Just popping in before work. Thanks, Cinny. It's good to have you. Depends if you know the person. You're going to keep playing the way you want to play. I mean, I see some channels do this and I think it's funny that when someone backseats them, they will do everything in their power to never do that to the point where it makes it a game harder for them. <laughs> Spite is a hell of a motivator. I tell you what. <laughs> You were getting a little frustrated because you were watching someone playing with an obtuse game breaking bug that was compounding and because of their policies you couldn't say anything about it oh man i get that it's good that you uh <clears throat> uh maintained that though you know in spite of everything you maintain that respect for the boundary that's not easy to do is it sometimes you're just like oh my god i could solve their problems right now just by saying one thing, but you can't, right? Not unless they want you to. But most people don't intend backseating, but some people react harshly to what is likely someone being excited in the game. Yeah, that's. I think that's why I kind of brought up that distinction. Um, Neo Bahamut. I don't like the way some people respond to backseating. All right, Odin, you served us well, but we got a new dragon and he's strong. <laughs> I don't like people who are flippant in response to backseating um, or offensive about it. You know, like, I don't know. Again, it's not my t channel other than this one to decide that, but it does make me uncomfortable to be in that channel when it happens. <clears throat> wherever it may be right and i was over the eight years of watching twitch i've seen it all over the place i've probably done it myself to be quite honest you know it's just things to learn over time for any years had someone heavily backseating while playing seven for the first time telling him how to put all his material in and the streamer clearly didn't like it he just said he wants to work it out himself the commenter was super nice problem solved okay i'm glad that that scenario went the way you just said it did because most of the time when I see that exact story you're saying and I've seen it time and time again the streamer is afraid to do anything about it because they don't want to hurt the vibe or their viewership and the fact of the matter is is that other party is hurting the vibe and the viewership because when people see that shit they leave <laughs> they don't say anything about it they don't tell anyone they just leave if the streamer is uncomfortable, so are the viewers. And they can tell. They absolutely can tell. As far as normal gameplay stuff or something isn't broken, you don't feel tempted. Makes sense to me. 
just know yourself yeah have you found anything in this game so far design story changes wise you've disliked um as far as the, the combination of mods i'm using some of the early voiceovers for npcs were clearly done with poor quality microphones um because this was like before these projects went viral so they were just getting recordings when they could you know from people though it is pretty staggering how many of them are actually pretty high quality um story they didn't change any of the story they just re-localized it to make more sense so that's not an issue um I don't know there really hasn't been much you know it has seemed like it's easier for some reason but I was told that's part of the steam version itself so I don't know but it has felt like it's been easier but it could be just because I beat this game like 10 times you're alive just tired after two days of work were they 12 hour days You do that if the person's being rude about? What do you do? Sorry, I lost context. You know some streamers who switch their chat to emote only going into boss battles? I've seen that. Those can be fun moments. I don't like doing it here, but it can be fun moments because that's when everybody starts putting like hype emotes and animated emotes and stuff, you know, to kind of hype up the event of the battle. Those can work out pretty well. You like when chat's allowed to puzzle along with a game only if they don't know the answer. Yeah, I do like that too, but I usually want, oops, want to try it myself first. Like our Luffy had two playthrough. I was like no help on puzzles at all unless I get stuck. Like that was an extra rule I added because I love solving those puzzles. Uh, hello Rufus. At long last, I've found you. You know what I'm talking about? With regards to what? You probably don't, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's incredible. I like her voice actor. Good performance, good voice. This truly is the promised land. The land that President Shinra sought. You saw a streamer refuse to equip armor or a different weapon than a katana in Elden Ring. Because someone was backseating them. They beat the game naked with that katana? Hell yeah. <laughs> During this convo, you keep hearing, You're not the boss of me! Screaming through your head. Yeah, you ain't gonna find that here. You don't gotta worry about that. I don't think people are that petty around here. Hmm... It's so nice seeing people give love to old games from your childhood. This looks nice. Yeah, it's really cool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Strong dragon. Oh, wow. I watch. That is an impressive bug. Mm -hmm. Some consequences of your action carry over even after loading. Wow. Their engine still has that problem. <laughs> I still see that in their newer games. Like messages will pop up about things that just happen after you've reloaded. So, yeah. <clears throat> You tend to approach things like backseating calmly if it's unwanted. Only if it continues do you take action. Yo, what's up, Amy Sumisu? Why does this look so good? Because we modded the hell out of it. Like these voices, for example. Although, I'll be the one to inherit it. Sorry, father. Amy, how's things going? How you been? Amy Sumisu talking about cool streamers hanging out tonight. There's another one. Right. No, I know. I, I mean, safe scum is no longer really have that negative connotation like it used to. 
Like I see like my Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough, I save scum the shit out of it. Because I want to see like what happens. Like these variations of like outcomes and whatnot. I do it all the time. Am I having for dinner? I don't know what to call it. But it's got a lot of it's like a vegetable stew with a lot of like cumin and coriander and Mediterranean slash Middle Eastern spices and some a wheat pita. Pretty good. It'll be nice. I, I, I barely put any in there, so with the pita, it'll be nice and filling. Dun, dun. Puzzles can be hard on streams. Yes. Yes. That's true. Okay, Grim, got you. Thank you for clarifying that. Thank you. Do I have any ADHD specific tips for a streamer just starting out? Things you should lean into or be wary of. Um, ADHD specific tips for streamers. <laughs> I mean, the tips I have are just life in general that can affect streaming. Like you need to, if you have it, you need to recognize that your memory is short term memory is next to nothing. So having established routines um repetitive language uh or phrases um uh, writing everything down putting things in the calendar and schedule like all that stuff helps me as a streamer like i everything that i have to do as a streamer is in a calendar you should see my calendar it's a fucking mess but it's necessary it's necessary. Eating Taco Bell saw Mudvayne and some other bands earlier tonight. Someone else that I know just saw them like a couple days ago. That's interesting. Mm Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Oh, that's a long one. Uh, five fives in a row. Um, okay, hold on. Yo, thanks for 200 bits, man. I never meant any harm. It was innocent. She asked, was that backseating? He apologized. It's so he weird hearing, the hold on. The TTS is so weird with that voice on this. <laughs> <laughs> I will we'll get to those messages. One sec. Thank you for 200 bits. Thank you very much. That was very kind of you. With that voice, it was really hard to focus. BG3 is so big, even the dev said it's likely impossible. Most people will see everything the game has to offer. Rub a dub, rub a dub it now. I like your name. It's a cool name. Welcome on in. I, yeah, I'm really happy with that game so far. Very happy. You want to know what success is? Oh, are you, you talking about saves coming, right? Saves coming. So you backseated AV. Right, on accident, okay. And then she kicked the boss's ass and took a picture of the password. <laughs> Bye, Darkens. See you around, dude. Yeah, AV's a, she's a fun channel. She does not want backseating. Uh, what I do see, Amy can probably share her experience with this, is that women streamers by and large in general this is a generalization but it's a true one by and large women streamers get way more people backseating them through no fault of their own they just do they just do so they often have harsher rules or more strict boundaries regarding it because people cannot shut the fuck up is basically what it boils down to um, like I recognize that like as far as I'm concerned like I'm in a position of privilege there because I don't face as much as that that bullshit that they do right so 
I get it when I watch my, you know, lady friend streamers and I hang out in their channels and I see it way more than I see it here, way more. So I fully get why they have those boundaries and why they respond the way they do to backseating because they're fed up. It's like every day for them, <laughs> like every day, like constantly. So it might look harsh, but you have to put your foot in the other shoe, right? And recognize the shit that they put up with. Yeah. Yeah, I have a calendar that also does notifications and alarms feature proof. And that helps me. Again, Maddie, thank you for sharing your story and your 200 bits, man. Sorry, that TTS really was throwing me off there for some reason. Uh, the TTS voice, I think that was Matthew, if I'm not mistaken. But I, I don't know. We have seven of them, I believe. I could technically have a hundred. I have AWS Poly hooked up. This land belongs to no one. It is the final destination of the reunion, where I drink. they will okay. all Thanks. gather. Why do the bad guys in this game laugh all the time like they're tweaking on that? You know, that's just like a trope with like anime. Uh, video games, <clears throat> things like that. It just happens a lot. I noticed that too. It's just kind of a thing they do, you know? Warren, you see that? Amy, yeah, it's true. It's annoying. Right. They get quizzed to prove they're real gamers. Yeah, my friend Ape D gets that shit all the time. Like, she talks about how she has a quote-unquote PhD in Final Fantasy. Like, she knows more than anyone I know in the entire world about Final Fantasy. She is obsessed for decades. She has read books. She has trans. She has had articles in Japan only translated, so she could read those. Like hired people to translate articles, right? Like that level of dedication, and obsession. She has played every single Final Fantasy aside from four or five mobile only titles that were in Japan for in the early 2000s. And this list is like 90 something. And she still gets people coming in like, oh, so you know all this? Well, how about we try this? And they're just like, no, you're done. <laughs> Like, even people who know more than everyone else in the world about it get treated like they don't know what the fuck they're talking about because they have the wrong genitalia, like, or the wrong gender identity, either or, right? Like, that's how they get treated for it. <clears throat> you mod for two men and three women, and you totally find that to be true. It sucks. It's like, just... <laughs> Just treat people like they know what they're talking about. And if they ask for help, go ahead and do it. <laughs> but I think the people that need to hear this aren't here to hear it. You know, that's usually what ends up happening. Hojo's like bobbing his head, tweaking out. Yeah, Hojo's a bit of a special case. You know, he's, he's, he's kind of gone off the deep end, you know? Your favorite moment was someone tried to backseat you in Cuphead and you clowned them by S-ranking a boss they said took them over a week to beat. <laughs> I think I was there for that. Mm. Ooh, excuse me. Yeah, Lauren, that gamer chick has platted Cuphead like four freaking times. And she still gets dudes that try to treat her like she don't know what she's doing. Like, come on. <laughs> See you, future. Thanks for hanging out. Sadly, ladies get way worse chat traffic on Twitch. Requires some strict rules and aggressive moderation. Yeah. I try to keep that perspective. Because sometimes I'll be in a channel and be like, wow. They clap back hard. And it's like, no. They got a history, right? They got a history of people not respecting them. <clears throat> I wonder if we'll meet Sephiroth. All the dudes saying how much easier it is for women to be successful on Twitch because boobs. Yeah, I know. Every time I've seen someone say that in here, I've shown them the current list of live channels ranked by viewership and counted how many women were in it. The average was one <laughs> out of a hundred. <clears throat> so 
They never have a fucking response to that. They're too chicken shit to own up to their own bullshit. That's really what it boils down to. Well, hello there. Hello there, Max Warwick. Don't breastfeed the mind flayers? That's one of my favorite raid messages I've ever seen. <laughs> don't do it. Oh, okay. I don't want to know. Don't tell me. But I won't do it. <laughs> oh my God. Quality raid response. Max, thank you. Welcome back. First of all. Second of all, thanks for picking my channel. Of all the channels out there to raid, I appreciate that very much. Sounds like you had a good time with Baldur's Gate 3 or a shocking, terrifying time. I don't want to know. I don't want any details. I'm sure I'll see it myself someday. <laughs> <clears throat> so, Rufus is here too. Rufus is here too. He is, yeah. Who knows more about five ape at deer yaga probably yaga probably yaga but he's like a student of that game specifically d is the person you go to for just knowledge about the franchise itself but if you want hyper specific knowledge about one game specifically that one i think yaga is, is the most knowledgeable person in the world on on five Max, dude. Max, you know what that is? That is a self-paid, organic, non-GMO, gluten-free sub. You, you hit the button yourself, all right? You did it all by yourself. No solicitation, no sub gift. You just, you just hit the button. I thank you very much. <laughs> Organic AF. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> oh, the RA jump scare clip? Yeah, with Erica. Erica, please. Yeah, that was one of the best responses I've ever seen to that kind of backseating. It was so good. Yeah, you do, Shadow. Yeah. You have to just... You can't let them get take an inch when it comes to that thing. Yeah, that is a wonderful raid message. I, I applaud you. I, I need to, I need to up my raid message game after that one. <laughs> oh man. That's the best one you've seen. Yeah. I think that's my number new number one favorite raid message right there. <laughs> you have a copy of fire emblem you could send for GBA. Uh, send me a DM on discord. I would be interested in hearing more. I will reach back out to you when I can. And thank you for thinking of me. He made all the worst choices. I love it. Sometimes that's what's fun about D&D. Just the comedy of errors. The inevitable. <laughs> the inevitable shit show, as we put it. Cloud doesn't have a deep voice. What do you mean, come on? Come on yourself. Cloud didn't have a voice at all. It's completely up to interpretation. When did you get a sub to OMS? I don't know. I don't know. Beyond sub. <laughs> Impossible sub. <laughs> uh, you're going to top my insurance. What's up, D Gen? That's a good name. I just, I just got it. I just got it. But yeah, thank you everyone for supporting um, Max on that raid. I hope you had a good time with the. Uh, the lithids, good lord. The lithids are terrifying. <clears throat> They're absolutely terrifying. Do do do. You still have any mobile looking after your little ones, but you'll be around. Right on. Yeah, do your post stream self care is always very important. And thank you again. You enjoying the hell out of it? Baldur's Gate 3? It's your first venture in a D, &D type game? Baldur's Gate 2 was mine. This was in 2000. I've been playing ever since. Maybe it'll open a gateway for you, just like it did for me. How cool would that be? We need to time our crossing with the calmer 
Windsor will be swept off. This part always messed me up because it's hard to tell where the hitbox is. Reunion. Oh man, voice acting so cool. Hi, potion. Sounds like they were engaging in illithid experiments. Nice. I actually understood that reference. You get extra points for that. Okay. Damn it. I think you get an encounter when you hit that. Yep. <laughs> sure do. <clears throat> Wind wing. Wow. She just counter killed crit it. Counter critted it and it died in one hit. What a boss she is. What a boss. You've never done these first time? I don't think I have either. Maybe I have. I don't remember doing it though. There you go. The raspiness and the cloak guy sells the severity of their situation. Yeah, I think it's good direction. I think it was good vocal direction. Uh, if there are any missables or secrets I need to get here, feel free to chime in as always. Look at them all just like falling off the cliff because they're so messed up. Kaiser Knuckle. Tell me more. Well, it's weaker, but it has a lot of slots. If I was aiming her for materia builds, magic, I should say, this would be cool. But otherwise, we're sticking with this. Sticking with this. Sticking with this. There's a place like this just in Chrono Trigger. I don't remember that. Which place are you talking about? What the hell are those? Gremlins. Sculpture. It looks like a battery. It looks like a battery on a table. Has anyone else seen that? <laughs> Almost had it. This looks like someone put a giant battery on a table. Dude. I'm not interested. He doesn't want batteries on a table. Well, that's not a problem anymore. We melted the battery. Mods might mess with the game. What do you mean? I don't think what what no? What the Jesus, sorry. That was a little panic moment. Do you wanna quit now? When did we last save? Death Peak? Um Yeah, there's a bit of a resemblance, right? He hit me with curse words. It's kind of great. It's a tombstone. Mm, okay. Where did I save last? I'm going to keep that limit break because I could just do steel because <laughs> it has added cut, right? Uh, begins fighting wildly, but it, he doesn't get I berserk because he's got a ribbon. <laughs> he's got a ribbon, so you know. Yeah. Let's do Aqua one. We haven't seen that in a bit. I'm not interested. Bam <laughs> bam. An area of wind that tries to push you when you run. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the, that's the first, uh, that's the entrance, right? I'm still waiting for Paul to answer. You just dropped a vague hint about mods messing things up and didn't give me any info. <laughs> oh, so like, what do I do with that? I think those things have white wind if you had missed it. 
up to this point. I seemingly remember it. Cover was born. Oh shoot, I think I mastered cover. It's the first material we've mastered. Yep. She'll cover every time now. That's really cool. Works for me. 60 FPS. Right, but I don't understand what you're saying. What is messed up? You didn't give us any info. You're being vague. You're being very vague. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Oh, no counter. Stole a tent. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Do, 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 do. Give me another one. Or just shred his face off with claws. That's good. I want to hear more voice acting. That's one of my favorite parts of this playthrough. Hearing all the cool voices. Okay. Um, is this what you were talking about? Mod glitch out the wind wall. Yeah, it sure looks like it, doesn't it? <laughs> okay. Can you get through it? When did we last save? Because what we can do is if this is truly impossible, I can turn off encounters. Walk back to the save point if there is one. And then turn off the mod. So close. Then reload. Turn off encounters again and get back to where we were, right? Yes, Vaeus. So the idea is to give Tifa like three to five counter attacks. Because they stack. It looks like I should be able to get through there, doesn't it? <laughs> Still, what does he got? We don't know. He's got death. Bam, bam, bam. Scammed. Last well, save was after I got Neo Bahamut. Okay. What's up, action? Okay, so we'll, we'll just turn it off then. This is an easy fix. Counter kill. She's the beat stick. Yeah. She's the beat stick. Cloud is the pure magic. Nanaki's kind of a hybrid. So this is not doable, is it? <clears throat> With the FPS mod. Okay. Uh, okay, so I push. I think it was control B. Battle mode disabled. Okay. Let's go save. <clears throat> Since it's a bug, I just turn off the random encounters, right? Instead of grinding. Three hours and the shield is finally uncursed. Nice. GG. GG. Seemed really fast. It did, didn't it? It also looked like there was nothing there at one point and I still could not go through it. Do, 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 do. This is the second time we've had to do this. It's the biggest downside of the uh, 60 FPS mod. <clears throat> is it has screwed up animation timing of some things. All right, it's really nice that this is here. You're all gonna notice immediately. This, the last time we had to do this, like I my it was staggering to me. Like, just how wrong the game looked at 30 FPS. <laughs> Hello, random character. I think it's Eve Online. Um, okay, so we just uncheck 60 FPS <clears throat> and hit play. And then it'll load up. And I run this move FF7 program. 
There it is. Okay. Okay. And now battle mode disabled. Let's get back to where we were. And once we're there, then we can re-enable. <clears throat> so we don't have to get extra grinding and time wasted out of that. Look at how different it looks at 30. Everything just looks more jarring to me. It just doesn't look right. <laughs> it just doesn't look right. All right. Okay. Things are off. Do, 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 do. Hello, cloud. There. I actually somehow ran past the zone border. I wonder how I pulled that off. Okay. <clears throat> do, do. Oh, I could just like, look how jittery everything looks now. You could get past it with 60. You should have told me that before I did all this. I would have just done that. -da -da. There you go. That's the way it's supposed to be, right? Going all the way from right to left. Instead of like constantly resetting. <clears throat> that is the clear difference. Yeah, it looks a lot better, doesn't it? Oh, come on. <laughs> Where's the hitbox? <sighs> it's a force battle, so battle mode off doesn't help. <laughs> it's so jittery. I think even the PS1 had 60 FPS battles, but the field was 30 and FMVs were 15. So the battles look slow, even by PS1 standards. Low frame rate is part of the charm, it says pink dodecahedron. You're a pink D12. Do you have a set of pink uh, D12s? Ha, we did it. Okay, now we can turn battle mode back on since we have gotten past the point of no return. You do? Hell yeah. That's really cool. Hitbox is just, yes, it's a suggestion, right? This is the end for all of you. That wall always gets you. Same, Margie. Sephiroth, get him! This is as far as you go. Get him. Indeed. This body has outlived its usefulness. Interesting. His voice is different now. He disappeared. Now. <gasps> he might still be nearby. Oh, shit. He's right down there. No, just look down there and up in the air. Come on. Our purpose <laughs> is to deliver the black material to our master. Our master. Our master. Master. Our. I sense something bloodthirsty. What does that mean? Jeff Schmidt, how you doing? Mm -hmm. And who is this master? I wonder how many of the people that came to this quote unquote reunion were members of Soldier. <clears throat> Why Sephiroth, of course. Interesting. <laughs> it's been pretty awesome, RD. All these mods. It's been really fun. Hi. Ow. Dick. <laughs> We're going to pause gameplay right here. Is this our first time hearing Genova theme? Is it? Ads are about to start. Non subs will see ads, so we're gonna pause.
Doesn't it play on the boat? I don't think so. Maybe, but I don't think it did. I think it just played the normal boss theme. This is nice. That like kind of haunting chorus. Lauren, are you in mod view right now? Are any of, yeah, okay. So this pop-up doesn't show up for you. I'm gonna show mods right now. Twitch added a new timer that shows up in chat when ads are running or about to. It's supposed to show for mods too. <clears throat> You don't know why you can't see it here? I don't know either. <clears throat> it's not a setting I have any control over. It's not a setting, period. In another channel, you see that even without mod view? That's weird. That's not supposed to happen. It's how I want it to happen. I want everyone in chat to see that. That's how I prefer it to happen. But it doesn't. Is it still in testing? It is, yes. That's a good question. Parts of it are anyway. <clears throat> we mean upload fail discord. Discord. Okay. Now it's uploading <laughs> twice. <laughs> Discord's having problems. My internet's fine, by the way, so I don't know what the hell Discord is doing. Anyway, <laughs> what do you all think of these mods so far? While we're waiting for the ads to finish, why don't you tell me your thoughts? Because Margie asked what I thought of them, right? I think it was Margie. I want to know what everyone else thinks of them. Discord is broken right now? Okay. Your Discord's messing up too? Okay. I kind of like this pita. I don't think I've ever had wheat pita before. This is the first time. It's kind of tasty. You love the way the mod looks so far. You're going to play it one of these days. What's your favorite part about it? You think it's great? All your other streamer friends seem to like them too. Awesome. You think about random auditioning for a random voice in eight? Yeah, I sent it in a voice reel. All the main like casts are done by a casting, like a voice acting agency, right? Main roles. Um, but there's hundreds of NPCs that need voiced, right? <laughs> you wanted to be Norg? Yeah, that one. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure that one's handled. If anyone should be Norg, it should be Jackasaur. She, there's a clip of her when she first saw Norg because it was her first time playing eight on stream. <laughs> she voiced him like a freaking Gungan on crack. <laughs> she was just like, just like going wild. <laughs> it was the funniest shit I've ever seen. <laughs> it was out of fucking control. <laughs> they need to have her do it. <laughs> I could have sworn there was something. Nothing to steal. Red light. Oh, whatever. Okay. Here, have a, a sea snake puppy. Whatever. D's favorite summon. Apex D's favorite summon right here. It's number three for me. I like Doom Train the best and then Diablos. But this particular version of Final Leviathan is the best of any Final Fantasy I've seen. You can count on me. <laughs> 
Oh god, this is a lot harder with 30 FPS. <laughs> Shit. That's a lot harder. Yeah, I'll just help with whatever they need because I I sent a reel with me doing like 20 different voices or whatever. Nice. That was great damage. First time doing Neo Bahamut. Oops. Let's check it out. Here we go. This is such a cool freaking visual. Cinematography in this game is great. Can you imagine that? Like this, the, <laughs> the earth around you lifts you up above the clouds only to have a dragon blast you out of them. <laughs> uh, oh my God, that was awesome. Tropic wind? Oh, well, that was comically weak. Okay. Let's send in Don't Alex. Good old Alex. Hi. I'm here to tell you about your car warranty. Boom. Nice. There we go. <clears throat> Alex gets the job done, doesn't he? The wrath of God. What is that from, Faze? I can't remember. Oh, comet level. I think that gives us comet too. Reflectoring. What in doubt? Nova cells. Drop a castle on someone. Yeah, we'll get things done. Wait, I think that's the black materia. I get it now. That's what this is all about. Oh. You couldn't tell you the first time you've heard it. I think it's from Path of Exile. I think it's Path of Exile. Genova is becoming whole again. That dude, what's his name? The Reunion. Like Dominus or whatever. Genova cells almost sounded like Solid Snake. Nice. Castlevania animated priest said guad the anime or not sephiroth you mean all this time it wasn't sephiroth we were following unequip someone oh i'll explain later right now the only thing that matters is beating sephiroth is that now is the unequipping now but sephiroth like I it I thought it auto unequips all the materia. Oh, okay, Margie. I don't remember that. He's here. The real Sephiroth is just beyond here. It does auto equip. That's what I thought. I didn't think I had to do anything like that. I could unequip armor and he is utterly accessory. Mercy. Right. Both wicked and cruel. We can unequip armor and accessory. But that incredible willpower of his has to emanate from deep within the planet's wound. Dude, just destroy the materia. Save everyone the, the hassle. The materia is back in our hands. Now all we have to do is defeat Sephiroth, and that'll be the end of it. Okay. We'd better not take that thing any further. Right. We should let someone else hang on to it. Yeah, we should. Um, let's give it to our boy. Should I give the black materia to Barrett? Let's give it to our boy. We should give it to Barrett. Right? How does one destroy a materia? They never talk about that in this game, do they? I watch. You never hear anyone talking about trying to destroy materia ever. So it begs the question, is it possible? With the information we have from this game, we don't know, as far as I know. I don't think it can be. Or, well, we just don't know, right? We just don't know. We 
There's one example that's a maybe. Is it a spoiler? Because I'm curious. They look like Christmas ornaments and those things break just by looking at them. I mean, that's fair. Yes. Damn. Precious own. Save the planet, Barrett. Don't give it to anyone. Anyone. I'm counting on you. No one. Sifiroth. You just don't make no damn sense. It is? Okay. We can cross that bridge when we come to it. Oh no. I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> <laughs> Should we hurry? The real Sephiroth is close by, right? The main cast voice acting is so good. Come on, give me a break. They all fit so well. Especially Yuffie, like a 16-year-old brat just obsessed with Materia. Sephiroth may appear at any time. Be on your guard. Yeah, the vo the VA for Catchy was really good. And they say Catchy's name right in this too, which is a nice touch. They made him a Texan. They made him kind of sound like a drill sergeant. You know, kind of like military or ex-military. <clears throat> I mean, he's technically like Shinra Air Force, right? So honestly, it's fit him pretty well so far in his personality. It's been really good. Come on, give me a break. <laughs> Should we hurry? The real Sephiroth is close by, right? Sephiroth may have... Sephiroth. Oh, no. Oh, no. Cloud, be careful. All right, so question. Please answer if you know. Don't guess. Is this a point of no return? Should I do one equipping for armor and accessory now, or is it later? It's now, right? Like, I don't think there's going to be any more boss fights. Younger than Barrett, yet yeah, looks and acts like he has one foot in the grave. It's all that smoke, you know? He chain smokes. <laughs> Let's go and find Sephiroth. This is point of no return. We're going in first. Everyone else, stay alert. Don't force me to run in. God damn it. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I thought it was like cutscene. All right. It's now. Okay. All right. Um, right. I'll take that. Let's just give him adding coat. Right. Yeah. We're not going to use that. I don't think so anyway. Do, do, do. Sid is meant to be 32. I think, he, yeah, he's in his 30s. Yeah. Um, all right. Just give her, like, a uh, diamond bangle. Stick the power wrist. And it will auto unequip. Excuse me. Their materia. So. Yeah, it, RPGs and anime. Margie, yeah. I think it's, uh, Japanese culture is like that, too. They view, like, past 30s as this, like, weird. Like, almost like Americans used to view 40s, right? Except probably more strict. Kind of odd. Just different culture, I guess. Okay. MP Turbo. I forgot about that. I used to always pair that with... Uh, with with uh, Master Summon. <laughs> it was kind of broken. Uses extra MP to increase power of paired magic. I don't remember the percentage it increases, but yeah, the summons would be extremely expensive to cast. Um, it was fun though. Do, do, do. I fucking knew there would be fights. What the hell? It's a good thing I kept their materia. <laughs> what are these? Kilbin. Okay. Why don't I recognize these? Turbo Ether. Comedier? Oh, they changed the name of that. Calling Comet. Oh man, I didn't hit the left one. That was pretty bad RNG. 
Give me another turbo ether. Got it. I got one. What are these enemies? These are weird. Why don't I remember these? Yeah, all the uh, spell names were updated to quote unquote modern convention. They probably had to create some because they never had a modern version. I don't know why they just didn't call it Meteor. That would have made more sense. <laughs> Comet, call Meteor, just call it Meteor. You don't need the CO there. I think that was a mistake. What up, Slampy? Do -do 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 -do. MP absorb is fun on Master Summon. Yeah, you almost always get your MP back, don't you? I remember doing that too. In Master Magic, I'd always pair with all. Just so you had AoE with literally every spell in the game. Pretty cool. What was fun is if you had multiples. Like at that point, like you're, the game's so broken, it doesn't matter. But if you had two Master Magics, you could pair all to one and then something else to the other and it would work on every spell. You thought the encounter rate in the screen was supposed to be insanely low. I didn't. Honestly, I will. I believe you because I didn't think the screen had encounters. I don't think I've ever seen one before ever. You like fire one, two, three. I don't like that, but it's, a, you know, it's like a, a, it's a, it's a, an opinion, right? It's like a to taste kind of thing. What is that thing? Dragon Rider. Okay. We got a we got a save point here. So what we're gonna do is save, turn the FPS mod back on because I don't think there's any more barriers, right? I think we're done with barriers. Dun dun dun. Gonna try and sleep. Right on, Highlander. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, there we go. It was like right next to it. Tent. There might or might not be another. Have I done the one with lightning? Um, I don't know. I'm not sure what that means. Is there another barrier or not? Do we know? Because I can't turn the mod back on if there is. There is. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Poison ring. It's dope when you take an accidental nap and your streamer's still on. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I definitely didn't do this one yet, did I? Okay. That was not bad. That means, though, that we have to deal with 30 FPS until after all of this. That's too bad. What is this? What's happening? I wonder if there's a way to get through there with 60. Because I don't want to do 30 for all of... There's a lot that's about to happen. <clears throat> I think we should test it. I think we should test it. Can't believe I cleared that so clean. Oh, wait. It's going to be... <laughs> it's going to be different. Uh, all right. Let's turn this back on. I need the 60. I'm going to try. It makes it more cinematic. Listen, you. All right. No harm in trying. Right. If it doesn't work, we just reload again. Reload again. Reload. That's the one you struggled on? The last one? Time to science. See, there's our 60. Doesn't that look so much different? <laughs> like, so much different. There's a save anywhere mod you could abuse for times like that. I think there is one, but there's warnings on that mod because you can brick saves with it, is my understanding. So, I just avoided it. I just avoided it. What's up, Agony? How's it going? Okay, 60. Let's go. Poison ring. Cool. 
Uh, it looks still doable. Lightning got me. <laughs> Damn you, lightning. Ugh, all right. We're going to get it. Oh, God. Todd berries. Not Donnie Tauntaun. Boom. Doesn't kill him. Tom berries are terrifying. Oh, so close. Time damage. Oh, what the fuck? What was that? <laughs> Holy shit. I don't know what that was. <laughs> that was awful. Uh, Bioga. Oh God, he's immune. All right. Comet again. Steal. Damn. I wonder what you can steal from him. Little Blizzaga. He's not dead. No, no, no. Oh man. Is he doing damage equal to the time played? I think he is. Hold on. One sec. He was. That is unfair. <laughs> he does damage equal to the time played in minutes. Whew. Okay. That's terrifying. <clears throat> wow. There's no one that can survive that on the team. Speedrunners don't got to worry about that, do they? <laughs> it was the barrier, Paul. You know when they made a menacing trait of the Tom Barry to just slowly waddle around the field where most enemies of the era didn't? Yeah, yeah. Like, so unassuming, but you can't... You can't mess around with that. Ah, oh, I thought I had it that time. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's a skill that's directly aimed in my direction. Can escape? Comet. Okay. We can't mess around on this thing. Okay. And now for something much more powerful. We have to just throw everything we got at him. More time to steal. I gotta not get hit by that time attack. That looks so cool. It's not dead. Alright. This might kill him. He's not dead! Couldn't steal. Not dead. I think it's physical attacks he's countering. You want the strats? I want the strats. Oh, you said something there. Hold on. Let's see, between Tom Berry's turns, the party may attack it twice undeterred. Any additional attacks are retaliated with an unstoppable counterattack called time damage. Oh. I won't disappoint you guys. Oh, okay. Did I hit him twice then? <clears throat> I think he only needs one more hit. Let's do Bazaga. I think this will kill him. Frog song works on him? Okay. All right, good. I don't know why I didn't think of that. I use that all the time. Whew. All right. Wow. Tom Berry's shimmy and FF5 is the thing of legends. You know what was the scariest Tom Berry's for me? It was 11. Final Fantasy 11. <laughs> They were really scary in that game. Really scary. If you let him act, he won't do it. Okay. Do you remember the entrance for Tom Berry in 13? Yes. I have seen clips of that. It's amazing. I remember seeing a Tom Berry for the first time and thinking they were hilarious until you realized how OP they can be, right? They just catch everyone off guard. It's so perfect. 
If you make him a frog, he'll use the Masamune on you. Oh, man. Unintended consequences. <laughs> three strikes. Two. One, two, three. One, two. Is it three, two, three, two? Like that? Three. One, two. Okay, it's three and then two. We're probably going to want to go after a two strike when the wind isn't going. There we go. How about that? All right, we did it. Yeah, they were terrifying because Final Fantasy 11 was just like unreasonably difficult because they wanted everyone to party up to do everything. So Tonberries were especially terrifying. Oh yeah, MRG. I'm definitely looking forward to that game someday. You like that Chrono Trigger reference? It was timely, wasn't it? <laughs> Who knew a turtle with a knife could be so deadly? Is it a turtle? I don't know. It's it's a it's a mix of things, right? Oh yeah, I remember I watched. What is this? What's happening? I forgot that happens. That scared me. Calm down, Tifa. Sephiroth is near. Anything can happen. That scared me. Hey, Mog. Did you have a good nap, buddy? Yeah, good boy. It's a good boy. You saying hi to me? Yeah, good boy. All right, let me move that mouse. How was your nap, little man? Here, we'll make some space if you want to lay down. Okay. Yeah, I haven't played the remake of Seven yet. I'm waiting until they're all done. It wasn't supposed to have a forced Tomberry encounter. But why? A dream? An hallucination? Has <laughs> a swim speed? Oh no. This is an illusion created by Sephiroth. He's trying to confuse us. Yeah, I had to do that a few times, I watch. <clears throat> People helped me with myths, so the summoner rule book was pay it forward whenever you could. It'll be alright. As long as we know it's an illusion, there's nothing to be afraid of. You can't wait for part two. Final Fantasy 7 CCR. CCR? When I see CCR, I think of a freaking 70s classic rock band. Well, maybe six, 60s. 70s. Final Fantasy 7 CCR. What is that? Credence. That's, yeah, that, I... That's, like, way older than me. Crisis Core Remake. That makes way more sense in context. Thank you. <laughs> like, there's no way that's what you were talking about. There's something else there. <clears throat> Hopefully they keep up the two-year thing so you don't have to wait too long. Right, yeah, the next part's what? Like, February, March next year? I expect part three would probably be... two to three years after that. See you, Sage. Let's keep moving. See you, Grim. Thanks for hanging out. Mm -hmm. Credence Clear Remake. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you, Paul. Yeah, you're right. Look! Here we go. Back where it began. Now, move out. Back where it began. That's not Cloud. Who is he? Stop, Sephiroth. Uh-oh. This is stupid. <laughs> what? Will this illusion ever end? How do we get back? Good boy. He's a good boy. Yeah, good kitty. Mog's hanging out. What's up, Rare? How's it going? Rare, my throat's really dry. Save my throat, Rare. Oh, 
Oh my god, Mooney Masa. Would it be Hemet's Hunt Tonberries? I think it'd be scared. Has he shared his hair care secrets yet? No, that's the uh that's the bonus DLC. <laughs> well, gangsta. What's up, Rare? How are your goofy kitties? How are you? It's good to see you. Rare is an amazing streamer with a unprecedented level of energy that she brings to every stream. I don't know how she does it. Maybe she works out. That's probably what it is. I don't do that part, so. <laughs> I don't do that part. Oh. Man. Will this a Tifa? Cloud, it's just an illusion. Please don't get worked up over it. I don't What's next. I don't think he is worked up. Just stop it. What a horrifying. What? That was weird. Like cut off. Said the wrong line. There are Tom Bears coded to be in the next room, but since you never get to control your party there, they'd never encounter them. One of the mods just moved them back a room. Oh. Mods added permitted term in your asses. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you, mods. <laughs> We talk about how much Tifa sucks as a human being. No. It's okay not to like Tifa, but I will never buy that viewpoint that she sucks as a human being. Try saying nice things about you. You sure that'll help? Rare, I always say nice things about you. It's your community that drags you. <laughs> uh, I, I, I try to offset the balance, you know? I offset the balance. You don't do the working out either. You run every day. <sighs> Impressive. I would like to get on my bike more often. The problem is the dryness, the constant dryness and finding a way to fit it into my routine. That has been the main issue that I have not been able to solve. Do, do. Running away won't help you. I'll just shoot you in your asses. Yeah, you had to auto mod for that. Mog, will you stop smacking the keyboard keys with your tail, little scamp? This is what it looked like five years ago. Yeah. But whoever comes out of the Shinra mansion, it won't be me. It's just going to be another meaningless illusion. There he is. See? Didn't I tell you? You told us. Cloud. You told us. Oh, no, it's you. You're What's still up, Broski? Saying, right? Broski, how you doing, man? How are you today? Then come over here and give me a hand. Wait, you got here earlier and I just missed it, didn't I? I don't want to watch this. Cloud, don't look. I'll check this house. You take the one over there. Zangan? Yeah, he's a boss. He's a boss. Installing Baldur's Gate 3 on Steam Deck? I've heard it works really well on that. You're gonna love it. If you like the any CRPGs, Broski, you'll like it. Divinity Original Sin, Dragon Age Origins, Baldur's Gate 1 and 2, Icewind Dale, Planescape Torment. Any of those? Pillars of Eternity, Pathfinder Kingmaker. Anything like that, if you like those, Three is like the best, I think, of all of them so far. I'm not very far. There's a Final Fantasy VII book? Oh, really? I didn't know that. Who is it? Was it like, well, obviously it had to have been licensed, right? It's not fan fiction. Black haired Sonic? Wasn't that like Shadow of the Hedgehog or whatever? What's wrong, Tifa? I told you before, right? You just started CRPGs, Baldur's Gate 1 currently. You're gonna run the trilogy and some others. Dude, dope. <clears throat> How do you like Baldur's Gate 1? As someone who came into it 25 years after the fact, right? 
What do you think? How does it hold up for you personally? There's another great streamer you can follow. We got Rare Gangster here. And we got Old Man Broski. I need to hang out with Rare more. I keep forgetting to. I get so busy and then I forget to open channels. <laughs> and Broski, I wish I could hang out with him more. The gentleman has a young little child now and his lady friend out in the Netherlands. So his streams are usually starting after I go to bed. <clears throat> You're obsessed with Baldur's Gate 1. You have four runs going. 40 hours the first five days you own it. Dude! That makes me happy. It's always really nice when you personally find a game that you get hooked into like that because I know how particular your tastes are, right? <clears throat> Leave your bestie alone. What's up, bird? Your cat's named Dom. Hell yeah. Baldur's one, Baldur's Gate one is so, is so goat. Yeah. <clears throat> I've only played two. You feel genuinely spoiled by Baldur's Gate three. Yeah, did you see those like articles about like AAA devs complaining? <laughs> because Baldur's Gate 3 quote unquote set the bar too high or more realistically, they set the bar where it should have been all this time. <laughs> and they're upset because it's making them look bad. <laughs> Fuck off with all the money they raise. They can do better. <clears throat> Teach Rare how to get a lady friend. Yeah, let's 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 go wingman for Rare. All right, let's go wingman for Rare. We could totally do that. Do how am I? My throat dryness is driving me nuts, but otherwise I'm pretty good. Run Bloodborne BL4 Ludwig fights for a month straight while lying about the size of your penis. No, that did work for him. That's true. That did work for him. <laughs> Don't forget, broski, the robe. You have to wear the bathrobe for a year straight with your chest hanging out. Put a patch of chest hair there too, Rare. Like a big patch of chest hair. Just sit there with a bathrobe on stream for a year playing stupid, hard Soulsborne games. Okay? You'll get all the ladies that way, apparently. As long as we know it's an illusion, there's no need to worry. Your homie bought you Baldur's Gate 3 and you haven't made it past the character creator. You're hunting for mods? Oh, come on, dude. Come off it. <laughs> Just dive into the game. <clears throat> it's not going to be perfect. It never will. That's literally what this you did and this girl flew overseas to find out what's wrong with you. <laughs> oh my god, Rare. What were you doing wrong? Why, Rare? Why have you done this? Rare, did you know that I didn't know you liked the ladies? You okay? I didn't know that. I thought you were bi for some reason. I have no idea why. I think it's just the vibe of your channel. You seem to just be open to everything ever. <clears throat> do, do, do. A good RPG is defined by the character creation being the first OP boss. That's an excellent point. It's an excellent point. Your pan. Okay. I figured it was something like that. I wasn't sure. Still, me and Broski will wingman for you. We'll find you a nice lady to hang out with, all right? Okay? We'll hook you up. The big AA studios need to get back in touch with what really makes AAA, what really makes games good. And a lot of that responsibility isn't with the programmer or other low-rung employees. It's big decision makers that need to stop putting all those efforts and things like grab, yeah. Mog, you keep getting in my way, you cute little monster. He said, don't touch me. I'm being majestic. Oh, good boy. He's a good boy. Okay. No, nope, he says no more. All right, let me move my chat window. I can't see. Little man is just standing perfectly in front of it. <clears throat> what are you doing, little man? You got to play Bloodborne, not Elden Ring. I you know there might be something to that. I love Elden Ring, though. It's my favorite Soulsborne. Doo -doo. You gave up and you were making your first character half elf wizard. 
Uh, slapping, if it helps you, there is a disguise self spell that you may enjoy quite thoroughly. Okay. So just keep an open mind. <laughs> okay. Uh. Oh, what's that emote? That pan pride emote. Okay, cool. I, I don't know all the flag colors. Sorry. I'm not part of those communities, so I haven't really committed those to memory. Your sexuality is like a hometown buffet. <laughs> Jesus Christ, rare, never change. I have to say I'm impressed with your vibe rare because you just put this like 110% lewd vibe out all the time. And yet people rarely cross the line with you when I'm around from what I've seen. Like people know there's a, there's a line and they don't really cross it very often compared to what I've seen elsewhere. What kind of pizza are you? Sausage, pepperoni, pineapple, something, the veg. Yes. Hmm. Okay. It's a good poll. Tough choice. Do, do. I did want ASMRs in uh, BG3. I was going to play one of those, but it wasn't a choice. I guess it wasn't supposed to be. So maybe eventually they'll do like a DLC for more races, you know? And play an ASMR. I just wanted to try one of those. This is my first time playing a Tiefling. Do, do, do. Go ahead, Mog. Oh, thank you for digging your claws into my leg. That felt lovely. And showing everyone your butthole. That's cats for you. See ya. Okay. <laughs> I'm sure you all enjoyed Mog's glorious butthole. Oh, there we go. I needed that water. Bah. Yeah, Baldur's Gate 3 is proof you don't need monetization to to do well. You just need to make a good game. Mm -hmm. You're very confrontational about your lines. You are, in a very funny way. Your mods are bloodthirsty. Yeah, I love it. Your, your boundaries are clear. And they're armed to the teeth with, like, rusted blades and cannons and freaking laser beams. <laughs> You're making a U.S. trip next month. Oh, shit, dude. Where are you going? You going to be in the area at all? Or are you going to be in uh, 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 Georgia or Virginia? West Virginia. You wanted to try a Genasi? Yeah, they didn't have a Genasi either. Mm, that's all right. They, they had more races than I expected them to. So that was a pleasant surprise. I'm not used to seeing some non-standard races like that in a D&D game. Modded at Saturns? Are those just satyrs? Do you mean satyrs? Satyrs. Mm. The pineapple heathens won. Oh my god. Margie, why is that familiar? That sounds like a tagline for a 90s TV show or something. Mog is trying to start an OnlyFans. <laughs> oh, man. No battle pass. Keep that horse shit away from games like Baldur's Gate 3. That, that stuff, the freaking time sensitive releases like that are the worst fucking thing ever. No battle pass. Season, season pass? Fine. Because there's no freaking time gate on it. <clears throat> Your mods ban using Vaseline and straight razors. Good lord. Oh, yeah. It's all an illusion. Zephroth! I know you're listening. Gotcha, bro. I know what you're trying to say. Nibelheim five years ago? That I wasn't there? That's it, isn't it? Is it it? I see you finally understand. <clears throat> These illusions you want me to believe, they're all just to confuse me, right? But 
Satyrs, okay. You said Saturns, and I was like, does that mean Satyrs? Yo, what's up, Michael? How are you? You're trapped in the 90s? I don't know what it's referencing. It just sounds vaguely familiar. Even making me see those things won't change anything. I remember it all. The heat of the flames. The pain. My heartache! Oh, is that so? It's so. You are a puppet. You have no heart. You cannot feel pain. Yeah, Rare, we were, I'm sure you can attest to this. We were talking earlier about backseating for the question of the night. And one of the points that came up was one I brought up uh, about why it might seem like some streamers are way more harsh in response to backseating. And I was saying earlier that, like it or not, like women streamers get way more backseating in general than men streamers do. They get way more people that come in and try to tell them what to do. <clears throat> so it usually explains why they have such clearly defined lines, you know? and just do not put up with even, you know, a centimeter of crossing that line. Yeah, Michael, his voice is really good. And thus, how can your memories hold any meaning? It's basically exactly what I imagined him. Not, a, not a, exactly, but pretty spot on. Like, it's very close to what I imagined him sounding like. The world I have shown you is the truth. Illusions are what you yourself created. What? Wait, why are we sorry? What did you do? It can be real tough here with a lot of the knuckleheads on the internet. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing good other than my throat. Throat's not good, but everything else is. Some channels require the mods to be more Iron Fist than Velvet Glove. Yeah. <clears throat> Shrug. Clown. Dead guy. Tifa! Cloud? Yes. Do you understand? No. I don't want to understand. But I have to ask you one thing. Why? Why are you doing this? Why indeed? <laughs> I like how they like run when he teleports like that. Like, ah, get him away. I want to restore your true self. He's got the ick. I don't want him to be near him. For the most part, it comes from there, Margie. Yes. But it gets toxic so quickly. Yes, it can. Yeah. The one who handed me the black materia. Yeah, I know. It's none of that stuff is going to help Michael. It's the medicine and the constant dryness in this room that I'm on. Like, that stuff doesn't really help. It just kind of masks it, I guess. I don't know. Who could have imagined that a failed creation would prove the most useful? Hoja will be less than pleased when he finds out, failed. I'm sure. A failed creation. The dead guy's blinking? Is he? <laughs> He's fucking blinky. <laughs> no way, hello. <laughs> uh, that that guy right there, he could see forever right now, okay? <sighs> oh man. Amazing. Hojo. What does he have to do with me? You were... Yes, it was five years ago. 
blink twice to prove it. <laughs> How long do I have to lie here? Can we shoot a shorter monologue, guys, please? Right? Yeah. Nibelheim was enveloped in flames. Soon after, you were created by Hojo. A puppet. Made from the astonishing life force of Genova's cells, Hojo's work, and the power of Mako. Mako. An incomplete Sephiroth copy. Not even given a number. That is your reality. Seen extra earning overtime. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Uh? Oh, I was going to say, I didn't see that person talk. Uh oh, accident. That's okay. Chewing gum can help with dry mouth. It does not help with the dry throat. So, but yes, I know that stuff. Chewing gum makes it worse for me, Paul. Lemon drops help a little bit. Probably gonna have another one soon. Clown. Yes. Dude, stop blinking. You're ruining the shot. God. We're gonna have to redo it. I have to I have a hair appointment in two hours. Cloud, don't listen to him. Okay. Cover your ears. Close your eyes. What's wrong, Tifa? This doesn't affect me. Can someone please pass the popcorn? <laughs> I wasn't even listening. Created by Hojo? It's a lie. Don't we both share that memory? The one from our childhood. That beautiful starry night. <laughs> Tifa. Has the seed of doubt been planted, I wonder? Uh oh. Hmm. Shall I open up your heart to everyone? <laughs> you don't look very well. Interesting. Tifa, is Sephiroth right? Cloud? Yes. What are you so afraid of? If it's about me, then don't worry. No matter how confused I am. I'll never believe a word Sephiroth says. It's true there are things I don't understand about myself. Yeah. And that my memory is full of little gaps. Mm-hmm. But Tifa, mm -hmm. you said those words, didn't you? It's been a really long time. They will always cast away any doubt. I'm your childhood friend. I'm Cloud from Nibelheim. No matter how unsure I am of myself, I know that much is true. So, Tifa, don't be scared. Okay. I don't care what anyone else says to me. It's you that keeps me. Y you're wrong, Cloud. What's wrong? About what? I'm Cloud, your childhood friend, aren't I? Hold on. <laughs> Here you go. Me? Gungaga. <laughs> That's not what I mean. I can't put it into words. There you go. Cloud, I need some time. Just give me a little time, okay? It's so dumb. Cloud, don't bother Tifa. I will explain it to you. Oh my god. Changing one's form, voice, and mannerisms based on the memories of another is an ability granted by Genova. Great performances here so far. Matt? Wait, who's Matt? There was a Matt in chat? I'm sorry. Boom, boom. Watched your first playthrough of this recently from someone and they were so mad at Tifa. The Genova inside you has merged with Tifa's memories and made you all that you are. I'm not. I don't know. I just feel like I have the whole picture here, but there are people watching who have never seen this game. 
or played it. So we're going to let them discover it just as uh, we did the first time. <clears throat> Don't forget the best performance. Steve the Corpse. Steve is really putting his all into this one, you know? Not phoning it in at all. The children from Tifa's past, for instance. Perhaps there was a boy named Cloud among them. <laughs> Cloud. Try not to think right now, please. <laughs> yes, Cloud, think. Cloud. <laughs> oh, how rude of me. Wow. You never had a name. What a dick. He's so fucking smug. What up, J-Mac? Shut up, Sephiroth. You still don't understand? Well then, how about this? Looks spoilery? Oh, for sure. I mean, that's literally every second of the game, right? Do you remember the picture we had taken before we headed out to Mount Nebel? Tifa, you remember? I remember. I remember, remember the picture? Me too, I remember. You alright, Mog? Is that you meowing at something? You meowing at, kitty. The clown? How would he know? <coughs> now, what happened to that picture? We have internet again, <coughs> but it doesn't reach your room. What do you mean it doesn't reach your room? Not. I don't understand. Just buy a cable. Picture is part of the illusion. Right, yeah. Is this it? You're glad you're here for this? It's cool, right? Do you want to see it? It came out quite well. Cloud, no. I should be in the picture. It's an illusion. <laughs> if I'm not, so what? This is just an illusionary world created by Sephiroth. There you go. Yeah, same he looks. Oh, hello. Where's Cloud? That's so cool that they show it to Just you. Just as I thought. Routers on one side of the flat, your room's on the other. Yeah, just get a cable. Right? How long would it have to be? Depending on how long it is, you might need a booster. The picture's a fake. The truth is what I remember. If it's more than 300 feet, which is highly unlikely, you'll need a booster. You could just run like little conduit plugs, like on the ceilings or whatever. Sephiroth still has the best haircuts in the history of video games. <laughs> Phenomenal, amazing. Yo, Penny with the four months. The Penny Meowie. <clears throat> Penny, I gotta say. It's so nice to see people showing up for you lately, okay? Like, went to lurk in your streams, and it's like a force of a crowd every night. Everybody vibing. It's so good to see. Thank you for four months, by the way. How the hell are you? Five years ago, I came back to Nibelheim. My orders were to inspect the reactor. I was 16. Mm -hmm. The town hadn't changed at all. What did I do? Uh, oh yeah. Ads will kick in soon, by the way. As soon as they do, we'll pause the gameplay so people don't miss anything. Because this is important. I saw my mother. You're getting a booster. I met the villagers. The ethernet cable you need is longer than 300 feet? There's no way. I went into Tifa's room. There I... I... I played the piano. He did? I, I checked the drawers. He did. I even read that letter addressed to Tifa. He did. The next day, I went to the Mount Nebel reactor. 
I was really excited about it. Yep. Listen to his voice. He's starting to break. Sounds good, J-Mac. Have a good time. Uh, because that was my first mission as a first-class soldier. First-class soldier. Uh, soldier. When did I join soldier? <clears throat> How do you join soldier? Interesting questions he's asking right now. Why can't I remember? Why can't he remember? It's being delivered like an actual panic attack. Yeah, it's it sounds a little familiar to me. I'm I'm Yeah, that's right. I've never really worried about this before because I Cloud Mog <laughs> He moved my mouse. <laughs> Let's go, Diva. I I'm all right. Oh man. Here we go. Amazing. Your voice is so good. It's so good. Have we heard this song yet? This is really cool. Only her voice? I mean, she's a horrible person. I hear a Scarlet, she is an awful, awful person. So yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Bye, Mog. Again. It's all materia. All materia. That outfit? Yeah, she she dresses well. You haven't heard Hojo? Oh no? Man, he's cr creep factor to 11. The outside is rich in Mako, while the core is a treasured trove of materia. This truly is the promised land. There is no such thing as the promised land. It's a legend, an old wives tale. <laughs> it's utterly ridiculous. Everything's just as we envisioned it. What more do you want? It's that kind of obstinance that makes you a second-rate scientist. Damn! <laughs> he drags people in this game. Holy smokes. Ugh. What's that? What indeed? I wonder if that thing happens. It's coming from within the wall. Something's in there. It's moving. It's like there's something right around here. Keep an eye open. I don't know if it'll happen. Oh! <laughs> the weapons. Yeah. You saw that, right? That's not something you want to be nearby. Then they really do exist. I didn't believe it. He sounds like he's about to fall over when he talks. Yeah. I didn't see anything. What does this mean? An eye open? Yeah. Weapons. Monsters created by the planet. They appear when the planet feels threatened, laying waste to all. This is what's stated in Professor Gass' report. I've never seen that report. Where is it? <laughs> there he goes. Here. Right here. You keep a lot of things to yourself, don't you? Do, 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 do.
Are Cloud and the others all right? What's this all about anyway? Can one tiny material really destroy the whole planet? It's a good question. What the? Oh boy. What the hell was that? Huh? What indeed? D -d guys! Where are you? Poor Where'd y'all go? Poor bear. Barrett! Thank goodness you're here! Tifa! Something ain't right. It went pitch black and everyone disappeared. Time compression? Excuse me. Everyone's waiting for you! Cloud's in trouble! Oh no! Please hurry! Help us! Okay. Over here! Let's go. Right. I don't have no clue what's going on, but but I'm coming. Okay, like Mortal Kombat. I think that's how Ultimacia says it, Nate. She has like weird accent going on. <laughs> and don't forget. The black materia. Oh, good. This is fine. Master of Illusion as well. Lovely. Mr. President, I've got a bad feeling about this. Tell me more about it. Hmm. Just keep talking. Perhaps we should return to the airship for now. No, not you. We need to prepare a full-scale survey anyway. <laughs> Jesus, I even... <laughs> Where did you come from? I don't know. <laughs> that's 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 fair point, Cloud. Well, I don't think we do know. This is too big for you. Da -da. What am I doing? Leave it to me and get out of here. Do you hear that? Oh, that's such a nice touch. Did you hear that? Who caught that? Did anyone catch that? Oh my God. Right channel only. You could hear Cloud like he was shouting from across the room, like a metallic room saying, what am I doing? That was so cool. Let's see if we hear him say something else. I'm gonna turn it up. Leave it to you. Hm. I don't follow. This is where the reunion will take place. Where everything will end and begin anew. Didn't say anything that time. Mmm. -hmm. I'm here. Uh, uh, what's wrong? Uh oh. Oh, is this me? Yes, kind of. I can't. Well, let me go back. It only lets me go forward. Don't do it. Don't do it. <sighs> Thanks. Bear it. Where's the black materia? Do you hear him? He said, don't listen. Barrett, don't listen. Listen to me. No worries. I still got it. I'll take it from here. Give me the black materia. Everything cool? Here. Sure feels good getting rid of it. Wow, that's <laughs> creepy. No! Someone stop him! Thank you. I shall handle the rest. Q. 
Give me the black materia. Oh! <laughs> Damn. Thanks for everything. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow. Sorry. Especially you, Tifa. I am truly sorry. You've been so kind to me. I don't know what to say. I never did live up to being Cloud. Hmm. I hope you meet him again someday, Tifa. He's like disassociated. <sighs> <laughs> Wonderful. It means that my experiment was a complete success. What number are you? Ha. Huh. Where is your tattoo? Yeah, Sojo. <laughs> what number? <laughs> Professor Hojo, I don't have a number. As I was a failure, you did not grant me one. Wow. What? You mean to tell me that the only one to make it here is a failure? Professor, a number. Please, please give me a number. Silence, you miserable failure. Damn. Oh dear. What is he? One of the copies I created immediately after Sephiroth died five years ago. Sephiroth copies are born of Genova cells, Mako, my own knowledge, skill, and talent. So I have a question, and I would like an answer to it without a spoiler. I need to know a when. When can I go back to... I think it's Shinra Mansion and see that cutscene. The one with you know who. Am I am I making sense? Like I know that's vague as hell. I've got a while, okay, because that's gonna be really important for us to see. Like really important. It's missable, is my understanding. It's way later, okay. It's a while, alright. Got it. It's closer to the end. Okay. They are the fusion of <laughs> science and the occult. I think it's going to be really important we make sure we get that cutscene because I am almost certain that it's missable and a lot of people didn't even know it was there. Chat will let you know when we get to it. Okay. Okay. I derive no pleasure from the fact that he is a failure. But... He's living proof that my Genova reunion hypothesis is sound. That's fair, HQ, yeah. You see, even if Genova is completely dismembered, the parts will eventually converge on a single location. That explains a lot. Restoring it to life. Hence, Genova's reunion. So that explains the reunion. It explains why so many people with tattoos were all coming here. They were all clones. They were created with Genova cells. <laughs> okay. I waited patiently for the reunion. Five years passed before the copies began to move. I thought that they would all gather in Midgar, where I was holding Genova. But I was mistaken. Genova itself began to move away from the Shinra building. My genius provided the answer. Wow. It was Sephiroth. Look at that. 
good use of audio uh, design here. Because Cloud is literally standing upside down on the freaking root there like a bat. And they're way down there. Sick backflip. <laughs> uh, His will had not been dispersed into the live stream. Trying to Edison some patents. Dang. He was manipulating the copies. He tried to clone them process the created Sephiroth. Oh, he is saying that, isn't he? Yeah, this relocalization is adding context that was missing from the original. You can move during this? Yeah, I tried. It wouldn't let me. I think that'll come in a bit. See, so, yeah, it's not working. Yo, Elsinia. How's it going? Thanks for the raid. How was your stream? What were you doing tonight? Is this armor core six? Yeah, absolutely. Totally. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Margie, it is. Yeah. How was your stream? What were you doing? All Baldur's Gate 3. Hell yeah. Yes, that's how it all started. What do you but think? Where are they going? That I was unable to discern. I couldn't figure it out either. Wait. I bet Hojo's the reason they were all in the reconstructed Nebelheim. Right? Think about it. We'll get into that. Ah, <laughs> uh, Nesotan. Is this your first time raiding? Because we like raiding Nesotan. I don't know if I'm saying it right. I'm sorry, I don't speak Japanese. She does English and Japanese streams. She basically says everything in both languages. It's so cool. Super, super great energy over there. How was your stream? Just chatting. She when, when we raided her last, she was playing Zelda 1 on the Famicom disc system. First time ever playing it. That was really fun. Hi, hello. Anyone coming in? If you know English, I'm sorry, I don't know Japanese. Um, I'm Phenomenon, and I love retro RPG indie, but mostly community conversation connection. It's a berry. How are you? Yeah, we got Elsinia and Nesotan raiding at the same time. How about that? Elsinia, thank you so much. Nesso, there she is. How's it going? How's it going? How about your stream? Thanks for raiding me. It's nice to have you over here. Jagmari, hi to you as well. Yeah, we've raided Nesotan uh, quite a few times now. Quite a few times now. So it's, it's like a good hype, energy, friendly place to be. And good if you want to learn Japanese and, Engli or, and or English. We are playing Final are Fantasy VII. Sure but it is heavily modded to include full voice acting for every character in the game. Among other things, you're happy you could finally raid back? Yes, that's great. Thank you so much. It's cool to see you over here. There's so many new games coming out now. Yeah, this year has been completely stacked, Elsinia. Wow. Jagmari has gifted a tier one sub to Nesotan. Nesotan. Yo, um, did you... Did you ever play more Zelda? I know you were fighting that, uh, that boss with the claws, the mouth claws, you know, the pincers. What was that thing called? It's got the four, four claws. That thing's really hard. You love voice acting mods? Yes. Yeah, this is really good quality. Jack Mari, thank you for the gift sub. Thank you so much. Enjoy the ad free experience and some of the best emotes. Enjoy those. So, I wasn't pursuing Sephiroth. 
I was being summoned by him. You finished the first Zelda? Nice. Congratulations. Did you like it? You're going to play Mario 3? Picking some good stuff. It's really, really cool. It's really cool. That stuff. Oh, man. It's fun seeing someone play games older than them. <laughs> That's the best way to put it. Because <laughs> those games came out like what? In Japan, like the mid 80s, right? Like mid to late 80s. Classic Famicom NES bangers. Yeah, like Zelda 1 and uh, FDS was like 85 or 86, I want to say. It's like way long time ago. Like almost 40 years ago. Isn't that wild? You enjoyed it? That's good. That's good. That's good to hear. All of the anger and hatred I bore made it impossible for me to ever forget him. That was his gift to me. Jagmari has gifted 10 subs to the Finny Bears. Damn! <laughs> Hello! What an entrance. Oh my goodness. You were four when it came out? You did beat it though? That's awesome. Dude, 10? 10 gift subs? Wow. Thank you. Thank you for that generosity. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's 10 people that have great emotes and no ads here now. How about that? I don't know what to say. Just thank you. Sephiroth. Sephiroth. I'm here. I've brought you the black materia. Don't do it, Cloud! Don't do Please it! Please show yourself to me. Where are you? So there's a heavily modded PC version if anyone wants to try it themselves. There's the Echo S command, which links to the voice mod and a video tutorial on how to set up mods. And then the mods command is my mod list and load order. So if you want to play it just like this, this was originally a PS1 game from 1997 or six, 96 or 97. And this is a heavily modded PC version of it. Wrong mod. Very funny. I he of a Nestle time. When are you going to start Mario three and Elsinia? Um, how do you feel about Baldur's Gate three? It was 97? Okay. There. Let's do the homework, right? Let's see. Whoops. What did I just do? Oh, I fat fingered the stream deck. Um. Yeah, there it is. You need to get on a train. You'll be lurking. Okay. Thank you again. It was, it was really good to have you. There you go. 1997. What's that? That appeared before it showed up in Twitch. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, no way. Yo, thank you. A self paid sub, as we call it. Thank you again, Nesso. It's always good to see you. The homegrown organic non-gmo gluten-free self-paid sub thank you all by yourself you hit that button and sub to the channel i appreciate it i hope you like the emotes and the experience here yeah with squaresoft coffee yep squaresoft that's right i don't know if they were still calling themselves squaresoft at that point at one point they dropped the soft at least in branding but i think they still were squaresoft Ba -da -da -da. Events. Hello, events. Are we ready for this? Oh, I can walk. Let's do RP walk. Here we go. He's there. Sephiroth. He's there. We meet at last. January 97 for Japan, September 97 for US. That was a long uh, translation process, wasn't it? FMV time. Let's go. Cool. Did you see that? It's Sephiroth. He's here after all. I think so too, Paul. Yeah, the merger was uh, 
not too long after Final Fantasy X came out, I want to say. Oh, this is perfect. Genova's reunion and Sephiroth's incredible willpower. Where's Rufus and Scarlet? Also, Tifa needs to punch Hojo, okay? He's off. He's a very bad person, okay? He's very bad. Do you mind if I drop a bit of lore about this bit? There are no spoilers to anything that comes after this. Yes, as long as you're not spoiling anything to come, because uh, we do have people watching who have never seen or played this game. As hard as that's to believe. So yeah, if you want to talk about things that don't spoil anything after this, sure. But I'm going to see 12 was the last square game. Let's see. I don't know if it was the last, but we can at least see. Uh, this says Square Enix on it. Yeah, this was after the merger. I thought it was. Because this was like 05, 06. Yeah, the merger was like 03 or something like that. Yeah, this is Square Enix. Another one? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Never been playing this, I hear it. Yo, what's up, Ducky? Ducky. It's good to see you, man. It's been a little bit since we raided you. A couple months, right? I know uh, that gamer chick speaks highly of you. Several problems solved, all right here. Yeah. Do. You have Final Fantasy 2 for. It's 4 now, yeah. And SNES and Theater Rhythm. 2 is Squaresoft, Theater Rhythm, Square Enix. When did Theater Rhythm come out? Merger was 03. Yeah, that's what I thought. Ducky, welcome. Flaccid Rain. Some stay soft and others hard with. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. Nice raid message. <laughs> Rick. Ducky. <laughs> Thanks for the raid. How was your stream, man? How you doing? How was your stream? Hope you had a good time. Let's see. What were you doing? Oh, CV2. No kidding. What kind of playthrough? What kind of playthrough? You did an interview with Suna. Yes. Yeah, I know Suna. They've hung out here quite a few times. And we've talked quite a bit. In, in the DMs. Yes, that is right. TH40 wow. Gamer Chick has gifted a tier one sub to the rabbit ducky. Thank you, Lord, for the gift sub to the donkey. Yes, yes, Final Fantasy, yeah. They made that clear with this localization, and that was basically like what the original was trying to portray that it just didn't do a good job with it. Mm. Mm. Playing Simon's Quest. Oh, retro achievements. Okay, what's the worst achievement in CV2? Because some of those retro achievement sets are ridiculous. Like, people are spiteful or something when they made them. <laughs> Most of them are pretty fair from what I've seen, though. 2012 with the Square Enix title? Yeah, well, uh, yeah, that's like almost 10 years after the merger. Mm. Wow. Look at you. TH40 Gamer Chick has gifted a tier one sub to Theo Plays Games. Theo getting a sub too? Theo is also cool people. Good to know. Good to know. Let's see. Let's see. Good to know. TH40. That's right. That's your name. Your TH40 gamer chick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he avoided dispersion into the live stream and regrouped here. <laughs> what a fucking greaseball Hojo is. Oh my god. What are you so happy about, Hojo? Beating the game without continues. In CV2, you got a 1cc it basically. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yuck. Yuck, Ducky. That's going to be rough. Yo, what's up, Sam? Who doesn't love TH4T Gamer Chick? I know, right? Right? You know what this means, don't you? 
Cloud has the black materia. It's some. Sorry, tsunami some. Okay. <laughs> what a horrible achievement for a curse. Love it. Sephiroth will summon Meteor. Every living thing is going to die. Hojo, calm down. It's all too little, too late. We must evacuate. I trust you'll be coming with us. There are a few things I need to know. No. No, we're not going with you. Shoot him in the face. Cloud! Stop! Don't do it! Don't do it. Cloud, don't do it. It's like... I like how this is visualizing some kind of internal struggle. Cloud! No! Don't do it! He did it. He did it. Sephiroth has no lower torso. Did you see that? I know why. I can't say why. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for us to see that scene. <laughs> the high wind. Very cool airship. And there's one of the weapons. Oh boy, what have you done? Cloud. Slash Sephiroth. Slash whoever. That's diamond weapon. I don't think the one that flew away had a name unless that was Ultima. What Yo, happened? Yo, good? What? Oh, what the hell hell is it? <laughs> oh god, that would be scary. Gojira! <laughs> right? Get the frick out. This is fine. Go, go, go. Uh, yeah. ah. Tifa, uh. you good? No. What the hell is happening? Nothing good. There they are. Emerald and Ruby was there. It wasn't in the original seven. I thought it was. They just didn't have Emerald and Ruby in it. Mecha Gojira. Yeah. Sapphire weapon. It has a name. Okay. I didn't realize it had a name. You don't remember the jiggling? Yeah. Whoa, that sounds wicked. Oh, I'm turning it up. This is going to have some ambience right now for us. <laughs> Not that kind of ambience. <laughs> Cloud. <laughs> I mean, it's appropriate to what just happened, though. <laughs> Cloud. Beep beep. Get him, Tifa. You I didn't give know what me to an do. egg. I've always been like that. <sighs> Midgar ambience. Sir, is everything okay? <sighs> Anxious Hearts kicks in. I always love when this kicks in. You know it's going to be some serious lore dump whenever you hear this. Poor guy. Uh, uh. Woof, woof. Are you all right? <laughs> no ticket. Oh. Uh, uh. And this guy is sick, you know. They kept that, by the way, for this. Diva. But it was done in a way that made sense, and it was actually pretty funny. Mm -hmm. Cloud? 
That's right. I'm Cloud. It's really you. I never thought I'd find you here. I'm trying to look at him, him closely there. Yeah, it's been a while. Okay, I see it. But what's happened to you? You don't look so good. Really? Nah, I'm fine. It's cool. It is cool. It's totally cool. Just waving that sword around like that. How long has it been? Um... 69. Five years. <laughs> hey! Hey! Mondo! How's it going? How's it going? Mondo, thanks for the raid. What'd you do today? Gothic. Oh, yeah. You've been playing those. What's wrong? It's been a really long time. Actually, it had been seven years. Interesting. Where are those two years, Cloud? You're almost done, but you somehow lost the key item. Oh, God. Is that a bug? Can you fix it? You told me you made it into Soldier just like you'd hoped. But that you quit after the Sephiroth incident and were now a jack of all trades. You spoke a lot about what had happened after you left Nibelheim. But... Something was wrong. There was something strange about what you were saying. Not knowing things you should, and knowing things you shouldn't. There you go. That's a pretty key line right there. It's part of the explanation of her behavior knowing things you shouldn't and not knowing things you should but that second one that second part right there is the beginning of understanding you can fix it through console or figuring out where it went okay thanks for the raid it's always good to see you i tried to figure it out but anytime i brought it up it was like some darkness came over you you were drifting somewhere far away it scared me. This part's for all the Tifa haters. I just didn't know what to do. I needed more time. She clearly tried the thing that everyone blames her for not doing. That's why I told you about the avalanche job. You're probably off to bed pretty quick. It's far too late. That's fair. I had to be by your side to watch over you. Hmm. Oh, the live stream. I need to clean my monitor. <laughs> uh, hello? What's it doing? Well, that's not good. Did it freeze? Okay, it just took a long time. I forgot about that. I... <gasps> I'm glad I have shades on right now, and I'm sorry for the color, but this part always did this. Right. Too bright. That's yeah, right. That's <laughs> right. Hang in there. You've been out for some time. I'm hungry. Dark mode doesn't help. Ain't you gonna ask? You know, about him. This part was always really cool. I'm afraid to. Hmm. Well, don't be. I don't know what's happened to him. Uh, maybe that didn't help. Nah, no, nah, not really, Barrett. I ain't got no clue on how the others are either. I am sure they're all still alive. How long was I out? How long? Let's see now. 
Must have been about seven days. Damn, what happened to her? What about Sephiroth? Head injury? I don't know. He ain't come around yet. Remember those bright flashes at the Great Crater? Mm-hmm. Well, since then, the whole thing's been surrounded by a huge barrier of light. It's protected Sephiroth while he's asleep down there. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that barrier. And we can't do a damn thing about it, except wait till he wakes up. Forgot about that. On top of that, these big-ass monsters known as weapons have been on a rampage. Weapons? Remember them huge monsters that were with Sephiroth at the bottom of the crater? <laughs> yeah. Well, they're up here now. Supposed to be legendary beasts from the past. Cast Dispel. There you go. Yeah, that'll get rid of it. Are they protecting him too? I don't know, but they're destroying shit all over the place. <laughs> Rufus is fighting them. Hate to say it, but he's got guts. Destroying shit all over the place. <laughs> you fixed your issue and now you're off to bed. Thanks again for the raid. And congrats on fixing it. How is she not concerned? That she woke up on an operating table after seven days unconscious. Her priorities are not herself right now. They're Cloud and Sephiroth in the world. Her own well-being right now is pretty distant to all of that. It should be us out there, but we ain't got the time. Time? Uh, hey, what about Meteor? Hmm. Beep. What about Meteor? Oh, that's good. Nothing can go wrong from that. Do we have to give up? I don't know. I thought Cloud would show up to save you. Professor Hojo wanted to take a good look at him, too. Gonna need to call Bruce Willis. <laughs> you found the original F of this in Japan. How's it different? How is it different? Is it what I said? They just don't have Emerald and Ruby in it. What do you want with Cloud? Sephiroth's shadow. Now that Meteor has been summoned, he's superfluous to requirements. Requirements? Which goes for you two as well. <laughs> no, wait. There is one last thing. Mr. President, preparations for the execution are complete. Good. Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, well delivered. <laughs> I mean, that's fair, Barrett. <laughs> that's that's totally fair. Yes. You are to be executed for causing this situation. <laughs> I think back with little praise I had for this damn jackass. Well, enjoy your final moments together. I guess his gun's broken. I'll tie your arms now. Bam, 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 bam. It's full of gravy. Why does it kind of have gravy? Damn it. Let me explore. I can't explore. This is fun. Look at Oh I like all the CRT monitors and stuff. They even have flat panels on the left. <laughs> oh the Smash Tournament, there you go. Yeah. No, it'd probably been like a Unreal Tournament given the time frame. Or maybe Quake. Maybe Quake. How do I use the safe point when I can't move my arms? Huh, okay.
Okay, let's see what it did with his materia. Okay, it did just unequip all of Cloud's materia automatically. Very good. What do we have for you? Not much. I never did buy stuff for him. That's a problem. That's all right. Um, here, have a, uh, that fire armlet. That's cool. I don't remember if I'm gonna have to fight with him or not, but if I do, that's an issue. We got a ribbon? We got a ribbon. Let's see that. Just in case. I don't know what's coming. Poor Barrett. He's fine. He's fine. All right, let's go. Do, 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 do. Cannon. Thank you. That's an odd banner to have. This place looks cool. I don't think there's any loot though. Is everyone here? These are the ones who brought this madness into our world. Oh good, we're scapegoats. Who the hell are these people? We will be broadcasting your miserable deaths live on national television. Uh, Miss Scarlet, a question if I may. <laughs> Why a public execution in this day and age? Great disguise, Catchy. <laughs> Like, come on. Oh, I love it. <sighs> With all the chaos resulting from media. It's a cat in a trench coat. public support. It's better that we punish somebody. Anybody. You make me sick. <laughs> Though they might not admit it. Everyone loves this stuff. All right, we'll start with the girl. If you're gonna do it, then do me first! Camera, make sure you get this. The audience just eats up tearful goodbyes. They employ Palmer. Stop it! What are you doing? Welcome to my special gas chamber. Sit back and enjoy a slow, painful death. Is it live? I don't think it was live yet. No, but I'm not sure. Portiva. Stuck up, bitch. Jeez. She's got some inferiority issues. I often wondered if that I'll let the show begin. Guard is in on something here. <laughs> it's too convenient for that key to drop right there. It's almost as if it was deliberate. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alert, alert. Weapon attack imminent. All units, report to your position. Oh no, it's a weapon. Oh god. Run. Hey. Oh, wait, you idiots. <laughs> Damn. Just when things were getting interesting. It is about to get interesting. Miss Scarlet, what are your feelings on this latest development? <laughs> hmm. You didn't run. I'm impressed. My feelings? Well, I... Uh, <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> Sleeping gas. Whee! It's a catchy. You're busted. Oh God. Catchy with no equipment or material. <laughs> Don't worry, I got this. I got this chat. Okay. We got we got something like this. Boom. Damn, they're still not dead. Impressive. Oh man, I'm asleep. Pretty much I watched, yeah. That's basically what Catchy just did. 
Ow. All right, what else we got? I think we got bolt plumes too. Swift bolt better, Thundaga. <clears throat> well, that was weird. It was like the sound cut out. Thunder. <laughs> this was to make a lot more noise than that. Bow, bow. I'm here to rescue you. Thanks. You? Thank you, Witch Shinra. What up, Dr. Butt Lasers? I don't give capital punishment. Besides, I despise that woman. Come on, we've got to save Tifa. Okay. I'll keep a lookout. You do that. Uh, should I give Barrett materia? With Scar oh god. I should give them both materia, shouldn't I? Oh, they have shit gear! <laughs> Oh man, I don't remember exactly what Cloud had. Oh, wouldn't hurt. Man, okay. Beep. Circlet. There you go. You can have a silver M phone. Oi. No, I haven't bought anything for them, Vase. I didn't think I'd have to use them. Beep, beep, beep. It's like, can I just rely on freaking items? Here, let's just give him some stuff. Because this isn't the team I'm going to use. I'm just giving the essentials here. Um, What do you need? Nothing really. Just a couple summons. Because I can spam throwing items too. Bam, bam. All right, let's go. That's good enough. Mod, fix an issue you had. You do this fight with Barrett and Catchy. It doesn't make sense. Like Barrett's hands are tied for the battle. Untied battle and tied after. Yeah, HQ exactly. Just bare minimum. Yeah, E skill can cover a lot of bases by itself, couldn't it? Ooh, I've already pushed the button. Can we just shoot her? Just, just, just shoot her! Just pull one in her head! Oh, cool. It won't open. He moved the direction I was pushing. I Dagar, you suck. It's a weapon. Mm -hmm. There have been so many attacks lately. Can we handle it? We'll manage somehow. Permission to engage the enemy. No need to ask. Let's see how it likes the taste of our great cannon. <clears throat> Open all gun ports. Set the main cannon to target weapon. Cool. Let's go. This part's dope. Let's see how the music is. Oh, it's still playing the other song. Okay. Our counter kaiju cannon. Oh my God. No, no ads. Hopefully I can pause. <laughs> Bye Lord. Preparations complete. Okay, good. Okay. Ads are going to start in like a minute and a half. We're going to wait here because there's a lot of FMVs coming up that I won't be able to pause. Okay. Okay. There's a lot of FMVs coming up. I won't be able to pause, so I just want to wait right here because this whole sequence is super cool. We want to do it uninterrupted. Uninterrupted. Bum, 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 bum. 
uninterrupted um i'm getting more water so let me do that okay let's get up let's stretch let's tinkle uh wipe your butt um you know pet a cat they're considerate enough to add shielding for the sea facing residential in the highest levels time to take a piss from what i know about junin the whole town is facing the ocean but i don't know for sure no nah, no nah, i'm not doing that you can do that andrew that's all you bud okay you can drain one for the rest of us <laughs> We didn't answer the question of the night. How do you feel about streams? If you haven't answered, streams that have 100% no backseating. Some really great answers earlier. Really good answers. Really good. They were very good. And you're formative. Many informations. Know what I mean? Well, let's see, one minute left on the ends. The poke game's down? You want me to fix it? Yeah, that, it's a, it always goes down. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Billimus did a poke lure and it didn't work, huh? Okay. I got you, Billimus. Alright. Uh oh. It's disconnecting. That's not good. Uh, it might be down, down. Now, super lure wouldn't work until I'm fully connected. Let's see. Uh oh, yeah, it's, it's not a crash issue this time. Like it's yeah, no, I'm sorry, Bill miss. Um, Whenever it gets fixed, remind me that we owe you a Pokemon, okay? <laughs> okay? Because we have that just to auto use points. Uh, okay, ads are done. Are we ready for this? 100% no backseating rocks. A lot of weirdos show up at narrative heavy first plays and feel the need to show their dedication to a franchise by backseating to a certain dominance or whatever they're trying to do. Fair. Yeah. <laughs> out of the sea cool sound effects Splish. 
Kaboom! <laughs> How would you still have air drums if he were that close to that thing? Did we get it? Seems so. Did we? Seems so. Weapon approaching! Oh, oh, not. Run for us! They're coming! Run for it! Can't be. That was a direct hit! What about the cannon? It'll take time to reload! Good. Then use regular firepower in the meantime. <clears throat> yes, sir! Target the weapon! Don't let it ashore! Cool. That is a lot of firepower. Speed! 79! Oh, no it? use! Collision is imminent! <laughs> The panic. Oh, yes, sir. 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 <laughs> what are you doing with those? That thing is as big as a city. Doink. Shinra penitents <laughs> are not worth it. Boy, Shinra. Giant blade oh, beats. <laughs> Oh, that was funny. <sighs> Barret! Help! Hold the brick. Hang on just a little longer. Ugh, easy for you to say. I can't hold it forever. Do -do. Shit! Give me the key! I've already pushed the button. Can we shoot her in the face? That'd be pretty cool, actually. I guess the chamber must be locked from somewhere else. There's nothing we can do. Time for a change of plan. Let's get out of here first. Tifa, I'll save you. I promise. It's cool. Look at up there. You can see the gas chamber. I know that big screen too, or the nine screens, I should say. It's kind of cool. Damn, this one's locked now too. Damn it! You stupid fool! Now you'll never save her. Ah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Scarlet! All right, sorry. God damn it! Sorry, sorry. Another change of plan. We're running to the airport. Airport. The airport? And just leave Tifa behind? It's okay. It's okay. We've got to take a chance. Mm -hmm. All right, catchy. Got the wrong way. Where are you going? The airport's the other way. Does anyone know where they're going these days? <laughs> what are you trying to say? <laughs> Jesus. All right, we'll go this way. Oh, safe point. <laughs> what a dick. <laughs> do, 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 do. I do believe. Um, there may be a rare steel frick, really somewhere like this. I think it's this guy. Actually, I don't have steel though. I do have Comet. 
Does anyone remember what you steal from the soldiers in this sequence? You think you can take me on? They beefy. Sword of Doom, huh? -na 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 -na. Oh, you've really done it now. <laughs> that wasn't great. Come it! No, stop dooming me! The skies are raining. There you go. It's just remedies. All right. Where are you going? I thought there was a rare steal during this sequence somewhere. It must not be those then. Might be some kind of armor. I'm vaguely recalling an armor steal. Oh, I'm up there. Barrett, a limit break. Here, frog song him. Tell me what flies taste like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit. That was a pretty funny clapback. <laughs> uh, turn him into a frog. This is the first class version? Is that during this? That's during this, isn't it? Uh let's do trying. Just you wait. This is gonna be good. This thing's like harmless now, so we'll just melee it down. Oh, he's melee. I thought he used a megaphone. Kitty, you're in the way. Move. Don't get in my way, kitten. Third class in Midgar, second class here, first class later. It is first class. That's the best, right? Those guys don't talk. Okay. They show up later. Okay. So not in this sequence. Got it. Time to meet your maker. What are you doing, kitty cat? What are you doing? Tell me what flies taste like. <laughs> kitty. What are you doing, kitty? I'm watching you, kitty. Dun, 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 dun. to interrupt at such a busy time, but if I could just get a quick interview. Hey, shut your trap. Ah, my ears. <laughs> <laughs> Not so loud. It's me. It's me. Yuffie. <laughs> the hell are you doing here? been there i've been there <laughs> that feeling when watching a streamer who doesn't I'll have their audio later. balanced we've got to hurry to the airport all right yuffie's in the crew now all right yuffie oh yeah yeah what a squad what a motley crew this is <laughs> Um, yeah, yeah, no, we're good. We don't need to do anything. Let's go. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, is this the way I need to go? What happens if I go in the barracks? No, I'll come back. It won't let me. I wanted to go in the barracks. Oh, well. 
Preemptive attack. Bye. We're good. Look, it won't let me push it back down. Oh, I was going to go in the barracks. I don't know if there's like treasure or like cutscene in there or not. Sometimes you find stuff like that. Garnica and high wind. Go for style. Wow. What the hell is that thing? Roulette cannon. Oh, that seems nice. I'm sure nothing could go wrong here. Um, probably doesn't like lightning <clears throat> or comets. Oh, it really doesn't like lightning. Holy smokes. I'm trying to think who we're going to use coming up after this. Nanaki. Maybe Sid. You sure this is the right way? Looks like a dead end. Neither Barrett or Vincent. I don't know. Huh? Did I make a wrong turn? A wrong turn? You idiot! What the hell are we supposed to do now? They'll be stomping on us at any minute. Watch my back to the very end, partner. Oh boy. Relax. Relax. Move your arms, Move feet, arms, feet, feet head, 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 whatever you whatever can to you can escape the chair. chair. Why is she hearing clown? Uh, okay. Legs. Legs. Okay, double legs. Legs. Not legs. Oh, okay. Now legs. Head and then legs. No, Tifa, come on. Calm down. Don't keep repeating yourself. Try combining two movements at once. Oh, that's right. Legs and head at the same time. Nope. Okay, now we'll do head and left arm. Left arm, right arm. Which button stops the gas? Um. There you go. Such a cool track. Never tried lightning on that one, Elsinia. Usually, it's a safe bet in uh, games like this. If it's a r machine in an RPG, it probably doesn't like electricity. Sometimes water as well, but usually just electricity. Yeah. Open, damn it. This part, well, you'll see. It used to have a face, but not anymore. That thing is so disappointing. Oh my God, Vase, you got auto modded. <laughs> what the hell was that? Hey, open up. Do, 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 do. Fourth or fifth JRPG you'd ever played, Zero Clueless. Ah, okay. Yeah. First you lock me in this crazy place and now you want me to come out? Make up your mind. Right? Tifa. Well listen. She's out. Bum 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 bum. Took a lot to put him down. Yeah. I'm more laughing at the fact that that laser it did that looked amazing just put basically a little scratch on the building. <laughs> like it didn't do anything. Oh god, Tifa. Ow! She'd be dead. But you know, Tifa. 
There's a lot less gravity on this planet. That's why they fly in the movie. God, I hated that part. <laughs> It's cool that this is like all fleshed out, even though you, there's never really any reason to see it. Airbags. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. It's a long way to go. Sister Ray. Doom, do, 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 do. Quality construction. Maybe that's it, Vaeus. What a cool scene. Our little game of tag ends here. How did you catch up? The gas chamber might have failed, but watching you slam into the water below could still prove quite exquisite. You too. Don't you think so? Listen, listen. How many times I gotta say it? There are people watching who have never seen this. Don't. Spoil shit. <laughs> Don't spoil shit. Also, how the hell did she keep up with Tifa and heels? Okay. Stuck up to the end. You got excited? I get it. I'm excited too. You can say it once it starts. <laughs> Let's go. Take now you pay. How do you like it? <laughs> Ugh, quit it. Shut up. <laughs> I can't stand it. <laughs> it's so dumb. <sighs> Don't just stand there. Grab her. Oh boy. Come back here. <laughs> Let's end this. Come quietly, or I'll drop you. <laughs> Run! Who said that? Sound like Barrett. Run to the end of the cannon! Okay. Yeah, she did, Mark. Yeah. Right, Slappy? Yeah. <laughs> Go! Go, go! I'm at the end! Over here. I won't let me go further! <laughs> Grab onto the rope. Okay, let's do it. Don't just stand there. Oh, autopilot. No. Oh, you missed! You fucked up! Oh god, she's gonna die! Oh, it's, it's fine. Everything's good. We're good. It's cool. Debated. You killed her! I, you know. <laughs> uh, sacrifices. You know? Oh, never mind. Yeah, exactly. Rope burn? Pfft. She wouldn't have any skin left on her hands. You okay? She's been better. My cheeks hurt a little. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. But never mind that. What's all this about? <laughs> the details can wait a wee while. Till the time's right. I don't think they're full gloves, Paul. They're just wraps with either claws or some kind of metal on like a pad on the back of her hand. I think she's bare knuckle. Monks of Featherfall, after all? Touche. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Dark Stories Anthology that would have been a reaction you had to make, which would decide if Tifa caught the rope and lived or not. Interesting. Yeah, fingerless. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, as far as I know, she just has wraps across her palm that holds the the handguard on it and the handguard either has claws or like you know knuckles or spikes or whatever the weapon is so she's mostly barehanded your hands have 36 percent through normal skin cover but no biggie yikes that sucks her 
palms are covered. That's it. Yeah, as far as I know. Most of them are either leather gloves, metal knuckles, or claws. Right. At any rate, the airship high wind is now yours. Yours. Final? Yes, HQ, exactly. I mean, generally speaking, she just bare knuckle punches everything or kicks it. <laughs> I forgot about this. Oh God, I gotta hear this. I gotta hear this. <laughs> she gets motion sick on everything. <laughs> Glad you're okay. Thanks. I'll be staying here a while longer. <laughs> uh, doesn't matter if it's sea or sky. I just can't handle ships. Poor Yuffie. It's a good flaw. It's a good character flaw for story. Makes him seem more real. Do -do -do -do. Yo, we finally got the high wind. How cool is that? Love it. Mm -hmm. I always liked the this game and uh, six and sort of five. Excuse me. Let you explore your transportation. I really like that when RPGs you do dare. that. Why did you tell me we had an airship? I thought Tifu was gone for sure. Du, 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 du. Oh yeah, Andrew. Tifa would probably knock Scarlet out in a hit. Or break her jaw if she aimed for that. Ah, sorry about that, lad. But I had to do something to fool the enemy. Come on, everyone's waiting. Everyone? Everyone? Everyone's here? I mean, with how fast they're moving, Paul, and how high they are, it would just disperse. Like, it would just be so atomized by the time I got anywhere near the ground that you wouldn't even notice it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Please speak with Captain Sid first. Captain Sid. He got his wings back. This looks really nice with the upscale. <clears throat> I like it. I always wanted as a kid this machine to do something. I don't know why. I just always wanted it to do something. Do, 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 do. Ba -na -ba 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 -ba. Welcome aboard my airship. The high wind. High wind. His VO is so good. I, I, I'm so happy with it. <laughs> I'm so happy with it. <laughs> uh, he gets a fax from Stars HQ. Oh my God, Stars. Dun dun dun. No, I don't think Scarlet would go to the gym. No. <laughs> hearts, nice. <laughs> nice hearts. Someday I'll play the remake. Yeah, I don't know if you've uh, played any of the uh, mods. Um, but if anyone's interested, this website has info about the voice mo voiceover mod. And it has a video tutorial on how to set it up. And then this link here, the mods command, has all the mods I'm using. And the load order if you want to do the same. Yeah, no, Slappy. Scarlet would not go to a gym. She would have one in her mansion. What's wrong? <laughs> you should be more excited than that. You don't understand. She would not waste her time around other plebs. She would have one in her mansion. Sid. Oh. Yeah. Also, welcome, hearts. Scarlet would probably sit on your back while you do push-ups, though. Probably, yeah. She has that vibe. We're 
short on crew. Mm. Indeed. Well, uh, life sure is full of ups and downs. <laughs> uh huh. Tifa, I'll be giving you all sorts of stuff on Shinra. Ask me if there's anything you want to know. She strikes you as the type of the personal trainer for cardio, not so much the type to train for fighting. Yeah. And not because she wants to be healthy, but because she thinks looking healthy gives her more power. That's the only reason she would do it. Don't worry, we're just fine being in the background. <laughs> hey, you! What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, uh, whenever anyone talks to me, I get all nervous and mess things up. Hey, you! What the hell are you doing? <clears throat> oh, I'm glad to see you're safe, Tifa. Right, turn it down just a little bit. That ambient audio is a little noisy. Let's get a little more oomph on the music. She does have that vibe, Paul. Yeah. So, we need Cloud for this. We can't save the planet without him. Meteor is coming. The weapons are on a rampage. Right now, I don't know what to do. I just don't know. Get a grip, Tifa. Excuse me. I like turtles. What up, Celestial Knight? We'll think this through together. Remember, there ain't no getting off this train we own. If Cloud were here, it'd feel like everything was going to work out. He'd stand in that cheeky way he always did and tell me, it'll be all right, Tifa. He would do that, yeah. Hey, when'd you become so weak? Shut up, Barrett. Sorry, Barrett. I'm a little surprised myself and disappointed. Yeah, but Tifa, remember what he said back in the crater. I know. That's why I have to see him again. I want to be sure. <laughs> nice. Shrug, huh? Please don't be sad, Tifa. I'm glad to see. Okay, he says the same thing. What does Barrett say? You can't go on thinking it's hopeless without Cloud. We did fine without him in the beginning. Mm -hmm. Turtles kid was in the latest TMNT movie. Oh my God. That's wonderful. <laughs> right. And what happened to that tough girl I used to know? Where'd she go, huh? What do you got, Catchy? Tifa, I'll be giving you all so- Ask me if there's it. Okay, tell me. Tifa. Ask me if Okay, he's not telling me yet. What do you got for us, Sid? Well, I sure didn't hate the guy. <laughs> Imagine going to someone's funeral and saying that. <laughs> uh, yeah, thanks, Sid. Yeah, that's, that, that helps. <laughs> Gotta admit, though, I thought he was a bit of a wacko. Oh, God, he just keeps digging. <laughs> <laughs> he just keeps going. <sighs> just when you thought he was cool, he'd go and do something real boneheaded. He's right, though. <laughs> and he came across like he was so clued up about stuff, but then he'd not know how to do the most obvious of things. Yeah, yeah. It's a good eulogy. Something about the way he moved and spoke just didn't sit right with me. Thinking about it now? Yeah, it all makes sense. Well, as long as he's still alive, you'll get to see him again someday. So cheer up, sis. Yeah, I will. As soon as we find out where his spiky ass is at, <laughs> the highway will have us there to Jiffy. His spiky ass. Maybe when... The ground collapsed deep inside the great crater. Cloud Anaki. was pulled even further below. He's right, though. 
further below. You mean to the live stream? I think he's right anyway. Well, we'll find out. The live stream passes just under the seabed and occasionally gushes out to the surface. Okay. I've heard stories about a place where this happens. There is a clue. A maybe, just maybe, clouds. A little bit of a conveyance there. Please. As soon as we find out where his spiky ass is at, the highway will have us there to Jiffy. Catchy. What do you got? Tifa, I'll be get Ask me if there's. I want to know where that gushy place is. You can't go on thinking it's hopeless without. We did fine, right? Okay. You. <laughs> Captain Soon. I like how this guy like levels up. Sorry, sis. I gotta teach this moron how to land. <laughs> Come on. It'll be over soon. Uh. Have you seen a blonde guy with a spiky ass? Yeah, right. Oh, and sis, whatever the plan, you gotta be ready, right? Right. Go to the operations room and start making preparations. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. An NPC gives you a clue on where to go. Okay. Chocobo. Hello. I have my hands full right now. I do apologize. Yes, sir. Never mind. Let's have a chat. Um, uh, what shall we talk about? I know. I can tell you about our mutiny. Yes. Huh? Huh? <laughs> yep. Heidegger worked the Highwind crew hard each and every day. Okay. Whenever he got yelled at by the president, he'd immediately take it out on the crew. We had to just put up with it. No matter how often he beat us. What an awful work dynamic they had. Those poor people. I've been worked so hard You're to get onto the high wind. We couldn't just leave. And everything all right? Then, well, it must have been about seven days ago. We were ordered to the great creator of the north. Okay. Everyone boarded the high wind with Scarlet and the president. Among them was the legendary pilot Sid. Mr. Sid was looking around the ship. Filled with nostalgia. He even gave us the honor of his company. He was unbelievable. Such an inspiration. What we'd heard about him was all true. He has a heart burning with passion. Oh, they were inspired by Sid. You love to see it. Nothing worse than working in a place where you feel like a hostage. Right. This, what this guy's talking about is probably relatable to a lot of people. Albeit not as extreme, but... Or hopefully not. Mr. Sid said that the high wind would make the trip a whole lot easier. Who would have thought it was a trip to save the planet? I'm so deeply moved by all this. So anyway, we decided to help. When we arrived in Junon from the Great Crater, I ran around screaming, fire, fire! <laughs> in the middle of all the commotion, we stole the ship from Shinra with Mr. Sid's help. Nice. And that's the story of our mutiny. It wasn't that underhanded when you consider what our superiors got up to. I tend to agree with him here. <laughs> Given what he had to deal with, is it really a mutiny? I mean, it is, right? Technically. But I don't think anyone can blame this guy. Want to hear about the mutiny? Uh, uh, yeah, I love that. How he did that. He's like, eh, eh. <laughs> You and Bear were captured by Heidegger. We had to wait a week for a chance to rescue you. That's why, Miss Tifa, I'm so happy the mission was successful and we could see each other again. And thank you so much for taking the time to listen to my rather long story. It was a good story, though. I have my hands full right. Never mind. What are. Uh, uh, I know. Okay. This is where your chocobo, you can stable your chocobo. Do you have one? Oh, I'm so lonely. Please bring a chocobo on board. I always like that you could transport your chocobo in this game. <laughs> I will do eventually. Oh dear. Oh dear. I'm be waiting forever. Where's the safe point? I thought this airship had one. 
Hello, Miss Tifa. Hello. Ah, okay. Squad. Oh, let's use Sid. Let's give him a shot. Oh, Sid. We got this Dragoon Lance. Got the Javelin. It's got double growth. Wow, that's actually really nice. That is really nice. Yo, Nico. What up, bud? You finished getting breakfast and coffee ready earlier than expected. You weren't sure if your was going to be on. Is Crit still in mornings? You know when he's swapping over? Is that like the military? I'm sorry to hear that. Obi Cloud Kenobi. <sighs> you ruined your joke. Ah, rip. Try it again. We'll pretend like we didn't see it the first time. All right. Do it again. <laughs> Your I, orders? My orders. Oh, he is the save point. All right. Um. Actually, I need to put them in here to take their gear. Yeah, give me that. Here, have that. Bum 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 bum. Hello. You were ordered. PHS. Sid and the Nucky. All right, so as far as materia goes, we only got to worry about what's missing here. Oh, no, I had the rune armlet. That's right for double growth. Do help me, Obi Cloud Kenobi. You're my favorite deputy. That is so funny. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Do do do. Drains poison attacks. Protect against poison. Now power wrist. All right, Sid, I, you know, you're, you're cloud now, I guess. So <laughs> there's a circlet and cloud of the dragoon armlet. He had a better weapon than this. I could do dragoon lance, but this is double growth. This says double, double growth. How am I doing? My throat hurts. Kind of it doesn't really hurt. It's just really dry. It makes me sound bad. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Bop, 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 bop. Actually, I did that the long way. This is quicker. Just click the name. Oh, I thought you could click the name and it would just unequip all. Wait, wait, wait. Damn, it doesn't work. Okay. Well, never mind. I'm stupid. Your voice has been nothing but warbling because dry. Dude, it's just new meds I'm on. Or stronger meds, I should say. Really dries me out. Gotta do something about it. All right, we had Bahamut with HP Absorb, I think. Or no, it was Neo Bahamut with HP Absorb. Bah! Uh, where is it? There it is. We had magic plus. Well, let's get the important stuff. Restore all, right? Comment with MP absorb. Um, we had Alexander, lightning. We don't get care about magic plus. Enemy skills required. Bahamut could stay there for now. We want revive. So we have Alexander, Neo Bahamut. That's good. Okay. So that was a pretty basic swap. Easy peasy. Du, 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 du. We wanted to go watch fireworks, but it's raining all morning. We had some wild storms in Chicago last night. Some places got flooded pretty bad, I guess, like flash floods. Okay, everything looks good here to me. Everything's honky dory. We'll have to get a better weapon for Sid. Hello, Miss Tifa. Your orders? Hello. Ding. Hello, Miss. Your order? My orders. It's been like a million years since we've been able to save. That was a hell of a sequence. 
or, or 35 minutes. That's, you know, almost a million years. That's close to a million years. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, you know, sorry, sorry. Bow, bow, bow. Oh, I rotate saves. You can have a lot of saves in this. I think 100. I just use 10. I use 10 and people have been like, what are you doing? Why do you do that? It's because bugs happen. Sometimes saves get bricked. You know, I've learned that lesson too many times. I don't take chances. Shinra aren't up to much at the minute. Fair enough. Did you so now's the time to look for a cloud. I wonder where he could be. You didn't think he's too many times, Mark. Yeah, a lot of us have learned that lesson the hard way, haven't we? Especially new games, new PC games. You know, it's very important. I don't even rotate saves on new PC games. I'm on, I'll be honest with you. I just make a new save every time. I just pretend like I have infinite file storage. <laughs> Shinra aren't up to much at the minute. So no wonder he... Okay. Don't worry. Hey, you! What the hell are you doing? What in the hell are you doing? Ah, uh, you know. I'm uh, distracting the crew. Whenever I think of cloud, I just don't get it. You stagger saves pretty often too, so you get it. Yeah. You have a favorite sticker. And what embarrassing trapper keeper did you own? I will be honest, as a kid, I never liked stickers. And I didn't have a trapper keeper. <laughs> uh, my family is too poor for those things. I can't believe that Shinra or Hojo have the power to create human beings. And it's cause of him that media's on its way. It's true. To tell you the truth, if I did meet him again, I don't have a clue what I'd say. Mm -hmm. Dead cells would wipe your save if your PC lost internet connectivity with Steam. Oh! Oh, that sucks, HQ. Hopefully they fix that. Whenever I think I can't believe it, it's cool to tell you the talk to the crew. There should be a small island near to the live stream. Go ahead. They say it sometimes gushes out unexpectedly to the south. Nanaki, you have saved the day. My father used to tell me about it when I was very little, so I don't remember much else. Hi, Matthews. Good morning. The design on the trapper keeper thing. Right. Yeah, I know what you're saying. A lot of people like to design them. Dude, thank you. Look. I'm sorry, Thanks, Tifa. man. Almost four years now. Love and hate are both equals and opposites. Too much love will kill you in the end. <sighs> love and hate too much. Fuck, Vincent. You are damaged, my dude. <laughs> that poor guy. Huh, that one didn't get voiced. We found one that didn't get voiced. That's only the second time that's happened. Yeah. Ooh, are we leaving? <laughs> yeah, go. Yeah, we're off. Let's go. I was hoping we'd get the uplifting music. I think we get it after a certain story point. This is the first time we have an airship chat. How awesome is this? We have rain to explore the almost the whole game world now. I love when RPGs do this and they have a world map. I miss world maps. I wonder if Sea of Stars is going to have a world map. What do you think, chat? I think it does from what I've seen from trailers. Who's going to watch me stream that? I've been waiting for that game for years. I've never shut up about it. I want people to watch me stream it because I'm streaming it. I'm getting a key the day it comes out and then apparently physical releases will come after and I'll show those off when I get those. You're going to watch me stream it? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I am 
so fucking excited for that game. It's like the game I've been waiting for for years. Do, 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 do. I don't think I've ever anticipated a game on this channel as long as that one. It's such a fantastic feeling when you finally get the airship in this. Yes, you will watch. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, thanks. It's nice to hear. Where's the, um... Where is it? Who knows what I'm talking about? Where are you at? There it is. Let's pay a visit. Do, 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 do. What game? Sea of Stars. Coming out, uh... Less than two weeks. 29th, I think it is. 11 days. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Green Choco. You just gave me a free enemy skill. What a nice bird. You subbed in the Kickstarter for that? Same. I bought a... Well, not the Kickstarter. It was their backer it or whatever, which was like after the Kickstarter. Because I wanted a physical Switch version of it. So that'll come out eventually, but I'm getting a key for it for Steam, I want to say. The day of. Oh, what is this? Someone came all the way out here? How many years has it been? I can't remember for the life of me. <laughs> do, 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 do. Who are you? Who indeed? Me. I am... Um, no. Who was I? Who the? What? Oops. You don't know who you are? Been a while since I gave it any thought. <laughs> <laughs> what was it they used to call me? What it did? Ah, yes. They called me the Chocobo Sage. <laughs> right, that was it. That the was Chocobo it. Sage. I like this guy's voice. It's cool. That was it. <laughs> Who could forget that? I uh, yeah, that's that's an excellent point, Tifa. <laughs> so, what can I do for you? Sell me. Some. What's that chocobo? Oh, that? Well, that's. Let's see. I don't quite remember. <laughs> What can I do for you? This guy's great. Well, let's see. I don't quite remember. He doesn't remember. So, sell me something. What you got? Nuts and greens for chocobo breeding and raising. Different greens uh, boost different stats. Do you have a Tella syndrome? Something like that, right? I like that it plays the Chocobo theme too. It's cool. 